Is of call Oh, Chad, I gotta reset the timer. One sec. Bing bong. Oh, chat. I am fragile right now. I am very fragile. Very, very fragile. You are not getting a high energy stream, by the way. This is. I'm here to RP till I need to RP, and then I'm going to. Fuck off. Uh, things I, the things I do, chat. I got commitments, bro. Jenny, thanks for tier one. You good? No, I'm just hungover. I'm really fucking hungover. I'm, yeah, I'm cooked. Oh, uh, let's get straight into a chat. Awesome. Cool. Um, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed today's stream. Uh, it's been awesome. Uh, uh, you all have a good night, all right? I'm uh, in the bed. I think that's enough calling for today. Uh, night, everyone. Have a, have a great day. Have a great uh I think we're playing R6 today, guys. <laughs> oh, I need to call Nancy. And it's fucking raining. It's raining. Is it about to get all foggy and gray? You're fucking having a laugh. Where the fuck have you been? Uh, thinking. Are you okay? I saw those texts. You aren't hurt or anything. Are no. you okay? I, uh, I mean, Keith Kyle shot me. What? Multiple times. What? Yes, that's what I said in the text message. Keith got to murder me. I was in the hospital. Why the fuck did Keith Kyle try to kill you? That's uh, a long story. I'll have to tell you in person. Okay, um, I'm. You're safe? Yeah, I'm safe. Can't just can leave. Especially the last thing I hear from you is, "Oh yeah, I made a deal. I'm gonna go think about it." And then you fuck off. You know how I've been thinking Norman had you this whole time. Oh, I told you. I just need time to think. Yeah, usually you don't go MIA for two days. Good point. But I'm here. I'm okay. Are you okay? Yeah. Well, I'm worried. Where are you? I'm with the Billy. Where are you? Driving to the Billy. Okay, I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. -bye. Right. Hello. Hey, Cap. You sound sad. What's up? I'm just uh, tired. Everything alright? Just peachy, Cap. Everything's great. I don't know that word, but okay. How's that? I will Google it so you can spare the time of explaining it to me. 
What word? Peachy. Oh, peachy. Oh, it's like, uh, you know, like a, a peach, the fruit. Satisfactory. Yeah, to say everything's peachy, everything's, you know, great. Oh, okay. So good. Anything, have I missed anything in the past day or two? I haven't been around for the past four days. Oh, shit. You know, as much yeah, as I do, I guess. All right, I gotta run some errands and shit, and I'll be back, okay? All right, man. Who's a, uh, who's awake? I'm just chilling with Antonio. He's uh, just in the in the in the magic room. Ah, gotcha. Right, right, right. Oh. Why? What the? F That's alarming. Gold's not there. There's a new charity tab on Twitch. Oh, you can instantly create a fundraiser. Look at that. That's neat. I, 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 I miss you. I, I miss you, Colin. I don't think you heard me the first time. Oh, I didn't. I miss you too, buddy. Oh, you did? Yeah. Um, How you feeling? Like a bag of dicks. I'm hungover shit. Shit. I'm so fucked right now, but I'm here. You need I'm some awake. food? Yes. Hey, well. Uh, anything I've missed in the past day or so? Um, well... Uh, gotta give Nancy a call. She's worried about you. I, I just she called she's coming out here. Appreciate you. Okay, yeah. And she has to show you some stuff that I saw earlier, and I nearly died laughing. Okay. So, I, I want to come with you and see your reaction, though. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's great. Um, apart from that, yesterday, nothing was really happening. Barry was talking to TJ for, like, a few hours. I don't want to sleep because there was nothing else to do, so... I don't know what happened yesterday, really. Okay. Sounds yeah. like it was just a normal day then. Yep, just a normal day. Just a normal thing day. Chad, how are you all doing? Normal day. Oh, apparently something's happening with Finn. I don't know if um, HOA actually managed to blow up PDM. That's what I need to go check. Um, I don't know if they actually held the meeting yet, so we gotta figure out. And if Edbert's bitching about working. Was my reaction phasing up? Yeah, what? Colin didn't bitch and moan when he when we went and killed fucking Hayes and boys. Yeah, he was annoyed about it, but the club comes first. Mm. That's a good scout. Thanks for playing. Have a bowl of ramen coming, chat. Uh, I don't know if you know, but now laptops are 15k basically, so. And mine yeah. broke. Awesome. If you have a break one, I'll take it because I think I can repair mine. There you go. Thank you.
Yeah, fuck it. Fuck PDM, bro. Plus, look at it this way, chat. Benson's back alley motor is up good. You guys want to read Finn's text chat? Who the f*** is that? Yes. The thing is, Finn's right. Bro, that shit looks that shit looks really bad for him. It was agreed that they're fucking over MCs and now you're basically like, I don't agree with this, give me my job back. I had to watch Baza yesterday because he... That's funny. Oh. Oh, man! Watch yourself, dude. What the fuck, Keith Kyle? Why the fuck you shoot Nancy, you stupid motherfucker? <laughs> Kate's the best daycare ever. Yeah, I think Kate treats BBMC viewers better than BBMC streamers. Who the fuck is down here? And testify. <laughs> oh, chat, let me guess. Hey, love. I'm here. You're running away. Oh, sorry. I'm, um, I'm wondering whose car this is. I think someone's down here gold panning or some shit. Uh, I'm coming back. Okay. Shit out of Kyle. Good. Oh, it can't. Well, apparently, apparently, that there's something hilarious. Right over there, multiple times, and called his friends, and they all shot me in the back too. What a fucking cunt. And all the okay. cops showed up. What? Yeah. Come on, like, <laughs> why did he start shooting? I'll explain in a minute. Um. There's a lot to catch up on. Can't be that much. It was just one day. Mm-hmm. Just a normal day. I was told Antonio said to me yesterday nothing happened. Nothing happened yesterday, right. apparently. Right, right. You telling me Antonio was lying? Right, right, right. It's been two days, McKinley. One and a half. Right. Sorry, uh, Go talk somewhere. Worry. Yeah. Yeah, you made me fucking worry. Uh, let's um, head down the beach. I'm just gonna talk to Nancy for a sec, right?
Woke up this morning with a crow on my doorstep. Oh, fuck off. And then again at the Cerberus Industries storefront. It's that one with the red eyes you were telling me about. Yeah, it's Norman's little pal. Giga Crow. Yeah. That's the cunt that robbed me. It's the one who gave me a feather this morning. Gave you a feather? Yeah. Dropped it outside my house and flew away. Don't like that. I do. I know. This involves Norman, that's why I don't like it. Oh, there's more. Oh, uh, I didn't doubt that. Alright, where to start? Well, you went to bed. Or you went for your drive, rather. Uh, I guess Barry went and met with Norman. Mm -hmm. Went up to the lighthouse. Had a conversation with Norman. Same thing happened to you. He ended up in the um, in the ICU. Hello. Bundy oh, yeah, and um, Pez and Cleo and Demi and Lennon drove him down. Wait, Pez. I've... Okay, the Bundy bunch got okay. The Bundy bunch. I found out because Pez called me and said. I basically, the boys wouldn't pick up, so that's why I called you. Not that he tried, but he just figured none of you guys would answer. So. Sorry. Called me. Uh, Junior and Antonio showed up and Hubcap. Bundy came over to me in the hospital and said, Hey, Nancy, would you believe something like the god of death doesn't like being called a cunt? <laughs> and then basically walked away so they obviously know what's going on and who he is and everything like that okay I'm not surprised by that at all nope. Norman pretty much told me he was like I gotta speak to the neighbors so. oh okay that makes sense then um Pez and I talked I basically just said thank you for calling he said, we need more people on the good side against this guy. Not necessarily banding together, but we need more on the living side than the dead side. Uh, the good guys. The good guys. Um... Then I got a text. Got a text from Norman. Okay. What does he want to meet up for brunch or? No, he said, uh, Jeffrey should deliver you something tomorrow. I do hope you heed the message. Bundy. Bundy. And I said, understood. Also, I hear you're a fan of smoking. If you ever need a pack, my store sells them. I'm sure you know where it is already. I was just trying to get in some marketing yeah, with for, an avid yeah, smoker. That's good. Plus, yeah, that's I think and then, then he'd be like, yeah, I go there to pick up cigarettes. And then he's speaking to like the god of nature. And she's like, you know, I've been meaning to pick up smoking. And then she's, yes. Yeah, so. I figured, you know be a good pyramid scheme and then he left me on red and i hit him with a k ouch yeah so <laughs> oh my god you k'd the god of death yeah, that's badass i, I k'd norman bones um anyways and then tj called me and tj seems very uh not okay uh Giga nancy he was asking TJ knows about me and he was like can you bring someone back can you do this and that you have to find a way Nancy and I was like I don't know that I have 
the ability to. And he's like, well, you don't know if you don't try. And it's like, TJ, it's always been a one-way street. And he's like, Nancy, it needs to be a two-way street. So I've been doing research and seeing what I can do. He okay, seemed okay. very, uh... Yeah, and Tony told me that Barry and him apparently spoke for like three hours yesterday. Jesus Christ. So, one of those conversations. is very um, much like, we're not working with this guy, like... Yeah, I don't have a great feeling about that. Is that Norman back there? Um... You might not believe this part, but hey, if you believe everything oh. so far, maybe you'll be open to this. No, 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 this this part's not terrible. No, no. Turn around. Oh, did you just get a text? What am I looking at? Norman's by the spray over there. Oh. Walking away. Up, buddy hey pal anyways um i went and i saw cass the supernatural where's that ziggy emote real can, can you just hold on for, for just one second yeah 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 fuck off norman I just bricked my fucking pants. There was a crow on my deck. Well, that's cute. Yeah. You just dab. Oh, for fuck's sake. Bundy's calling. Hello, Bundy. Oh, mm. hey, what the hell? We do. I am in the middle of a different conversation right now. Can I call you after this? I understand your conversation is quite pressing, but so is this one. So let me, let me get back to you very shortly. Oh my Alrighty. god. Appreciate you. Okay, where's... Okay. Okay, so where were we? Went and saw Cass. Supernatural lady. Yeah, the stuttery lady, right? Yeah. And talked to her. Obviously no details, no mention of D or anything like that. Asking a lot of very vague questions. Um, mm, ramen. And I, I had her do a tarot reading for me. And I realized partway through that the tarot reading wasn't actually for me; it was for Dundee. What? Every every single card that she pulled. Okay, pause. And explained. Yeah. What's a tarot reading? Okay, so it's someone like Cass who has forgot your old somebody hurtful. Somebody 
No, well, I, I love you. Somebody like Cass, who has <laughs> like a deck of cards and like energy is put into the cards and then they pull the cards and it like reads what is happening with the energy given to it. So like, like Texas hold them? No. Some so people think it's like you're, you know, telling future or something. It's, it's not quite like that. So you whip out a, you take out like a royal flush. What does that mean? No, no, no. It's like a special set of cards with like special imagery and each image and stuff means something different. Oh, like when you buy a deck of cards that like, you know, the king is like Homer and like the queen is like, like that? No, sweetheart. <laughs> something different. I've lost. I know. We'll skip this part of the story. It's okay. So, um, what the cards tell you about someone? Yeah. What's for D? Can, not, a, not about someone. It's just kind of like something or how things are going or how things might go. Like, I can send you a picture of what the cards look like. She sent me a photo, but it was... It was so wild, everything that was coming up. She was talking about, like, each card meant something different. So there was, like, this broken family, um, like, very disjointed. And there was this adult person that you were once connected to romantically or something like that, which is, like, fairy. And then a stubborn, self-absorbed person who's very lost at the moment, just like Dundee. And then that person is dealing with monetary problems and abandonment and the fear that how many people are around you willing to support you and like so stressed about their support and their legacy and it just like kept fucking going all about Dundee. That's, that's very on the nose. It, it was scary. It was nine that cards on a bike? all about Dundee. So she gave me some tips too. No, this is the. I met with some the people left last night. Comment. See if there's like any way for me to bring souls back or whatever. And I'm not sure, but got one step closer to it. Okay. All right. <sighs> oh, and Dundee's skull is missing. I saw that. TJ called and asked if I had it. <laughs> well, fuck would you have it? I have a feeling I will be having it soon. Bundy? Why would Bundy take that skull? I don't, I don't know. But as soon as he told me that, I remembered that Norman said, and Norman phoned me this morning and said, has Jeffrey passed along his gift? And I was like, no. So I'm just as well, confused as you are. You're not going to let me. Do you want to see why Keith shot me? Of course. Hi, oh, Scraps. Keep Nancy safe while I was away, huh? I'm glad, thank you. Still pissed, by the way. I don't know. GSF drive a Land Cruiser like that? Yeah, so does CG. No. Maybe it's Norman's. Norman doesn't seem like a Land Cruiser kind of guy. I went up to the observatory yesterday and I saw a car parked next to mine. I was like, that is a Norman car. I wish I knew what it was, but it... it there was no shot it wasn't a Norman type car. Hmm. But like style of car was like a hatchback here. No, it's like a little, I'm like, smart four months, ninja vintage, two-door, like a old type of, like, Russian-looking car almost. Oh, a Chubrick? A little boxy, a little boxy. A Chubrick, that's how I think you're 100% talking about a Chubrick. Yeah, and it was black. Well, 
He does look like a cab driver. You know, sunny showers are always very odd, aren't they? I don't know what sun you're seeing right now. Oh. Yeah, same. Yeah. A weird thing for me to say, huh? Mm-hmm. Boost, yay! Oh. That's scraps. came down to the billy and talked to Keith about right. getting him to do a little bit of dirty work for me. And he, uh, he did it. Did what? Look at the billboard on the left. <laughs> <laughs> the crow shit on it already, but that's fine. Uh, that is a lot of shit. A lot of shit. There's another one up on the highway right to, on the way to the lighthouse. You know what I enjoy the most about it? There's, there's a, probably another random Norman in the city and he's like, what the hell, man? Hey, hey, dude. Oh. Holy shit. What the fuck? Is it fucking awesome car? Thank you. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Dude, this guy's crazy. Drive away. Uh... But so I threw some money at Keith to pay him, and he shot me for it. Oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, so... He's got, uh... I gave him... He's got anger problems. Yeah, I gave does. him a can of blue spray paint. And told him, uh... Told him the message he might want to get across. So there's... There's two of them. Maybe don't call. Breathe. Maybe don't. Uh, wasn't I told maybe not to call cunt, uh, death a cunt? I didn't call him a cunt. That's Keith. Mm. So that guy looked like a weird looking D. This wish.com for uh -huh. Yeah. Um, alright. I need to go talk to Bundy. You guys coming? All coming? Mm hmm. Oh yeah, we're coming. I'm down. To caps on my car. Hang around, slow your car. That's embarrassing. I'll let him take it. Hey, whereabouts are you? Okay, I'll ping you in a sec. Bye bye. It says pick a meeting spot and ping me there. All right. Well. Even though he's literally up the street. <laughs> Take us there. Where are we going? Where are we going? Pick a spot, guys. No, I... you. You're picking. Court center. Observatory. Look, I should grab a class too. Sure. Chat well.
What do you mean? He's, he's a jack of the member. Out of the ICU, by the way. Oh, good. He was tweeting yesterday that Norman Bones is a cunt. Norman Bones is a cunt. Well said. Yeah. Of course. Wicked. So <laughs> Looks great, though. Barry went into ICU, he realized he left his car by the lighthouse. Yeah. And, and I had to get dressed up and go and, like, retrieve it. The yeah, he track. was more concerned about the car than he was about his own life, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, that's how I feel about Caroline. Every time I come up here, I hear crows. This just confirms that birds aren't real. Also hear crows. Fog today. And rain. Mm. Amazing. Great day for it. be in my head a moment. Yeah, no, chat. Honestly, whenever I see crows now, I think of fucking Norman. Last night when I was, like, like out, I saw, like, a crow. It was, like, like bathing in a little pond. What's up, Cap? And I was like, that's cute. Oh, okay. And then immediately was like, never mind, that's a... Sick. Um, it's a pretty good deal, to be honest. If you're gonna leave my car, leave it at the Billy, okay? Yeah, I am. Good to see you again, though. Appreciate your uh, help. Did I appreciate your help? If you're around later, I'll be around. Easy. All right, man. Easy, you gonna sleep? Where are you, Ziggy, you fuck? Alright, too easy. Stay safe, man. Okay, easy. See you, mate. Cap says, see you later. Bye, Cap. No, I didn't hang up. I hung up, I don't care. You know what I wonder about? Why the fuck would Bundy be the one to deliver this message? Tommy gun. He's really happy about it. Tommy guns look sick. Yeah. Mm. Yum. So I guess one of you stick around. Uh, 
How's it going, guys? As good as can be, I suppose. I've been wet denim. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How are you guys what? doing? What the hell happened to your eye? You always have that. Well, that's, I haven't had an eye for months now. I can't hear. Can yeah, anyone hear him? Colin. <clears throat> well, um, I haven't had an eye for months now. Hmm. No, it's been a while for. Has it always months, been? It's always been that eye, and Colin. Yes. <sighs> Fuck. Okay. I was hoping that we would uh, you know, get to talk about this just me and you, Nancy, but uh, these two being here actually kind of makes sense. Uh, Wait, do I actually have it on the right, wrong eye? I really know everything anyways. No, probably not everything. Uh, oh my god, it's on the wrong eye. Oh my god. How much god, do you guys know about uh, my lovely neighbor? Not much. Speaking of, he's behind us. Oh, so he is. Death would be so fucking nosy. He's just with us at the beach, too. Yeah, that's pretty good for a guy who was executed by firing squad four years ago, doesn't he? Was he? Mm -hmm. 54 victims, the last of which was Jackie Snow. Meta? Snow? Mm hmm. He was standing on the firing squad lineup, and his last wish was for Snow to stand beside him. And uh, he pulled out a knife and uh, stabbed Snow in the abdomen right before everything went down. Oh. Of course, of course, they shot him anyway, and then they uh, dragged him down to the lighthouse that I now live at and threw his body in the water because they didn't really use to do state burials back then. So that is why he lives there. Um, I'll give you guys the abbreviated version if you want to ask questions then I respect all three of you enough to answer them uh, for the last month that fucker's uh, you know, pet crows or ravens or whatever the hell they are have been dropping bones off on our property attacking all of the flora and fauna I've heard, uh, I've heard some of you guys were down near the lighthouse recently, so you've probably seen that uh, you know, the gardening isn't as well kept as it used to be, and that's not for a lack of trying on our part. Uh, and he insisted uh, during a meeting that we were having yesterday that uh, we make a delivery. Delivery to... You, specifically. Why me? Don't know. Don't know why I'm the one that has it either. But it's from him. It's from him. Okay. Uh, I want to preface this by saying that he is dangerous. Uh, I have personally watched two or three separate people dump entire magazines of Glocks into uh, into his head. I know that he offers deals that sound like redemption. Uh, but unfortunately, those don't always go according. Uh, open that up. Um. The note that I got when I got that, uh, if you want to show it to these two, show it to these two. Uh, the note it's... that I got when I got that, go ahead. 
It is a human skull. Okay. Um. The note said to Jackie or anyone at that table, referencing the round table discussion we were having about uh, about Norman Bones. Deliver Dundee's head to Nancy Drew and tell her he's mine. Sign nobody. We did four different sets of DNA testing. Uh, scrapes, swabs. Uh, uh, that, there's no doubt who that belongs to. Who does it belong to? Erwin Dundee. Is this public knowledge? Is this death public knowledge? Uh, it depends on what you mean by public. There were about eight cops around the table when a fucking magic bird dropped that off in front of us. Fuck. Public knowledge in the sense that we've recorded it or reported it anywhere? And no, how the fuck am I going to report that? Good. What am I going to do? Go to the chief of police and say, yeah, the death who is my neighbor dropped off Erwin's skull. Who are the cops there? Mm. Main one was me and main ones were me and Snow. Others were my family members. I'm sure you know who they are. They've all been dragged into this kicking and screaming because of uh, the antics of the man who is standing up there casually smoking a cigarette. Nancy, are you okay? Well, okay is a funny word. Totally agree. Yeah. But yes, I am okay. I've got, Sorry, my, I've got my own theory as to why uh, I've seen so many folks wearing denim walking in and out of that lighthouse over the last couple of days. Uh, your question kind of confirms it, Colin. Uh, I think you guys have known about this for longer than uh, longer than I've had that skull, to be honest. You'd be right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Either that be to us or he's leaving, who knows? Oh, and the crow is gone as well. The only thing that I'm going to say is he told me that nobody walks into that lighthouse and walks back out without making a deal. Uh, now, I'm pretty sure that that is uh, pure fluff on his part. I think he told a lot of people that before they walk out the first time just so that they know they shouldn't come back. Oh. Uh -oh. But before he walks over here, I do want to say the last person who I'm aware of that made a deal with him has their head in that fucking bag right now. <laughs> but I don't know that that's the best idea for anybody. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh. Well, can I give you a hug? Of course. Yep, no deals here, chat. Smile. Deals never. This me. I'm sorry. Oh my god, he walks like Pez. I hate that he walks like Pez. Mm -hmm. You have been an 
excellent, Coria. You and Lennon. But I need you to go now. Yeah, fair enough. Mm. Colin's too stubborn to die. I love all of you, and those of you I don't love, I respect. Remember that. Appreciate you guys. Norman. Hello, Nancy. Colin. It's been a few days. How you doing, Bones? You're on the right. I'm unsure if we've met. Uh, I don't think so, no. <laughs> Your name? Antonio. Antonio. Colin. Are there lots of you about today? What did he say? Sorry, what was that? Are there lots of you about today? No. Unfortunate. I have good news. What might that be? Oh, I think I'm going to hold on to that until I can tell most of you, if not everyone at once. I understand that is a difficult task, but four or five of you will do. Okay. I, uh, I can let you know when, uh, was, uh, was that amount of week. Yes, do keep me posted. It is important. Do you want me to, to call, leave a text, make a chat group or something? You want WhatsApp? Smoke signals. You decide, Colin. I'm sure you'll Skype call me. Oh, gotcha. All right. Did you, did you FaceTime? What's that? Okay. Do you, you got, we'll talk about it. Well, you've we got can a, I can show later. you on the phone if how you do FaceTime. It's like, like a video call. It's like a phone call, but they can see you, you know, and speak to them. What kind of that? Send my crow or something. What? Crow will do it. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. And you, Miss Nancy. Hello. You are free to do as you wish in that uh, delivery. But like I said, I do hope you heed what was said. Understood. We need to have a discussion at more length very soon. For now, it will have to hold off. I do have to speak to Jeffrey and his family. Colin, as far as what we have discussed, that also, for the time being, is on hold until I give you some more good news. All right. I'll, uh, I'll be listening. Wonderful. Why'd I ask, though? Uh, why... would you give that to Nancy? Do you feel... Do you see me clueless? Mr. McKinley. Suppose not. I know why. Mm. The message is understood. Psycho pump. Good. Have a good rest of your evening. Bye, Norman. Bye. Have a great time. Don't forget to call, but why? We should bring him food next bye. time. Bye. Does he eat? Hmm. Um, souls, probably. <laughs> like souls of shoes. Can we get that at Burger Shot? Is that a. Yeah, I think it's in a combo. Like a murder meal or something? 
Oh, uh, yeah. Deadly low prices. Oh. Let's, um, let's take this back down to Billabong. It yes. deserves to go back on that shelf. Yes. Yeah. I was a ramen. It was alright. Why would Nancy get a jacket? was that? What? You guys not hear that? No. Huh? I just heard someone whistle. It's a coyote. Yeah? It's a coyote. It's one of them coyotes. <laughs> well, thanks for five tones, kitty. Do you reckon you do the hangar challenge? Norman? Norman? Yeah. Other things on the That was my first time getting him. And I, I'm not gonna lie, I felt the air getting really thick. Yeah. How did the two of you feel? Um, I'm okay. Are you sure? Yeah. Well, I feel good. Yeah, I don't feel like I'm, my heart's gonna fucking stop. You okay? Four people. Mm. Fifty-six. Fifty-six. Yeah. Wow. I mean, I'm not entirely. The sure last one that. being Jackie Snow, but. I'm a little confused because if that's the case, he was killed once before. Yeah. When he was a human. The the thing with people like him is sometimes you can. back to where it belongs as quickly as possible. Yeah. 
Yeah, but I don't think he's. I definitely don't think he's human. Oh that no, was not weird. anymore. He was. Perhaps just chilling. Light this up. Oh. Are we sure it's on the wrong eye? What are we on today? Um, six eight three point one. really fucking quick By not, not lighthouse sorry not lighthouse fucking oh the lifeguard, lifeguard tower. tower jesus colin is actually i should be role playing colin blind right now <laughs> just slamming into shit Yeah, yeah, just give her a mini heart attack. That took my other eye and gave me diabetes. From what I know is he was he's been held captive basically this whole time. Out here doing someone else's bidding. Yeah. And you know, I really wouldn't wish that on anyone else to take that spot. I can't imagine how hard that is.
thought Ziggy was an admin. Okay. Yeah, sounds good. Wait, I thought I thought you went to go get that car alarm. That's what I'm about to do. One sec, be right back. What was that? ways that this can shake out. We're all hoping for a good one. Ooh, a feather. Yeah. Um, yeah. I miss the jacuzzi. Yeah, you guys used yeah. to have a hot tub in here, didn't you? Yeah. Even the, all the piss in it. The Vago stole it. He's got. I wonder what he wants to say to us when there's a lot of us around. Well, he said it's good news. Yeah, but do you believe him when he says it's good news? It'll be good for him. Yeah. Death doesn't usually come bearing good news. Yeah. To be honest, there's only one. One thing you could say that'd be good news right now. What's that? That there's a chance that uh, we can have D back. What do we have to do? Is Baza not going live today? Well. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Uh, what he said the night the note was signed no nobody nobody. Me giving me that skull and signing the note the way that he did and kind of makes me feel like Dundee's spirit is sticking with him. But you guys may get the body. They're separated right now. Did the rest? I feel that. Kind of, Colin's mind frame is a little like confused. Hearing Bundy's words of like anyone that makes a deal with him usually gets their head in a body bag. Oh, shit. Well, this year's RP is draining as a viewer. What do you think I feel? Now I'm hungover, chat. I'm supposed to go to a dinner in six minutes. Where do we go from here? Well, I don't think there's much I can't, we can do right now. All those things were... Yeah, it seems like it's a waiting game. 
People need to wake up. Yeah. Uh, we'll go from there, but until then, it's, you know, business as usual, which is kind of like a weird, like, oh, all this shit's going down. It's like, what, do I just go to a fucking dodo run and rob a bank or some shit? Yeah, do I do a boost? Oh, Colin, I robbed a bank. Oh, which one? The Fleeka on Hawick, and I did a bunch of the hacks myself, and I, I was cracked at it. Oh, well, I'm proud of you. Thanks. Fuck the government. I did most of the hacking. Oh, nice. Yeah. You sound legit very proud. I and am, but be. it's a really tense, sad moment, so... I have an A-plus space if you ask me to do it. How long's left on it? Um... Two hours. Yo, maybe give it an hour and we'll see who wakes up. Yeah. I'm also very close on high quality parts to the Subaru. Yeah. I need a few more high quality and then 300k. Easy as that, right? I'm throwing this evidence bag away. It says the word skull on the front of it and I hate it. Um. Yeah, I might start asking you to scrap some bees for me. Because I want to convert the G-Wagon. Mm-hmm. What do I need? How many bees would I need to get for that? 27. Okay, 27. All right. 27 and 300k on top of that. Is what it will cost you. That's not too bad. Yeah. It's a lot of work, though. <laughs> I, did it in, I did it in, like, four days, but I on a lot of contracts and oh. did a lot of racing now it's uh, okay so one second let me tell you exactly what, how how much what you need <sighs> so you need 27 b contracts mm -hmm. uh which is worth 200k in g and e you need a max of 945 g and e plus 300k feeds at h and o for the work mm -hmm. if you bring everything else okay that's, That's for an A class. The most, yeah, the, most the most work there is the uh, bees, really. Uh, the most work for me is the 300k. <laughs> it's hard oh, as well. I don't know. Um, did Andy uh, come talking to the boys? Andy from HOA? HOA, yes. If. If they talked yesterday, then I wasn't around really. Ah, oh, fuck. I uh, went to sleep because they were just. I, f I called Barry early on and he was talking to TJ. They were like a few hours. So I just uh, didn't have much to do, so I went to sleep. I want to give her a call. Is it about the bikes? Yeah. <sighs> What's happening there? We might be blowing up PDM. Oh shit, not again. Myself and D already did that. Bro. Oh shit. I remember that now. I think she's asleep. Oh my god, chat, my number's gonna be 666. Fuck me, kind of lucky. Oh, okay, I'm just gonna think for a little bit. Okay. Alright, chat, hold on. I need to uh, take a piss. Oh, I'm not okay. But I love you, chat, and I'm here. Fuck dinner with my friends. Basically, like it's a work day, and I need to I need to be here for work, you know. Hello. 
I'll be back. I need to check if there's paint in it. Nailed it. the stream if you're too tired no it's more of a case of like i made a i made a commitment to the subathon so i was gonna go live today regardless damn nancy's got a fat ass she out here walking around the billy asked like a question mark Oh, we're not doing that twice, challenge. Say you have enough. Burfund. fund. Burr fund? Oh, 20 beer fund. Oh, appreciate you. If I did, if I did the spice challenge today, I. What is it that you're going to do? Maybe a wing challenge. Ooh. You guys want to do a Polito run? <laughs> There's no paint in it. Oh, fuck. I just had 10 <laughs> in there yesterday. Yeah, I ate them all. Oh my god. For all that meth, you're definitely not cooking. No, of course not. No, no, I was just hungry. Oh, yeah. Antonio okay. and I were picking up Barry's car yesterday. And Antonio said something, and he's like, what if the. Oh. The one, what if the one thing I love gets taken away? And I said, meth? And he went, yeah. Uh. That was really cute. <laughs> he does love cooking. You love cooking meth. I yeah. love cooking meth too, Antonio. We have that in common. Yeah. I, um, speaking of that, I need to move a lot of stuff to another place. Wow, very cryptic. I'll walk away from this. No, 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 no. You don't have to walk away. What the hell does JFC uh, mean? My current location of all my cupcakes is full of cupcakes. Uh, I need a new bakery. I need a storefront. <laughs> <laughs> also, Damien is confusing the shit out of me. Bought tequila I mean, Now he's working at Jewel Dragon and Maldini's with CG. 
and asking to buy all the genie that people have. Damien's a crackhead. I, I think he changes him. his mind on what he wants every few days. Yeah. What? That's... He spoke to, what? That doesn't he sound spoke like to me about... He spoke to me about, you know... Jesus fucking Christ, okay. Coming down to Vespucci again. And then like a few days later I heard a complete opposite things like he's going off and doing his own thing. I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah. I don't know. I think he just chases dopamine. He gets a quick hit, then he's on to the next thing. Yeah. So cute little bird. Oh my god. I think I'm like four or five laptops away from just recharging mine. And it's got six battery left. The fuck? I, um... I asked Norman what his crow's name was named. What was it? Nosy. It's Russell Crow? N O N O X E E. Oh. I would have said Russell Crow. Mm -hmm. Gwyneth Powell Crow. Or Crowella DeVille. Hello, Q. Oh, I mean, shit. Russell okay. Crowe. Yeah. A little too on the nose, I though. I do, yes. That'd be great. Yeah, you're at the, uh, at the gas station. Polito. Sorry, what was that, love? Polito. Oh, sure. Uh, we'll do, we're gonna do Polito lines whenever we get back, right? Alright. I'll see you there. Bye. Okay, I'll see you back here. Okay. I'm gonna Bye. get a free laptop. Okay. Get me one too, thanks. Mine's fucked. Well, it's a, it's a free broken one, so. Oh. You know. Shit. <laughs> the Giga Crow. I want to pet crow chat. It's a weird thing chat where it's like, I think pet birds are really cute, but I think it's kind of fucked up to keep a bird in a cage. something new. Mm -hmm. That's why it was so hard having you not being around. Are you holding up okay after hearing what he said? I think I know why he said what he said. Well, I think you might be making that threat because maybe you're able to get these, you know, that's exactly what I think. That's exactly what I think. And he's trying to be big and scary, but I'm just simply not scared of him. I'm fascinated by him. I asked about his crow. Had two when I was a kid? Jesus Christ. If that's the case, there probably is a way you can do it, but fuck knows how. 
I have a place and a person who might be able to help me. But if I tell you about it, I basically owe them my soul. So I can't tell you about it. The fuck? What are you talking about? I did some research and I found some ways that I might be able to do it, but it's a matter of, like, if I out this person as to who or what they are and where this might happen, if it comes down to it, I, I owe them my soul. Okay, fuck that. No, like, they're probably the only person that can help. That's why I just can't... The only thing is, I just don't say where it is. Oh, okay. Yeah. Are you pushing a local car right now in your ass? <laughs> I think so, yes. Okay, great. Um, yeah, that's... That's the only thing. I just don't say who it is or where it is, and I'm fine. And I trust them, and they will help me. The issue is if I break that trust. Quite the deal to make. I know. Yeah, I want to ask, tell me their name if they do take your soul so I can go kill them, but then your soul will be taken. So it's kind of kind of productive. Exactly. Thing. No, they're, a, they're a good person. It's just kind of a side effect of how it goes, you know? So as long as I respect them uh, and respect their trust, then we're all good. Wondering who all is going to wake up today. I have a feeling we're probably going to get whatever that news is not until tomorrow. to deal with this. I don't think I can, Blue Freak. Thank you for restocking the shop yesterday. You're welcome. Put up the signs and a bunch of armor and stuff. In. And all that beef dinner, which I thought I put too much in. But obviously not. Keep this up, you might get employee of the month. I should fucking hope so. <laughs> I don't know, we'll have to do a performance review. Oh my god. Two for one special on Salisbury steaks at my local pancake house. I mean, that sounds like a pretty sick deal. What did you go and think about two days? How this all might pan out. How the club's gonna react. He said that Barry went there to go. Yeah, so the reason I deleted those texts is because Barry called me and said, Nancy, you and Colin are close, right? Like every time he needs to know something, he leaves with that. And I was like, 
yes, but I was in the middle of robbing a bank, so I couldn't talk. And he's like, Nancy, I need to talk to you about something, and I'm assuming it's whatever you told him, and then before you went on your drive. So, in case he thought I was lying about not knowing, I just deleted the text in case he went through my phone. Uh, he also questioned me about what you tell me. He said, Nancy, Colin tells you to post up, right? And I said, no. He said, Nancy, I won't even be mad if you're lying. I just need to know. And I was like, no. I don't. He doesn't tell me club stuff. I don't tell him server and stuff. And he went, okay. But I don't think he believed it. I don't like that. thing I was thinking about. Thanks for ten grand, Ash. Really worried because you're so intertwined with this now. Not my choice, you know, I know. It never is. Just hope the club doesn't turn around. also continued that conversation by saying like Nancy I I trust you it's was it the same day I can't remember Odd. oh it was the same day when we were all in the garage and he was like Nancy I trust you and I care about you He does. Yeah. He also told me that if anybody finds out about B, obviously he would murder me, but um, I haven't told anybody, so it's somebody on the Bundy Bunch side who. Well, I mean. Yeah, the way that I. Having D's skull didn't really help. The way that I see it, um. If it does get out, I'm just gonna blame the eight cops that, uh literally know that he's dead. Well, I'm... Yeah. Are you going to tell Barry about that? Of course. Yeah, okay. I've been, like, avoiding Bunny. Oof, yeah. Kind of a... <laughs> how do you, uh... How would you even premise that? Sit down, Bunny. I've just been telling her that I've been going through it since Jordan's funeral. <sighs> it's one of those, that feeling every day now where like you wake up. Just wanted to be fucking over. I'm sorry, love. 
There's nothing to apologize for. I'm just tired. I'm sure you are tired. I'm sleeping like shit. Let's look carry around that deagle I shot him with. Why? I don't know. One of the heaviest guns I've had to carry. You thought about putting it away. Wouldn't feel right. But I have two repair kits. Any vodders? There's that fucking whistle again. Did you hear that? No. I'm I'm fucking losing it. Is it like close to you? No, oh, it's on a little far. You heard that, right, chat? Lock in the door of the lighthouse. Stay out. I'm tired. Good night, homies. Enjoy the crows. Yeah, thanks, Diggy. Diggy, I saw a clip of you laughing your fucking tits off at me when I couldn't see you walking towards the billy. <laughs> he only has one eye. I don't think I've met someone who's a, a big a shitter as I am. Out here. Okay. What the fuck is up with Twitter, man? I hate Twitter. Now I think I'm going to have to have a stern talking with Edbert. Why? Apparently he was twatting out with this whole PDM thing. Yeah. Because he works there, doesn't he? Mm-hmm. Twatting out. He added someone. I wish I could help. I was hired until yesterday. Let PDM know to hire me back so I can service this time of day for people. I would, but I, uh, he added this person and he says, I would be, but they fired me without telling me why. Apparently, Finn was trying to talk to him about it. And like, Finn, uh, Edward basically just told him to shut the fuck up. This pulls rank. But, like, you know how it looks like when we as the BBMC agree? How, how, how does it make it look if, you know, we make that call that we're going to help with this and then one of our jackets is, like, bitching about it on fucking Twitter? Yeah. Not a good, not no. a good PR move. So I got to go talk to him if he gets me lit. I'll just kick his head in. up in our meeting yesterday. Oh shit. I, I was, what was the consensus on that? I don't know what the consensus really was because I think it got talked about again after I left, but I put my two cents in of like, if I was in an MC and you made a special deal with us for special pricing on a bike, and then decided to say fuck that a year later with no warning at all, I'd be pissed too. Like, I even I even told the guy, I was like, if you had done like a two month warning, hey, these next 10 bikes that come in are all going to MCs for the agreed upon price, and then we're gonna be opening it up to public auctions, it probably would have gone a lot fucking better than it did. Um, but he didn't. And 
he's like, well, the MC should just bid on them. I'm like, well, wh why did you even do this in the first place? Like, why can't they just have one thing that's just for them? And then I even asked, I said, okay, so everybody that's on a wait list from an MC, do they have one of these bikes? And he said, most of them. I was like, you need to make sure all of them have the bike. All these people who've been waiting forever and then open it up. Who is this guy, by the way? Thanks, Max. Nice guy. I just don't think he really understands. Yeah. Like, he's trying to do what he thinks is best for the business, but it just doesn't make a whole lot of sense because I don't think he really understands what's going on. Yeah, let's see what's uh, the best call for your business and start murdering your employees. Also, if it comes back that I talked to you about this, I could, um, I could yeah, you're okay. Shit with Cerberus, so. I know how we operate. I know. Inside the truck is a safe space. <laughs> Charlie's still renovating the house. Oh. How's it look so far? It's good. Has it changed much since I last saw it? Yeah, but I think I'm going to keep you out of there for now. Oh. Stay at your house. Are I want to surprise you. Ouch. What? Ooh. I, I said we'll stay at your house. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh. And I want to surprise you. There's a couple of things I asked for, so. Okay. I want you to see when it's all done. Charlie does some good fucking work. Yeah, she's like my go-to now. You know Freddy Versetti decorated the CI storefront? Oh, well, how's it look? That's good, but it's just kind of funny. Your best of friend? all people, Freddy Versetti, I actually need to tweet that the storefront is open. Um, That, I feel like that'll actually free up your time a lot more. Me too. He says there's new stuff coming too, which is nice. Like what? I don't know. He didn't actually say. He just said, Nancy, new gadget soon. Lang has been very complimentary of me recently. Isn't that weird? It's more worrying. Well, it's I've either, been, yeah, you've either been like absolutely just nailing it like you always do. But. Yeah, he was, he was like, holy shit, Nancy, you're crushing it as always. You're the best. Like, uh, I walked him through all the storefront stuff. He was like so happy. I, I, fuck, I don't know. It's very, very cool. Racing lines, even in a truck, you know it. Well, I'd be proud of you too. I am proud of you. You do a lot. I just always hope it gets noticed. I try my best. Preaching on the choir. Hmm. I'm happy you're back. You ever been handed a human skull before? Yes. Huh? Yes. When? Uh, a couple days ago. 
See that like not there. Like who the who the fuck steals a fucking skull? Explaining this to Barry is gonna be a little complex. Yeah. Happy in my head for a sec. You're all good, love. Hey, thanks for a tier two, my man. What's the time, Rat Chat? Looking good? Still 16 hours, poggers. Oh, I feel bad for missing my fucking mate's uh, restaurant thing. But also, chat, I also am in a lot of fucking pain. Yesterday, do you guys know what Birkenstocks are, chat? Birkenstocks, it's kind of sandal. So, me and the guys were like, fuck, let's go buy, we're all gonna go buy Birkenstocks together and be the Birkin boys, right? Hipster art school student shoes, yes, correct. Uh, and then we went on a walk around a park in them, brand new. So, I didn't know that you need to kind of break them in a little bit before you go on a long walk with them. Do you know how much blisters are on my feet right now? You could pop all of them and fill a glass. Walking hurts so much. That's my streamer. <laughs> Don't say it like that. Aren't they for women with hairy legs? What the? F Trying to eat? Trying, failing. Um. Okay, I gotta. Holly, I'm fucking, fucking coming. coming. <laughs> Your late night booty call. Thanks for ten to one. You fucking cutie. I need a little more. I need more upbeat music. I don't ask me you cops. Maybe I just smoothie? No. Hardcore, baby. Oh, did you just drop this off? No. Go get a VPN. The radio's gonna be fucked as well. <laughs> Good late night booty call. Another five more? You good, Murda? Much for 15 subs, my man. Also, chat again. Sorry, I'm not very energetic for today's stream. 
Lots of socializing and a lot of alcohol. Oh, and uh, we got a woman fired from her job. Yeah, we got someone fired. Yeah, a little, feel a little guilty about that one, not gonna lie. Um, we went to a, uh, an oyster bar. mean it is yeah and we got sat um our server comes over she takes our drink orders leaves comes back doesn't have need a bunch of money gold panning by the way yeah i got a bunch of materials and shit. i still have a gold nugget on me anyway so I went gold panning today. how was that it's actually really nice She's, like hung out. She's a good egg. Talked a bit. He said he said something mean about men and she really liked it. That made me smile. Hurtful. <laughs> but I'm a Except man. You. Um So yeah. She after she comes back with she doesn't bring our drink order, but she comes back to take our food order, which is weird. That's not usually what a server does. Usually you bring the drink orders. You know, give people time to do whatever. She takes our oyster order. Uh, we were waiting for 45 minutes. And then, then we get the oysters. We still don't get our drinks. So we tell her when she was, we were like, I mean, I'm, I'm, I've got a chef mentality when it comes to servers. Um, 45 minutes for drinks? No, we didn't get the drinks. We got the oysters. So, um, uh, another server walks by, and I'm like, sorry, we've been waiting, like, nearly an hour now for our drinks, and we got our oysters. So what's up with that? And she was like, oh, I'm so sorry about that. I'll check in on that. Not even, like, 15 minutes later, our original server, that took so long, walked out of the restaurant in like like normal clothes not wearing her uniform i was like that's weird um the owner comes up and he's like i'm so fucking sorry about that that's an unacceptable amount of time apparently the bill got lost which is a thing a common excuse that kitchens use to just you know oh yeah no the, the bill got lost so we we get our drink orders and um You know, it's good. And they're like, well, we were getting a little cranky, but once we were fed and had some food on us, we were like pretty chill. Uh, the, the owner brings us a round of um, oyster shots. They're really nice. It's basically like you do it, you suck back an oyster and you it chased it with like, it was basically like a, a Caesar. Um, and I, I'm, at one, I'm like, okay, I'm going to go to the bathroom. I walk past and there's a couple of, there's like a couple of servers polishing cutlery and uh, I over here being like oh yeah she got, she just got fired <laughs> what <laughs> I was really drunk at the time so I thought it was really funny in my opinion you don't fire someone for that alone there's usually multiple reasons She was crazy hot, though. Yeah. Camel's back and all that, probably. Great oysters, though. I had a really nice time. I got a mussels and clam dish, you know, with like a nice white wine garlic sauce. Like some nice crunchy garlic bread. You dip that bad boy in. Suck up all that clam juice. Chat, you like oysters? Yeah, it's definitely a 
I think they're deli delicious. I love oysters. Great oysters, hot server. She got fired though, but great oysters. Damn right. Yeah, people people compare it to the consistency of like, why would I want to eat salty snot? And I'm like, fired Warpig. Happy 10 months. Love and appreciate you. Thank you. I think you should always try something once, Chad. What was the flavor like, though? Um, there's actually lots of different oysters. They all taste pretty different. I'm good. I just want to let you know, as an avid wingsuit and ramp purchaser, uh, we opened up our storefront today. It's up by Roosters. It's like I chew them. Roosters, then the wiener shop to the left, and the building just to the left of that is CI. I'd rather eat my boogers, chat. No. West. That guy just admitted to eating his boogers. West. Two buildings west. Oh my god, Dundee, you're in chat. Poggers. No, I'm not. But all the product is in there and it's already in for sale and stuff. So. Alright, sounds good. But yeah, if you guys, I think they're you delicious. guys need meat, some are like some are like creamy and sweet. And I'll probably just uh, tell the boys every night and I'll probably give them a call, but I know you guys always need them, so there you go. Alrighty, talk to you later, Randy. All right, bye. It takes so long when you don't have coffee. Smoked oysters, fried oysters are delicious as well. Did you like calamari? No. Seafoody, sure, but... Can't eat any soup food. I grew up with a mother who could not cook and she ruined lots of foods for me. I feel like um I feel like that's a common problem with a lot of people. My ex-girlfriend hated mushrooms because um apparently they were or like whenever she got them cooked by her parents, they were like rubbery and tasted like shit. Because it was overcooked, not done right. Only time I ate oysters was to impress a girl. How did that go? Rod never brought me coffee. Hey, Colin. You bought Nancy coffee today? Uh, no, I haven't seen. I, oh my God, someone else just killed me. I haven't seen Nancy. You haven't seen Nancy? Why haven't you called her? And you'll be like, you need coffee today, ma'am? Yeah, you're right. No, Rod, I think you're really shit in the bed on this one. What color was what, Karina? The, they were both black. Um, I didn't shit the bed, man. I think you are. I think you're currently shitting no, the I'm bed. No, sh I'm not shitting the bed. There's no poop. <laughs> I'm there's not no, pooping no my poop? pants. Are uh, you sure? The bed. I'm not pooping. I, I'm pretty sure, yes. Do you just actually Do you smell it? shitting on the floor? What? Why are, are you asking, do I want to smell your shit? I want to smell my shit. I'm no, asking I don't if want you to smell, smell your it. shit. I'm asking if you smell it. Not God, if are you, you hitting on me? No, I'm not hitting, on, hitting you. on you. I think he's hitting on me. Oh my, are you telling this to Nancy? Please don't tell her. Oh, I'm not telling Colin. her. I'm not telling her. She's next to me. Oh, so you're just saying it out loud yeah, so she hears yeah. it? Pretty much. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. All right, I think she's going to call you now, so I got to go. Bye-bye. Okay, all right, bye. No, I was just texting him. All caps. Stop hitting on my boyfriend. Nice. An amazing barbecue tonight. Oh, is this Eminem but a classic version? No, actually, this is the original. A lot of the songs are based on uh, a lot of medieval music, which you know we can't get copyright strikes because you know it's medieval music. Chicken noodle soup sounds like it would slap. Oh my god, is that the real? It says I wasn't. I would not. Is that the real Lizzie McGuire? I respect your relationship. I love that. Jesus Christ. Hi. 
Hello. Who the fuck's that? Oh, Colin's right here. You just probably can't see him because Colin just there. You go. Oh, there hello, is. Colin. He was hiding. Hello. Um, things what are up? good. I'm just trying to finish getting all of this in here so I can make you your stuff. Yeah. I'm actually quickly do a contender run and just grab some shit to make some radios. Yup, yup. Um, I need to ask you about your uh, your G wagon that you want to do later. Okay. Why is that? I I could do it for you, but it just might take a little bit, you know, and a lot of money. Uh, yeah, I'd appreciate that. Like I like I could smash it out in a week, not even. How much money? If you... Um, well, you'd have to give me the genie for it, basically, because I'd just have to spend all the genie super quick. How much do you need? Um, so you needed 950? 950, yeah. Well, oh, that's doable. Yeah. All right, McKinley Racing Arc's back. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit. Yeah. Might as well just give you the C7 so, at this point. That's, that's the reason why I um did it so quickly, because I raced and also bid on contracts. I'm two B-class cars away now from getting the Dogger X. Which is fucking awesome. Nice. Nice. Crikey. It'll take about Crikey, 40 minutes. Mate. 40 minutes, alright. 40 mm -hmm. minutes. Um, I do have another B class car and a A plus G wagon if you guys want to do it. It'll be fun. You can hack it. Schmancy. You could hack it. Have you been hacking, Nancy? Oh, since first day that boosting was introduced in the city you're a fucking boosting. hacker i didn't know that my <laughs> first ever hack was on an m plus boost and i miss m plus boost so much yeah people used to talk about those a lot the m they were the motorcycle fun. boost they were yeah. so fun i forgot about that the m boost they yeah. were so fun i was never i never was in the city for those yeah it's like you're that fresh to the city 25891 is my state id Damn, what the fuck? Jeez. I'm a I'm a pleb. Gross. Baby. <laughs> yeah. Uh yeah, I'm down to do that. I just need to drive up to Polito on the contender and quickly get some stuff to make radios. Okay. Yeah, I'll go with you and then. Uh, we'll do that and then we'll do this boost. We'll quickly smash out this B and then yep. we'll yeah, the we'll build the B. Okay. Alright. Okay. Bye old mate. See you later, old mate. Bro, I caught him huffing that the other day. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, Lunar, you shouldn't have looked those up. Amazon's gonna be on your ass, bro. Did you know that Michael Simone gave Bundy a BMW? Why? Wedding present. Oh. Mm. When it's from like trying to kill the guy to. Here's oh, a Michael's car. playing with his food for sure. Yeah, that's. That's weird. An AK in the glovey. Good. Gotta find a gotta find a place with unlimited oysters, then you'll get some kids and maybe a wife. No desire for kids, but more sex would be alright. Driving is going to be fun. You check your emails so fast. <laughs> the 
Good luck with that. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna be fine driving. Or Antonio can drive. You can intercept. Uh, I'm probably gonna let him handle the main car. I'll just do, uh... Yeah, because I, I am in no state to be driving for an A-plus boost. Okay. I will take one corner and put it into a fucking wall. Well, then I will pack as best I can. Oh, I'm not worried about that. I, is there an AK in this clubby too? No, that's, I just put it in there. Oh, okay. I'm glad that Scraps and Nosy gotta be friends. Yeah, I don't like that. Fine. I think it's a Norman. Mm -hmm. What's up? <laughs> we just uh, tried to do the B boost. Hubcap got dinged. Hubcap got uh, dinged. Croc, <laughs> Croc rocks up. I tried to put Hubcap in the car. He d for some reason doesn't go in the car. <laughs> Are you, are you okay? Are you out? I'm out, but how come on the floor? <laughs> Knock the fuck out. <laughs> oh, big owl. Oh, God. Oh, I feel so bad because I tried to put him in the car and he just didn't get in. That's all right. Yo, uh, big owl usually gets ones of uh, ones. Uh, well, I mean, Hubcap probably had it coming at some point. We all do. <laughs> Poor old fuck. Is he dead? I feel terrible. He's dead. If he's dead, you, you already, Barry's gonna kill you. <laughs> oh no. Fucking oh, hell. Oh my god. Why didn't fucking Norman just hire fucking Big Al? We're gonna have to hook out <laughs> easy. Why, why did we give D if we could have just. Yeah, we're giving D when we. Yeah, fuck. <laughs> That's not funny. <laughs> yes, it is. Fuck hell. Get him to the hospital. <laughs> I didn't have him. He didn't get in my car. He's, oh, he's definitely going to jail then. Okay, bet. <laughs> if Croc has his hands on him, he's going to jail. All of that happened in like a less than felt like two minutes. <laughs> oh fuck! I don't know how he didn't get in the vehicle, but I mean he didn't, so he's fucked. All right, well, um, we'll just do this run, and then I guess we'll wait for him to get out, and we'll launch it into uh, the. A. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right, peace. See you back here. Hubcap got dingered and got arrested. Oh, no, that was so fast. That was so fast. Wait, like we just left the city. We, yeah. Oh, See, look. At Norman Adams, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, Norman Adams, what did you do? I like Seattle, but I can only say yeah, that. Yeah, that is the second billboard I got used to go visit. That's where is that? It's about what highway? Which one? It's on the highway. It's the last billboard on the highway before you turn off for the lighthouse. Uh, oh, perfect. Mm -hmm. There's one on the road to the lighthouse, but it would never be seen by anybody. So I sent Keith to that one instead. Picked out a spray paint that was as close to Bondi Blue as I could find. Oh, you nailed it. Norman is a cunt. Nice of Antonio to offer to help with the G-Wagon. Yeah. I mean, it was going to be fun to try to grind all those bees out with you, but if we wanted to... Yeah, I say what we do is we do get him to help, but we still, you know, help him move along, you know? Yeah, that works.
Hey, bro. Norman's a cunt, eh? People are making friends in my chat. That's cute. Oh, friend. All right, beautiful. You want me to stop and get us stuff from what he win? I'm okay. Have you been eating? Yeah, I've been eating. Colin? I don't have diabetes. No, you don't have diabetes. I just want to check if you've been eating. Mormon didn't give me diabetes. I know he didn't give you diabetes, but when I had to cover for Barry in the hospital, I said that he had diabetes. Norman Bones gave my VP diabetes? <laughs> Hard for Norman. I don't think he deserves that. Why well, would strong police say no? Yeah, you're right. I really want to, but I won't. Bondi to la diabetes. But I will think about a fun card for him. Sorry you're such a cunt. <laughs> to Norman from the BBMC. Why is Demi Black phoning me? Oh, fun. Help, Demi. I'm good. How are you? Yes, that would be me. That would be me. I will have to charge you for it, but I can absolutely do that. Um, I need to check the pricing on it, and they it's a once a month charge. So they kind of fall apart after a month, and then I come back and do it again. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, yeah. Whoa. No, that's not a problem. So yeah, I'll uh, I'll reach out a little later today and get that sorted out for you. Okay. All right. All right. Thanks, Demi. All right. Bye. <gasps> Gosh, you got a storefront. She wants an ATM. Full of dodge. One of the ones that brought Barry in yesterday, so I was like, oh, I don't want to have. Oh, great. There's questions. more. Yeah. Yeah. They brought. It was Bundy, Lennon, Cleo, Pez, Demi. Very curious to see how Bundy and Lennon react to Cleo wishing death upon you. Did I tell you that? Yeah, you did. Okay, good. I'm pissed, still. I wonder why Bundy agreed to bring that to you. Probably doesn't have a choice. Mother! Oh! Oh, my finger. Okay? Hey, oh, hey, Moosebeard, no. fuck you. Fuck you. I don't know why I love hating Moosebeard. <laughs> Moosebeard's so likable, though. Yeah, that's why I want to hate him. Mm. Cleo's a little... I don't little... understand why they all just won't move. 
Yeah, that really gets into me. Like, all of this is like, why? For what? That fucking shithole? Yeah, okay. He's still laughing? What? Fucking hell. I don't know if you know this, but Cleo Shaw, kind of a meanie. You heard it here first, chat. Again, he <laughs> just stood there uh, on the floor, and I couldn't shoot the person because I was too busy laughing. See, you were laughing so you couldn't save him. Then, uh, well, I tried to. I, I tried to put him in the car, and then apparently he didn't get into the car. I don't know how. He just laid on the floor. See, I tried. That was okay. the same thing when the when I was there for the very the first Big Al, watching Barry get hit. I I was laughing so hard that I wasn't able to help him. <laughs> Because I literally was like, this, okay, is the, I, this is the funniest shit I have ever seen. What the fuck? Love my new house. Um, CG fun house. What? running away yeah. from him and then he shot me in the back a couple of times luckily it like dinked off my wingsuit and then he got he like called his friends and they all started doing cute ones yeah keith and his mates are really really aggressive yeah and realize they had aps now hey like, joe that's a very lovely dress yeah they're strapped i've seen some of the fucking angels locals they've got Full rifle. Oh shit. God yeah, damn. Crazy. And then there's the Mandem grubs who have shanks. Not so bad. It's not so bad. feet is today a bbmc day off for some shit chat get rid of all of that stuff <laughs> before they can start decorating again and then you'd have to put it back yeah i got a i got a feeling that i know who who did that man i don't know the yeah. blue oh man i don't know Our time bro they'll never know it was the bondi boys chat why did nancy not oh, whatever Like four and a half radios. Bing bong.
Hey, Andy, how you doing? Um, I'm okay. How are you calling? What's up? Uh, oh, I'm good. I'm over shit. Um, okay, I've got 21 months. Uh, blah, 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 okay. any... Yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm just checking in on... Uh, I wasn't awake yesterday. Did anything happen with this, uh... Oh, yeah. I, uh, I talked to Barry since I couldn't get a hold of you. And I gave him months. the, uh, time and location. So it'll be an hour after the restart. And then he has the location. Hour after the restart? What does that mean? Uh, <laughs> tsunami. Wow. So sorry. Wow. <laughs> so sorry. Wow. I didn't even realize. God damn. Oh, my hold God. Out of these streets, oh, my God. Man. I want to step now, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, we'll see on forum drive, all right? Where's Jaeger? Oh, my God. He understands. <laughs> right. Oh, an God. hour after storm. Got it. Okay. Yeah. After all we right. restart our lives <laughs> from the horrible storm that's incoming. Who the Oh, God, yeah. Hour after, and then uh, Barry has the location. Um, well, I right. told him to memorize it and eat it, and then he immediately asked me what time it was at, even though it was on the thing I gave him. All right, no worries. Uh, our so we'll storm. Uh, hopefully he's awake. Okay. Bye. Right, like, yep. Bye. Right, bye, -bye. Who, the, who the fuck are you? Hello, Colin. It's me, Brox Carver. What the? F I've been gold panning and I've changed slightly. <laughs> <laughs> But, How are y'all doing well, today, then, boy? That does kind of check out. I've, I've been great. Living my best life. How's gold planning treating well, you? Judging by the sound of your voice, that does not sound convincing to me. Yeah, I'm hungover. Well, that'll fucking do it out to you. <laughs> God damn it. So what, you a millionaire yet, or what? I'm still broke as a joke, but I'm lying in debt now. Fuck yeah, well, that's a little bit of here. Still down bad, but we're in the positive right now, so it's time to uh, try and find a bike and get around. Chad, who the fuck is this? I am such a piece of shit. God damn it. Well, you know, good luck. Well, I've, I've seen a Thank bunch of. There's a bunch of shit. Are people like. Have you. Has anyone given you shit for gold panning in um, different areas? Uh, not that I can see, but normally I just go down to the beach. Oh, okay. Well, shit. Well, have fun and good luck, all right? Thank you very much, brother. Well, judging by the awkward silence, I'll leave y'all to it. Have a good day. Yeah, we're going to go do crime. Okay, bye. Brox is such a... F oh, it's Brox! What a cutie. Who is that? Uh, bitch crew. Oh. I mean, beach crew. Mm-hmm. You eating something? Mm -hmm. What was that? What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, let me. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna go put this away. Hey, can I get paid? Of course. Did I myself the view? Hash brown. What are you talking about? Oh. <laughs> A and W hash browns are way better than A and W hash browns are it? way better than McDonald's hash browns. Fight me. First time I ever had it was because you told me yes, to, and, and now I'm just like yes, really upset about yes. it. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> I'm a convert. Oh shit. Um. Do you something for us? Anything. Can you put scraps in his cage? Oh sure. Thank you. Throws you into a box. Uh, I need to go get a VPN, so let's go do that. Okay. Not that. Oh, no, 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 no. You want to try the rat shack first? Where the fuck is my Mustang? Well, this is the tuner show. Let's go, go grab that. Alright, uh, I'm gonna go get my Mustang and a VPN, and then we can send it once he's out, right? Fuck you, Keith. Yeah, he shot me. But he did spray paint the billboards for us, so... Oh. 
You all right? But he did shoot me. Bro. Oh, no, 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 no. Smack that. Did you, did you not hear Antonio? Said, like, what was that? Take me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Take me with you. I said, oh. Scraps! <laughs> how did you get, Scraps, how did you get there? <laughs> how did you... Wait, Scraps is, wait. That's not Scraps. Scraps the whole time? Nope, that's not Scraps. That's not Scraps. Oh, good. Okay, it's random a, that's raccoon. just a regular raccoon. Gross. <laughs> oh my god, I'm seeing some shit. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, my, uh, Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> oh, can I tell you about the bank? Sure, of course. Okay. It was me, Zav, Rod, and Sid. Um, I did my first ever bank thermite. Oh. First try, I crushed it. Nice. Killing it. Mm-hmm. I think Zav, yeah, Zav did the laptop. And then I did the lights out and the drill multiple times. Ooh. And then did, was like two things away from doing the bar hack on my track. I've never done, I've never been inside of a bank. Mm, no, 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 what? No, smack that. Yeah, the new ones I haven't been inside. I've just been outside. Oh. Around the outside. You had a vault? Mm, no. Oh. Okay, I have driven from a vault once. A long time ago. And you hit the vault, right? Yeah. We hit the vault and walked out of there with the loot. When the cops were on scene. <laughs> a Dund That's Dundee right. disguised as a cop. We had him at the side door. Made it look like there was a little kerfuffle between Barry and him. He handed him all the loot and D just drove away. With all the loot. Perfect. Good shit. No. It was... I didn't think it would work, but it was fucking hilarious. I did a vault with the Vagos a little while ago, and all of them were like in their yellow. And then there was me, and the, the look on the cop's face when they're like, oh, it's Vagos vault, and they're like calling it in or whatever, and they're like, and this woman. <laughs> some lady some and they all knew it was me but they were like and also some woman is here oh huh? there's like hello hi i'm taking part in this hmm? we took sidecar as a hostage well that's always a good time where are we driving uh los santos Okay, were we gonna pick up your car? Uh, no. Oh. Said Antonio left the right bitch in the trunk. Right, okay. We can pick up Hubcap too. Mm -hmm. I feel bad. Yeah. It's his fault. Why? It's hilarious. But I'm also still gonna laugh at him. He got caught lacking. Do you have a tracker disabler? I have both, yeah. Okay. And now I have food, so my brain's up. Ooh, yeah. Ready to go. I can't hack on an empty stomach. And rescued Wolfie. There's some crocs out there waiting for me to fucking start the boost. Oh no. Yeah, he knows it. Lower knows uh, he's pretty fucking horny for those things. Yeah. I forgot we were picking up a VPN. I just 
probably said that genie as well. I forgot about that. Fuck. Oh, true. Do I have enough to start? I do. Ooh. Ah, I would've got you. No, we're not gonna be raiding the house for a while. Oh, chat, I got a ship ruin. Oh, God, my stomach just turned it in on itself. You said ding dong to your students? Oh, it's cringe. What's beautiful? Oh no. Rocks tweeted, who the fuck is Norman? It's because of the billboard. I'm just saying, I can't. As long as you don't like say like lol or WTF. Yeah, Andy said something really weird to me. What did she say? You said that there's going to be a big meeting after restart. And I was like, what the fuck's that? that was Sounds pretty, like a gang. That was pretty weird. So weird. Maybe she's talking about a new MC. Hey, why is the yokel here? What is this? car is sick. What the f is this? Oh my god, it's a Rolls Royce. Chat, this car is sick. It's just, it just manslaughter. It's not Did you get those murder. tattoos in prison? No, I've had these for like a Meet a prison half. tat. You definitely need a prison set, Tanner, yeah. for sure. Make a pose, Tanner. Where are you guys going on water? Yeah. Make it a pony. Okay. Wow, Get a big pony. Like oh, God. It'll be in my head. Yeah. Go away, I'm taking a shit in this bush. Give a man some fucking oh privacy, God. bro. Oh, my God. I didn't know. Come back, Chad. I gotta go. I gotta, I gotta go make poopy time. Poop, poopy. I found him, he's in the rose bush. <laughs> one with the flowers. 
Sacred Heart, I know you're having a breakdown, but it doesn't have to be here. <laughs> like, we can... Me and Antonio, we're here to... We're here to talk. We can help. We can help. We don't have to do this alone in a bush. It's been a rough few days. Handsome. I'm going over here, okay? Sometimes when I get sad, you just need to pick me up and spin me in circles a couple times. Strong shoulders. Yep. Thanks for the pickup, everyone. Of course. Appreciate you. I'm not gonna lie, Hubcap. It took me a while to shoot the, the guy because I was too busy laughing. But... Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh. Where is he? Oh, I don't see him. Uh oh. Yeah. Well, see, Colin was not on you. Colin? Colin? Colin, can you hear us? Kinkus Donkus, Colin. Co Colin? Oh no. In the trunk, is he? No. Oh, he's. I think he's in the. He's in the back seat. Oh, I can't. I can't go to the back. I can't go to the back seat. There he is. There oh, he is. there you go. I'll call him. Uh oh, Wait, you guys need going? to sort yourself. Oh out. my god. I see Hubcap and Colin sitting in the same seat. Here we go. Yeah. Seen his lap. Are we good? No, no you need to no, move Colin's over one gone. seat. I see, see I, see, I see Colin in the I other seat on the far side. So <laughs> What have we done? Uh. I think we're, everything <laughs> looks fine to me right now, so... Who's left? Oh, well. No. That works. You're a deputy dog. mayor. Oh. Sorry, yeah, I'm we'll just going to dip from that conversation. Yeah, that's probably... Yeah. yeah. Don't need none of that. Um, One sec. Hello, Harry. Oh my god, I'm making it right now. Because... Oh, you know what? I'll even... 
I will stop by the store and I will put it in stock right now. It should be done curing already. Yes. I will be there in a minute and a half, maybe less, probably less, 45 seconds. All right. I might be a little bit longer because I, I have I have an advance. I have advance. Oh, okay, my car's broken, but I'll be there shortly. Okay, fine. Bye, Harry. I have to go to my soap shop. Somebody wants soap. Very okay. aggressively. <laughs> Same. Harry wants what he wants when he wants it. It's true. He does. Y'all good? Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. L Nancy. Appreciate Thank you. you. Oh, look, oh my god, Rip. L? Yeah. Been hanging out with the nerds a little bit. Oh, the Cubans. I just ate shit off the motorcycle. Oh, I, see you, man. I don't, I don't oh. know. I think someone threw a shoe at him, maybe, and knocked him off on the way, or I don't know. He just fucking <laughs> ate shit right in the middle of the road. It did look like for no reason, but Jesus. Oh my god. Lovely. I'm kind of concerned for this A plus with Croc around. Is this an A or an A plus? Or I'm like inside a hotel. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look who it is! Yep, I'm here. I call him. It's me. It is. It's. Are you driving away from that? <laughs> no, I'm just. I'm not. I'm not going. I'm just oh, going to drive. No. You want to drive the A plus? Ah, uh, no. I'll let you do that. I'm too fucking cooked right now to take charge on that. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda concerned with the uh, old mate Croc around. But. Fuck it. Fuck it. Uh, is she in her shop? I said to go sell somebody a bunch of soap. Good. You doing okay? No. What's up? Taking the shit in that bush really took it out of me. Oh no. I know, I know what that's like. You know, literally took it out of me. Oh. TJ's calling me. Nice. Oh. Hey, TJ. You do. Okay. I'm um, just with Colin and Hub Kevin and Tonyo right now. We're driving. I think we're picking up Colin's car. Yeah. And then probably coming back to the Billy. 
It did. Did you see it? God, I want to put an ice cube in my ass. It's back where it belongs. I put it back where it belongs. Another gift. No, I'm saying you have another gift. Uh, see you back at the Billy, alright? Yep. Get fucked. Is Colin planning on going to that MC meeting? Yes. up you know just another man grinding oh, yeah, yeah. nope no oh bro i just took the fattest fucking shit and i'm not okay Your ass will spread out so yes it is hurts. it is on i can feel it <laughs> being true big ups know exactly how that one feels yep, that yep, shit yep. starts hurting Yep, that go there goes the door. Um, can I grab your laptop? Can. Thank you. So Nancy, you're, you're a sexy machete. <laughs> it's an Agnes gun. I'm gonna go get uh, changed. All right. Yep. Shutting. I, uh, I'm gonna go get the Mustang repaired, all right? What? I come over here. Uh, there's no real context with this other than I was told to give it. That's it. There and was no message him? with it. Yes, no message, nothing. Why is Norman giving me gifts? I don't know. The death trying to bang my girlfriend? Ooh. Thank you. Huh? What I didn't was it? Know that was a thank you thing. A feather. Mm. A black it's my fourth, fourth one today. Don't like that. Colin doesn't like how excited Nancy kind of sounds.
What's up? Uh, I'm assuming you want this up to showroom. Oh, let's get it to uh, whatever the nines are. Uh, what's the state, Eddie? 6382. Chat, there's a fucking whistle again. Chat, I am not crazy, bro. Oh, it looks like I'm meeting that I'm not just going to waltz into. Well, if it is an old stinky. Oh no! Oh. Silence for 15 years. Oh, thank you so much, you don't go there.
that first happens. Time. Yeah, this is the first time hearing of this. Which means me telling a lot of people oh, stuff I don't want them to know. Custom, yes. don't well, you, uh, rocks! Thanks for the raid, my man. It's not like loving the prospect or you already knew. Everything is fine. I'm not feeling sick. I mean, I'm theoretically, you can just keep it to the people that you've only shared that with. Though maybe Barry outside Barry, now. yeah, that might be the only other one I want to add there. I just I don't want Barry to think that I'm somehow working with Norman. I understand that. I Though think I think would... uh, Colin might, hopefully, he might be able to you know, persuade that one a little bit. You want me to persuade Barry? Not persuade him, but lead him down the track that she's not working with Colin. Or Norman. Colin, Jesus, I'm not Norman, working sorry. with Norman. Like, I'm on the, I'm on the <laughs> yeah, good I'm side of this when well, Norman then, is very clearly on the bad side of this. If he was around, maybe don't, you know, stay with Glee when he gives you a gift. The feather. The feather. Oh. Uh, I thought you were talking to me. Oh, no, no. Fair enough. That's, um... That's fair enough. Yeah, I'll speak to him. Uh, and I just told TJ about the testing on it. The skull. So how long do they have it, and who took it? I that would don't be real know. Generous of you, Mr. I would assume, considering it's from Norman, that he took it. It seems odd. It seems odd. They gave it to them to go do tests to get on back. it? Yeah. Okay, goodbye. Maybe? I mean, did he, did he hey, did he... here you go, Bundy. Go ahead and do a few tests on this. What did we try to prove with this? Maybe it, maybe it was to get kind of Bundy and them involved on why we might be negotiating with Norman. I mean, Norman, or. Bundy did say there was a lot of like denim clad people at his like on their property recently. Doesn't uh, Norman just want no. chaos? Do you just think this is, you know, Norman's bit at chaos? Uh yes, I do. In reality, though, I mean he did also say that he wants the highwayman out of Pez. What? Yep. I said not sure exactly why you want the fucking highway, man. I'm just going to be honest with you. If you wait for that asshole to do something, you might wait an eternity. I think you have an eternity to live. Because that dickhead does shit. He wants the highway, man, just because he wants a killer. Um, well, it's not exactly like the highway man's truly a killer, let's be real. He just says he is, but he doesn't do anything. I think I've, kill I think I've killed more than people. he has. That's exactly what I'm saying. I'm the highway man. I kill people. Yeah, you kill innocent people. Name he's had one. A list for... Right. <laughs> he's had a list. I'm now that I think sure about it, he actually is a list. pretty shitty killer. Am I right? How many people has he truly gone after? The list from when it started. I'm pretty sure you only got one name on that list, and it was like, okay, great, cool. I'm like crazy busy with all these meetings with venture capitalists these days. Ow, ow, ow. Fucking assholes. So. Well, that could, well, um, Tell you what, let me think about still it. a pretty good deal right. here. Take the right. shitty killer. We get D, D back. Awesome. Is that a gunshot? Uh, well, that, I think that's separate. I'm pretty sure that's their dealing with them. So I asked him what's his deal with them, and he wanted that from them. Basically a life for life type of shit with them. Which, if that's what he's already dealing with at this point, truthfully, I don't think it really matters about anything with this fucking flower because they're already in a different situation with it. He already wants that, which is within the flower, which is the highway band, is it not? Yes. Or his life force, whatever the fuck it is. So, to me, it kind of sounded like Pez wants it out of him anyway, so why are we truly doing anything with that to begin with? Well, we almost feels like a dono here might be the best strategy, truthfully. A dono? A dono. What? A dono wall or a donation of a life? A dono, show, dono wall. 
Sorry, not a donation of what? Like. You want to dono wall Norman bones? No, I want to dono wall the fucking flower. Ah. Because essentially, if you go with the flower, guess what's going to happen? The entire fucking PD is going to be there. You have air, you have water. Barry and I talked about this extensively. I'm like, Barry, what is actually your plan? If you have any sense of going in there, you have two options to get in there. He's like, oh, let's just put up a ramp, ramp in, ramp out. I'm like, are you, are you, are you done? I have ramps. I, I understand that. I sell you ramps, more ramps. Right, right. I, I get that. I get that. Ramps ramps the the entirety of the PD is going to be there. Because I think they're taking something that belongs to a PD member. A flower. Really think the entirety of the PD is going to get their panties and bunch over a flower. Yeah, I do actually. Well, yeah, that and it, well, I think you're maybe overestimating a little bit. Because, you know, let's say we start and appro we approach it and we get in there. It's all the way up and up north, so we have plenty of time to get that thing to go. One cunt with a dragon off could do a lot of work. I think there's better options right now with it. You didn't make some sort of deal so that I'd be able to talk to Dee, did you? Me? No. Did you make a deal? Period? Nope. nope. Interesting well, when you have some background with that shit to begin with. Yeah. How much time is that on that they boost? Have... Uh, not much at all. Okay. All right, let's do it. Let's go. I just need you to join my group. I'm trying to get my... Yes, yeah, so I'm trying to get my laptop off. I can't get in my pockets because I'm sorry. Yeah, no deal was made. Right, chat? Smile. Smilers. I do like the way you work it. Freddy's mask. I need 16 genie, please. I got you. And 199.5. There you go. Okay. Yeah, except Wolf, I think the mentality is enough and like no deals with him, like.
Oh no, the G-Wagon's coming. Soon. I don't believe TJ, by the way. You don't believe him? <laughs> How's that? When he said he didn't make a deal. Uh, I don't believe him. Is that just your gut? The way he said no, just like hair on the back of my neck stood up. <sighs> okay. That's a fucking G wagon. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Get on a radio. 199.5. Your, your stuff is there. We're on what, sorry? Hacking tool. 199.5. All right, and be aware that a crocodile looks. Right. Oh, uh, yeah. Cleo's gonna be pissed for stealing her car. The for sure on the door? TJ? 100%. Wait, is TJ coming on this? Where the fuck is he? Yeah. Oh, you are here. Good, just double check. Uh huh. Are you able to help us if we need it? Yes, sir. Thanks. Might as well get involved uh -huh, anyway. It's an A. Plus. Uh, Cops are gonna be yeah, on. I'll us. be, uh. I'll be on radio. I'm in the group. Yeah, yeah. Um. Uh, need, like, pickups or whatever. Right, let's go. We'll, uh, I'll grab you. I'm gonna send it, okay? Give it up. Uh, Colin, take the hacking tool off of Nancy once she's done with it. Put on the glovey when you're ready. Oh, that's... Did that get fucking faster? Is this an A plus or an S plus? What is this? It's an A plus. A plus. A plus. Huh? Put on the glovey? Okay. I'm not- I didn't get it. All, All good. All good. Chill. I'm getting like I'm not getting 10 seconds. That's why I was like, why did that go by so fast? I thought I used to get 30. Uh, you should, yeah. It's running A, right? A plus. Yep. Yeah. Send all the way uh, westbound to Middle Park, okay? All right. I'm gonna try and drive uh, pretty safe because Nancy is uh, doing the tracking. Like head back to the building and just put this shit away. Yep. I'm getting 30 seconds on these hacks, so it should be fine, but I think the second one's got to. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, are you talking about getting into it? Yeah. Is that only 10? Um, is it the, is it a AMG? No, it's the yeah. G-Wagon. Yeah, G-Wagon, for some reason, is like that. I do, that was the first oh, okay. one I ever tried. Uh, All right, okay. so yes. Sirens around altar. Yep, I'm just gonna do the regular loop column. I'll go to Greenbridge from Mirror Park. Okay. Nice to see you guys. 
I'll stay quite far behind you. Thank you. Uh huh. Two mirror packs at a bike from the other right. There's an explorer behind apartments here. It's on. I'm on to make it. Up. I think there's still lots of good music being made today. I go and find it. Roger that. is actually here. Just getting off Green Bridge, gonna continue on to Del Perro. Uh, there's an explorer going medium. south of Little Soul right now. Should be good. There's another one sitting outside of apartments. They're just there's one going yeah, south on Calais Ave right now, to, like past Uwu, towards Tuner. I'm just at this point right now, I'm gonna go eastbound. PDM. I saw you, TJ. I saw you above me, my rear view. There's a cop car at GG gas station. Uh, I'll go look at it and follow it. On the bridge, though. I'm staying on like, going east out of the city, sort of. U turn and go back the opposite way. Explore at impound lot. Explore leaving uh, Viceroy Hospital, heading north up Alameda for okay. a little so. CVPI is going on Lucian Fields, CV getting it back to Greenbridge. Yeah, CVPI at Cerberus Building, heading towards Burger Shop. Yep. Stick inside of the city. Yeah, I don't know if they're doing much. I just saw like four leave MRPD. It doesn't really seem I, like I just, they're... I just saw like five cop cars, a little uh, soldier chasing a white car. I'm in a white car. Stay away from the uh, Alpha. Yep. Okay, there's a charger leaving. Uh, yo, they also have an UC charger, like an S plus one. What the fuck? Oh. Uh, it's going to Olympic. Underneath Olympic, yeah, to the south I'm side. Olympic. Yeah, they're going to the south side too. I mean, UC charger and. At least I think so. I mean, I don't know. This thing was definitely an S plus fucking gauntlet looking thing. Right, I'm gonna go like north of Red Garage and then go on to uh, go that there's way. An, there's an explorer sitting right outside Cerberus. They're chasing a car at the like fucking Davis skate park, GSF. Oh.
bum 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 Good shit, Nancy. Keep it up. Okay, we're on Olympic right now. No, sorry, Delco. Gonna be passing pillbox exit. With five of ten. Explore at Cerberus. Yep, six of ten. Nancy's killing it. He's heading up north towards taxi rank on uh, San Andreas. Sorry, Alpha. Yep, I'm just above Otto's. I'm off of uh, Del Perro. On Mirror Park Boulevard now. Gonna be heading past the oil fields in a moment. Have fun in there. Don't talk to strangers. I don't have one. Oh, what's up? Someone's sure to ask for it. We got a bar. Have fun, all right? Have fun. Goodbye. Hi, wait, wait, wait. What's up? Do you have a VPN? Do I have a VPN on me? Yeah, yeah, what's up? Can we borrow it? Seven of ten. Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, Literally all four of us. Let us have a fucking VPN. <laughs> you fucking get it. Glovey, 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 glovey. Fuck, kidding me. Hey, would you sell this car? Fuck no. Fuck, man. It's my dream car, bro. You don't need anyone, you don't need anyone selling it me? or trying to get rid of theirs? Uh, no. There's only like five in the city, so. I bought mine okay, for 800k. This shit's crazy. Yeah, you're a lucky fucker. Yeah, you I fucking me? know it, bro. <laughs> Wait, let me get out. Uh, invite me. Green bridge currently again. Yo, hold on, I'm hitting a bank with GG right now. Give me a sec. Also got bank city codes, by the way. Uh, four cars chasing a silver looking car. Five cars. I'm actually U turn on Green Bridge and go back the opposite way. We've got a big, um, we've got a big delay. So seven, seven, it. one, three, one. Have fun. Yeah, thank you. Hey, no worries, happy to help. I hit a bank, I hit a bit. Uh, that's a, that's why I'm high command. Hit a bank, mid A plus move. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're now heading east on uh, Greenbridge. We're gonna be part of the tuna shop right now. Yeah, I like Marty and I like Marty and Cookie as well. Colin's not really had a bad interaction with either of them. Mm. I can't go again. west on uh, Dutch Pond towards Maze Bank. I think it's that chase. Killed. I think it's twelve four months, cutie. CVPI passing ammunition by the rentals. The rentals charger box. by Mega Mall. Yeah. There's a shit ton of cops by Forum Drive. Looks like a shooting, so stay away from it. Oh, yeah. Cops are being shot. I'm at this bitch. Yeah, we got one hack again. Are we done? Oh, yeah. Top of Oh, oh shit, let's go. Explorer at uh, Fleeker Bank across from Motel. I'll pick you guys up. What did the DJ name his two kids? Ricky and Eric. That's good. That's a good joke. Ricky?
Rick him, Rick him. Fancy seeing Newt here. Come here often. Yeah. Yeah, it's usually I come to just publicly masturbate. You? Um, that's where I come to publicly watch. <laughs> Park looks clear. Oh, we're out. Thank you. Oh, you're already out. Fucking Thanks for the pickup. How'd your bank go? Pretty good. Huh? Yeah, hit with Marty and the gang. What'd you do? Um, they got the codes, but none of them had a VPN because it broke. So they were standing oh. there because they all need to be in the, you know, heist group where you can't do shit. Yeah. So they were like, Colin, you got a VPN? I'm like, yeah, why? And it's like, police. They just passed it around? Yeah, they did. <laughs> did they give you a cut? No. I let oh. them keep it. Yeah, I think they need it. Yeah, they need it more than you do, for sure. <laughs> That's really funny. Thank you for name. your help, by the way, guys. Appreciate it. Of course. No, I just got an A, a if anybody wants to send it. You have an A as well. Can I just get you left? Available. I got a... Oreo? My mom asked me if I have seen the dog bowl, but I said I didn't know she could do that. That's an awful story. I'm gonna try to start it if you're still up. If it is, it's just a quick B. The fuck is a warrener? I doubt that I can actually get it. I have a B if anybody needs something to scratch you. Yeah. Nah, I can't, uh, can't do anything with it, unfortunately. Alright, never mind. I'm fucking it off. Oh, it's ugly ass. Uh, I got a B. I can Vince Scratch. Yeah, yeah. Just send it into that real quick. Can I grab my laptop back? Sure. Did you start it? Um. Actually, uh, we'll make a new group so that way I don't cock block anyone from getting their Vince crushes. Yep. Join Dean Powell. I need to go get a new dongle. Okay, the, the one person that joined me, nobody else, nobody else. Whoever Hilda is, just, just right, sending it to them. Yeah. Um, Ooh, let's put that tracker no. away. No, I don't actually. I do not have a lockpick of any variety. <laughs> I don't know. I think maybe they're in my car or something. I'll throw the back in the table into the lobby, please. Karen, to give you shit, I also don't have a lot of things. I mean, I can check in the back of my car, but I think it might be in my apartment or something. Where's your car? Uh, it should be here. It's gonna be pushed. Yeah. <sighs> Sleep. Wait. Did Andy say... Hello? 
Hey, Andy, let's go ahead and double check something. Did you is, did you say that this meeting's after this storm or tomorrow after that storm? Oh, I was wondering why you were leaving. Uh, after this next storm. The, like, so the one that's in, in coming. In a couple hours. All right, bet. No worries. Yeah. All right, see you. Bye-bye. It's an hour after. Bye, okay. Guys. Thank bye you. Bye-bye. Any luck? Yeah, I have an advance. Do you want it? Oh fucking Jesus face, get the shit that out of me. scared the fuck out of me. What, was like, where the fuck is that? Where the fuck have you been? Just lurking in alleys, huh? Hi. Hey, how's Huh? Hello. Hello. Oh, hi. Hi, what's up? Oh, live my best life. Is anyone else on the Yeah, no. Antonio and TJ. We're all uh, kind of working together to boost at the moment. Get on, um, um 199.5. Uh, you sound like shit. Are you okay? I just woke up. Oh. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, you, you, you sound great. Yeah, thing. You give your time, wake up. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> Women gamming up on me. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Bought you something yesterday. What'd you get? Maybe it was the other day. One of the days you were gone, I was thinking about you and I bought you some stuff. Oh, yeah. I love that. Hello? Jesus Christ. Fuck me. I planned oh. you, yeah. Yeah, we're on here. Jesus! Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, I got really sad, so I went and bought shit. Sad equals horny question mark. Well, you were gone, and the 48 hours was up, and then you left me. It's very inconsiderate timing. I'll apologize to your vagina later. Thank you. What's the car? A big old piece of shit. Can you give me my laptop back to you? Because I have a. Do you want to see how much time slept on? Yep. Oh, I got 45 minutes left on mine. And it's only four to scratch. Uh, so far. Perfect. Just slam van. He said Faye, I'm pretty sure, at the end of that. I think he said Nancy. You got I did it at a Pleaka the other day. Eight months without even a kiss. Mm -hmm. Shout her out. Chat's out here backing me up. This is the worst thing I've ever had to drive. Is it electric? I believe it is. Uh, 
I get it. I get it. Funny. Get it. Nancy's lost the plot. It's like too generic for me to understand specifically what you're referring to. I need to get a fucking 5G ring. I need to get mine repaired. I don't know what the fuck they're talking about. I don't know where to go. I've been scratched by Pyotos. Yeah, I can't remember where it is. Now I'm lost. Wow. Driving down the auto street. Lost. Sad. All right, Brox. Thanks for stopping, but I really appreciate you. Always nice to bump in, man. I'll be out. I'll be out in a sec. Okay. Thanks to one of Brock's. With the man, the legend. Never thought I'd ever see Brock's in my chat. It's in the billabong. Because I'm a giant shitter, and he's the one, like one of the nicest dudes on earth. Looking thing all blacked out looking for BBMC people. He just passed a Tell him to call me. Oh, I didn't. He just he's left, but uh, yeah, he's just going around asking a bunch of random people if they're BBMC. Yeah, hmm. he said bad words and then bad words about BMC and he's left. So I'm just letting you know that somebody was looking to shoot you guys. Shit, yeah, alright. Uh, do you have any idea who it was? Nah, gangbanger and the mask. They're all the same. Shit, alright, thanks, Shadowbox. Here we go, alright? Okay, you too, bye! Bye. -bye. Nancy, can you teach us, man, how to use spreadsheets? Colin? Yes. <laughs> Look, I spread. You know I, spre use spreadsheets? I spread Nancy on the sheets. No, 20. not spreading cheeks, bro. Oh, yeah, he spreads oh, spread my sheets. Spread oh, oh, okay. Not oh, cheeks. Very good at it. Sheets, not spread cheeks. I keep hearing spread cheeks. Okay. Spread. Spread me in the sheet? He does that too. Oh boy. Nancy! What? I am not trying to have any sort of thought about y'all's relationship and what y'all do in extracurricular activities, alright? Alright. You look like I'm a ghost, Nancy. Yeah. Yep, 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 
Nancy? I'm gonna take a piss before we go. send this. Uh, I'm gonna go get a fake plate for the CDPI. Not that it truly matters, but I'm still gonna do it. All that is in trust, Chatter. Especially because of this weird shit Kirk's been doing. Ow, my feet hurt. Ow, my back hurts. All right, I'm ready to go. Just waiting for the thermite. Pigeon's coming down. You want me to go see if we have okay. any? Uh, no, I'm buying it anyway. It's all good. Mm, okay. Oh, I don't even need to bring a gun or a dongle if you die. Nope. Oh, where's the um, two tools? Oh, I've got uh, going to be later tonight. Yep. They're safe, though. Thanks for tier one. Get a couple of bands for packets. Yep. We could be using my car. I'm gonna take your car. I need to figure out. What to put on Sweets' Explorer license plate. Colin, I'm fucking coming! Nighthawk, thanks for the 10 2 ones. What the? 
Yo, Mambo! Thanks for the five two ones, you fucking little. MCR with five more tier ones. Whoa. On the bus. Is that a? That was a black Range Rover. <laughs> Saren, thanks for five tier ones. Bomb after bomb, man. Ah, that's hot. Oh, the hype train's about to roll out, chat. It's gonna do it. This city's cold and empty. No one's around around me. I look at this thing. Let's go, go. Oh, oh. I said, ooh. I'm blinded by the lights. Man. Why? Huh? as always. Just be heads. I, uh, I got a call from Chatter. Apparently there's someone in a Range Rover driving around asking for BBMC, so just keep an eye on that. Oh, split size is marked okay. on the map? Biddies, thank you. Get your biddies out for the guys in the back. Oh, chat, you're crushing it. Oh. Baz shake to 20 hours whip wiggle to 2.7k subs Baz shake to 20 hours whip wiggle to 2.7k subs right. Sounds like the range thing is a mad man And Lindsay just got a 1k bits Baz Look at that Nancy question come here Okay <laughs> Your late night booty call thanks for the five tier ones Have you ever heard Chatterboxes that not clown voice it's fucked up it's weird bro i just talked to him he's like you don't even know who this is i'm like yeah i don't really he's like it's uh. me he put his mask on i'm like fuck me oh my fuck yeah no, what no uh. yeah, it's yeah, weird it it's weird here like that yeah yeah it really fucked me up my god the pigeon make it here yet there he is there That's we go a black range rover with a guy in it What up, Pigeon? Hello, oh, that's a black Range Rover. All right, we get to go. Oh, that's a black Range Rover. We're going to take all five just in case. I'll take all five just in case. Fuck it. Inside the bank? Yeah, he wants me to do thermite. Oh shit, well, you definitely should be in the bank then. Uh, can someone get the hostage, please? Yeah, I'm gonna give you an end. Oh, fuck, I'll just go find one. Yo, uh, do you have a group up? I do, yes. 
Or are you guys already full cool, cool. Yeah, I don't see what No, no. Alright. Two, four, four, two, 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 two zero four seven, please. Gotcha. English is good, right? Uh, yeah. Sometimes. Oh my god, that explorer just took that fucking guy out. I just told TJ not to talk to Norman while he's been drinking. What? He was drunk when DJ's he- DJ's been drinking. No, he wasn't drunk yesterday. He's he's drinking now and talking about him, and I've just said, please do not talk to him when you're like this. Pretty solid advice. In the event that we have to, uh, I'll uh, leave Nancy with the stuff and she can get out and swap cars and, you know, this, that. Hey, alright, pal. Is our first bank? Yeah, right, fella. Oh, I think we've done a bank before. Have we? I think so. Maybe. You still owe me that bank fee. I do. You, me, catering. Romance. Mark Bills. Careful, I'm starting to chub up. <laughs> we did a jewelry store together, but I don't think we've done a bank. That ju oh my god, that was a jewelry store with all the fucking Helions. That was fun as shit. Mm -hmm. That was fun. Although that turned into one of the longest fucking chases I've been in a hot minute. That was like a two hour chase. Yeah. And I was the only one with a gun on the hostage, and everyone was like, what are you doing? I'm like, keeping a gun on the hostage. I caved and bought a 5G ring. Yay! Whoa. That is life. Best decision you'll make. Join us, eh? The hostage looking. Not great. Come on, where are all these lonely cunts? Old panic. Normally this is like a conveyor belt for hostages over Yeah, here. exactly. They're all gold panic. Hmm. Mm. I could just go to any local waterway and find one, I'm I'm gonna sure. go check the Spoochie Beach. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually a really good call. Your uh, fish sales is what I remember is people go all the damn time with gold pan. Appreciate the big train chat. I really appreciate you doing a subathon. It's been, I'm, I'm really enjoying it. I, I'm doing one last little test with my, the other microphone, and if not, I'm gonna have to buy a brand new one. Any luck on the beach? No, it's empty. Back to Burger Shop. I'm gonna check Uwu. The city bolt is open. Oh, it just closed. We're good. Okay, there's three people in Burger Shop. I'm gonna wait for one to come out. Okay. HOA is doing a bank right now, they have zero pat response. I tried to go yoink their hostage. No, I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, they're doing a bank. So they literally got zero response. Um...
Hi. My God. Hey, I was about to disjoint you. Fucking <laughs> Faye <laughs> hostage. Come on, fella. Oh my Let's God. Go. Hurry the fuck up. Quit conversing and getting to know people. Little soul, but I think they were beating each other up, so I didn't really want to deal with that. Take this cannon a fucking jugular. Bring it on, baby. <laughs> this guy just said, I'm in a good mood. I'm about to go get expunged. I fucking, so I come out of the burger shop for yet? all their meals, we're going to take a hostage. What's the plan? Give it two, two seconds. <laughs> Angry as bean. Oh, that billboard at nighttime is even better. It does it way more obvious. Uh huh. What did Chatterbox say? Someone in a black Range Rover. One person in it was looking for BBMC, but I'm pretty sure it was oh. Pigeon. Oh. oh my god, he walked in and then walked back. In a Come on, cunt. A Kiki? Uh -huh. I don't want to kidnap a medic. That's that's terrorism. Oh, I'm just getting the guy. But he keeps going back and paying for their fucking meals because he's in such a good mood. Well, let's ruin his fucking uh -huh. day. His mood's about to be really shit on real quick. He said he's in a really good mood because he's about to go get expunged. <laughs> well, he's about to get his fucking... Yo! Oi! Get off the phone. Get off the phone, uh, get off the phone and get in the truck. Let's I'm go. getting. I'm uh, getting kidnapped. Get off the fucking phone. I didn't say keep we talking to your fucking friend. Hell get yeah, in the car. Hell yeah. <laughs> Uh, the stuff is in the glove box, Nancy. Alright, buddy. Appreciate you being so hospitable. Hold on, I'm just gonna check him for a gun. One sec. Come here, buddy. Yeah, no worries. Get a little closer than that. <laughs> he's running away. Yeah, he's running away. Sorry, he's running. He's running. I'm shooting. I'm shooting. Cringe. Cringe. Hopefully, <laughs> there's lots of money on him. Oh, you don't have a taser. It's fine. Oh, my, my, my $45. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm Rich. real damn bad right now. <laughs> I'm gonna go to GG and fuel up. Yep. I need the code. Are they in the bodies here? They're in the inner. Did you get the hostage? Yeah, yeah, we're in the bank. <gasps> Jeez. Oh, I this world. Oi. What are Mats R Us? Who the fuck is Jack Higgins?
American Hello. Beach Crew. What do you want? Wow, okay. You remember who I am? No, I don't know who you are. What do you want? Uh, okay, I was gonna do shit at, when you were at the prison, get sent up all the time, but anyway. Um, oh, f okay. Yeah, what's up? Yeah. Hey, uh, are you guys associated with the HOA? Um, what do you mean associated with? What, do you, what, what, what the <laughs> fuck does that mean? Do I, just got, I just got kidnapped by a group of HOA people for just right now. That burp shot. That burp? Oh, like, okay. Yeah, I didn't. They didn't give me their names, but I didn't know if you guys like had any beef with them or anything. No, no beef at all. Okay. Damn. Because they took they took a uh, my, my other fellow officer with her to, with them to with someone else. I was just trying to see if you knew them by any chance, like a guy with a great green do rag cowboy hat, weird looking mask. Are you asking me to, to to tell you who kidnapped you? Maybe. Fuck off, you dog. You will not believe the phone call I just fucking had. Who? So the HOA hostage um, Jack, whatever the fuck, just called me and was like, yeah, do you have beef with HOA as BBMC? And I was like, no, why? And, uh, he was like, I'm trying to figure out who kidnapped me. Because he also had one of my, he, they also, like, did it in front of an officer. And he was like, can you tell me who you think kidnapped me? I was like, Wh what? What? Are you, you are, are you trying to ask me to see? Snitch, you fucking moron. <laughs> Got the first door. Congrats, hold on. Good job, Nancy. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call um, hey, uh, HOA and just like tell them what just happened. Give me a sec. Yeah. Hello. Hi, Andy. For the third time, how are you? What's up? Um, oh, I'm good. How are you? Fantastic. Uh, did HOA just hit Great. a bank? <laughs> yeah, why? Uh, did, did you kidnap an officer? Uh, some DOC guy. Yeah, so... You're gonna, you're gonna love this, Andy. You're gonna love, oh. you're gonna, you're gonna love oh. this. He calls me <laughs> and he says, Hey, C Colin, you have any beef with it? Does, Car, be quiet. Is BBMC yes, on, beefing with HOA? And I was like, no, not to my knowledge, why? What? And he was like, because a bunch of HOA just kidnapped me as a hostage for a bank. And I was like, oh, okay. And he was like, yeah. Okay, and? And it was in, <laughs> yeah, I know. I was like, okay, fine, and? And he was like, oh, you know, there's another, in like. In front of Burger it, Shot. Yeah, in front of Burger Shot. And he was like, <laughs> he was like, this is what they're wearing. Can you tell me who it was? I was like, are you asking me to, to snitch? Are you asking me? What? I was like, <laughs> I just told him to fuck off and called him a dog and hung out, but I thought I'd let you know. What? Name, he was trying to. He was trying to get me to. What the fuck are you doing, Stanley? He was basically trying to get me to like give a guess on which HOA member fucking kidnapped him so I could snitch and maybe call the cops. I was like, you are a fucking. He moron. called you so that you can snitch on us for doing a bank job. <laughs> Who is this fucking idiot? His name's what? Jack. Dude, Jack something. Jack, Jack what? Jack Higgins. Jack Higgins. I'm gonna go back and shoot that guy. Yeah, I would. What the uh, fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, he calls a gang? Yep. To fucking. Bro. I literally was like, he asked me to say, she was like, maybe. But I was like, you're an idiot. Bye bye. Maybe. I was like, yeah. So, you know, so I let you know. Have fun with that. I got it, Stanley. <gasps> okay. Well, thank you for letting me know, well, Colin. Have fun, Andy. Bye bye. <laughs> All right. Bye bye. Uh, yeah, what, you, you think that's worked calling up another gang and be like, do you know who this might have been? Probably. No! A, well, actually, probably GSF. Ouch. <laughs> okay. Or SN. I could do that again, to be honest. I still have, I, you know what, I've seen them like three times since I reward. That's it. Totally clear out here, by the way. 
Oh yeah, no, I'm, I am not taking this seriously. What the fuck, bro? Neither the cops, apparently. Cops showing, showing. Don't be, don't be silly. <laughs> Maybe if my cousin was on duty, should he get done? But otherwise, nothing really does. Okay, okay. You're gonna use getaway then. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say that out loud? Yeah, you did. Oh, I, I ain't gonna take shit from a fucking former motor unit. Get the fuck out of here. The best one there was, okay? Uh, Calm down. Doesn't know how to drive, becomes a motor unit, the classic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> doesn't know how to drive. You know how fucking gate kept SRU was during my time? Obviously, I don't. Why, I why would I? <laughs> Wait, what do you say, Nancy? Just always forgot you were a cop. Yeah. Sick, dark, demented TJ. Former cop. Ask me. Fuck this vault door. I'm dead. Fun. Five minutes, right? <laughs> 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 like I the said. Hostage, like, Jesus fucking Christ. Easy we'll getaway. five minutes, right? Yeah, okay. I hit a bike. I'm okay with this. I'm okay. I literally, I'm just happy I'm alive. Chad, that clip? No. DJ, you, you remember ages back when I hit you with um, Henrietta on, when you were a bike guard on the unit? That led to me being shot. Yeah. yeah. To this to this day, I still I I didn't hit you on purpose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's funny how things uh, ripple throughout time, right, Colin? You know. <laughs> God forbid, uh, some asshole judge, you know, and uh, some dickhead chief of police and trooper decides to ocean dump uh, Dundee, yeah, right? Yeah, it's, it's... It's crazy how mm. things just go. I have one, one for my left. I lost that one by literally 0.1 seconds. If anybody wanted to take it over just to we actually get it. Fine to, I'm fine to do it, and I'll even pay you guys back for all of this if we don't get it, but, like, it gets harder every time you fail, so it's... It's all you. Can if you have to. Oh, if she fails this, I'm gonna have to be super supportive, Colin, be like, it's fine. It happens to the best of us. It was just, it was too many squares at that point. I, sorry, guys. Okay. Oh, good. No worries. It's good practice. Oh, good. Shit happens. We'll take old mate to, uh, don't get shot. Listen, don't worry about it. I'll get it. I'll get it. Just tell me how much I owe for all that. Ain't about money. Not like we didn't ask you to do it, right? Yeah, don't worry about it. It's a, uh, every once in a while, people do jobs and it just doesn't go right. They said it was the same Who's as the Flika, and it's not the same as the Flika. Oh, good luck. Oh, dear. They're trying, their explorer is blowing the fuck up. Uh, I'm excited for this MC meeting, uh, chat. Uh, uh. <laughs> Barbecue, thanks to the five. Hey, Core, thanks to the five.
check it on me. Yeah. Hey, come on now. Don't beat yourself up. It's, it's just so frustrating. I had it like twice. I'm just too slow on both of them. By like, like I had, I had clicked the square, the final square. I clicked it and it didn't accept it. Like I said, things happen. Dundee, what? Dundee's been doing thermite for ages and he fucking shit the bed on one. Okay, that's Dundee. For another one, included. try again. Can well, Dundee use like fucking 15 sticks in one bank? Yeah. Need the thermite. That's why, you know, you doing this is sure. really water out of the bridge. It's. Shit happens. Yeah, but I was like, I don't have any more and I don't have any more money. Like, cool, I was able to do bank hacks, and like, cool, I was able to do boost hacks. And then it was just like, I only needed two, and I couldn't even do it with five. Well, we'll just get it on the next one. Yeah. It's annoying. I've, I've done fucking jobs where it's like, oh, this is just a nice, quick, easy B boost. I can draw away from this, no problem. Bang. I'm in jail. I'm dead It just happens. Those jobs just don't go well. Only thing you can really do is take it as a learning experience. No? Yeah. I mean, you nailed the A plus boost. I failed. Twice. And? Dude, what does that matter? Mm. Gotta keep practicing. The great A plus hacker would be failed twice. That's fine. I mean, if it makes you feel better, I got forty five bucks off that hostage. Well, one sixth of that is mine. I'll see. Yeah, I'll split it with you. What's your lucky number? Put a half half, don't tell the club. Okay. Make sure not to spend that all in one place, alright? Lost a hundred thousand dollars today. Jesus Christ. How'd you do that? Dice God. You gotta stop. He called me. And say no, I don't said, I don't wanna gamba. He said he said you're the only person in the city with balls enough to face Dice God, Nancy. And I was like, alright, great. And then he fucking rocked up in his sick car, and then he pulled out a trident. Remember the trident? Yeah, which is dope. There's new special effects where there's a tornado of water that surrounds him and lightning coming down from the sky. That's fucking cool as shit. It's the fucking coolest thing I've ever seen. I want to rob there's it. There's thunder and lightning and sounds, and but he has a seaside a ringtone that plays because people phone him when he shows up to different... Oh Location, so it's intro music. <laughs> that is dope. I want that. Yes, you need to see Dice God in all his glory. That is actually fucking cool as shit. I think there's gonna be another. Hello. Hey. Hi. Don't worry about fucking failing, okay? How much was it? Just gotta get some. Don't food. worry about it. It's okay. It's not okay. It's fine. It's fine. You know, it's practice for when we need you next time. You'll be able to do it. Yeah, when we need you in Kids. 14 minutes when we're getting these codes. Sure. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. You up for that base city, right? I'd, I'd literally do... I'm I'd go and get more thermite, but I, I can't right now. Tits. So it's all good. No stress. I did win one round against Dice God. And then you doubled down. Dice God? No, and he asked... Oh, do you know about Dice God, Antonio? No. Nicholas Simone, aka Dice God. Di Dice God. He, um, I don't know what that is. Top kicks you, Beth. Run, Beth. Run, Beth. Run, my bow. Oh. 
You know what death rolls are? Yeah, it's an easy way for me to lose money, which I don't have. I've lost two hundred thousand dollars rolling what the fuck? rolling dice with him in the last three days. Oh, that makes me feel less worried about what I have now. Yeah. <laughs> I have twelve thousand dollars. Oh fuck. Well, you did choose to gamble. True. Wait, you gambled too? Sometimes. He doth gaze upon the field and he maketh a plan. To be honest, if you, did, if you didn't do the thermite, then I would have tried to do it and I would have failed too. So don't worry. I, I got one. I know. And I got one. I was so fucking close I, I, to getting the I other just, one. I even clicked the square. I pay you back my debt. You gamble it. <laughs> That's exactly what oh. I did, to be honest. If yeah, she gave me money for the demo, I'd probably gamble it. Actually, no, I wouldn't. I can't. I'm saying oh, because I'm very cool. Did I have to gamble that last time you're No, no, no. You got a problem. <laughs> it's just Ice God. It's just Ice God. You know how I yeah, stop myself from gambling? I'm too lazy to get a new membership card, so I don't go to the casino. Our accountant that brought up with me. He went through every single... Ham, so thanks to your one. Cold things are 666 bits. Um, Don't like that. That anybody has done since July and August. And he came. <laughs> he asked me the other day. He said, Nancy, there's $100,000 here from your business called Gamba. What, like, what's, <laughs> why did you take out $100,000 to Gamba with? And I was like, well, it's the day that we thought Lang died. And oh, he put $100,000 on five tier one. in his honor. And he knows. And he won't be mad. <laughs> and he's like, okay. I don't understand how you guys operate as a company. So it's like, well. Who made this? It's a tribute. Who made, made him a roulette cake for his birthday. Who made he this? really likes roulette. Her accountant was not happy. Lang shot him in the kneecaps. Go from my bow. That's true, though. I might actually wake up later and do some racing, make some money. You gonna be awake for that MC meeting? Mm, yeah, hopefully. After, after, an hour after tsunami. What do you call a deer with okay. no eyes? Yeah. Like, oh, I'll be no hours. idea. Yeah. 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 I wonder if um, anyone from BDM is going to be there. Probably not. Hmm, that would be funny. Look too bad, how bad you go. I'll try to bend my bow. I'll try to my bow. No idea. That's a terrible joke. Joe, you need to think about your life. Um, do you want to do some Dota runs, Nancy? Sure. Okay, I might, uh, I might go make some money. Uh, have fun with Dota. I will, thank you. Alrighty. Go gold panning. Make money. Okay. Thank you for inviting me, by the way. I know that's yeah. like something I can I can knock out of the park every time. Well, you have the third mod down. Don't worry. Practice, practice, practice. I have, a, I have. A... I also, if you guys need people on the inside of Fleekas, I'm real good at Fleekas. So. It's not okay. that. Remember when I went? And, anyway. Remember when I went and did VAR? I was able to hack the VAR first try. Oh shit! And I tried again and I couldn't. Your shoes too big? No. Are your shoes untied? Sometimes. Uh, I, don't, I don't have laces, so I think. Oh, oh no, I do. They're just tucked in. Why did the whale blush? He saw the ocean's bottom. A a a a. Jesus Christ. Did I cut off your toe one time as well? Nope. My toes are here. I shot a guy's toe off once. This 
This medieval remix is fucking top tier. I'm telling you, little soul needs toy robot team in the bar. You alright, Puddin? Popping? Oh, I'm head popping. Take me, phase me up, chat. Phase me up. Oh, Deus. Oh, in a bad romance. I don't really like this remix. Chrysler. Donut emote. No, please. You can't spell advertisements without semen between the tits. Nice. It's good. I like that. Let me in! Oh, chat. Alcohol's bad. Why do I keep drinking it? What's wrong with me? Why are you cooked? You really have to hand it to blind hookers. That's good, I like that. Fireball, gross. Five students all day, and I haven't talked to an adult in three days. Well, you've come to the wrong place. Oh my god, that was disgusting.
So this bear wakes up in the spring and he hasn't had a drink all winter. So he wanders down to town and heads to the nearest bar. He walks in and orders a beer. The bartender says, I'm sorry, we don't serve bears beer in this here bar. The bear roars and says, if you don't get me a beer, I'm going to eat someone. And the bartender says, look, threats will get you nowhere. We don't serve bears beer in this here bar. So the bear turns around and eats the woman next to him in one big bite. What? <laughs> Bartender says, I'm afraid you're going to have to leave, bear. We don't tolerate drug use here. The bear roars, what? And the bartender says, bear, don't you know that's a bar bitch you ate? <laughs> I'm big. Hi. Sorry about that. Uh, Colin, can I get those two tools back? I'm gonna go to sleep. Oh, sure. I'll go get them now. Please. One second, Nancy. I'll be right back. All right. I don't get it. Oh, okay. There you go, okay. Sorry, it clicked. I'm very, I'm very hungover and tired. Oh, gross chat. A Honda Civic Type R. Bill. <laughs> Revenant Kangaroo, thanks to fight here once, you fucking little. Mm. Sure to thank Reverend everybody and give them a, a, a little kiss. Where the fuck did I get that? Yeah, I'm hungry. Heck, that's cute. I wonder if we had gone war with this war with the stable where we'd be. I keep going, sorry. I know he's doing bad things. I know he's done horrific things to people here, but thanks for coming. It's, it's tough for me to be here. Uh, Stay, in the the well? Stay in the car. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's a storm. Yeah, no worries, kisses. An hour after you said, yeah? Yep. Uh, 
Um, but yeah, FYI, I got bank codes again. So <laughs> what a part to it. <laughs> wow, I joked and it happened. Uh, yep. Uh, <laughs> the thing is, I, I don't think we off. have thermite. I can probably call around if I need to. Oh, good call, go ahead. Up to you guys' side. Oh, I'll choose bags over a fucking door already. Uh, we Uh. Yeah, got a got a job there. Uh. Uh. He's a fancy boy. Uh. Easy yeah. money, baby. True. True. Um. Uh, yeah. So what was about him wanting more people awake, or whatever? That's you left. Pardon? Remember when we met with Bundy and Norman was like, "More of you awake." You guys. Oh, uh, apparently he has good news for us when there's more of us awake. He said uh, he says at least majority of like five jackets. But... And he wanted to sell all of you at the same time. Yeah. Um, good news from death. Okay. Yeah, death does not ever come bearing good news. Good for him, maybe. What if he is just like, you know what, folks? I have decided to go to Turks and Caicos. I'm retiring. I need a tan <laughs> and <Yeah>. some cocktails. <laughs> yeah, good luck. Hey, I'll send you a postcard, motherfuckers. Yeah, he's like, yeah. hey, you know what? I'm cashing you in my what? 401k. Here's and the. I'm, I'm out. Bye bye. <laughs> this was a mistake. Dundee is really annoying. <laughs> He won't <laughs> shut the fuck up, honestly. How did you guys up? put he's, up with it for that he's long? He's yelling. He keeps asking for megaphones. <laughs> uh, God. Please take him away. When he realized you. he couldn't hit banks or race in the afterlife, he was like, I'm out. Get me out of here. Oh, he's probably miserable because he's having to talk to Cleo all the time. That's exactly what I was about to say. <laughs> Yo, I'm different, bro. This lighthouse situation, share property. Nah, we're good. We out. Don't need this I have to no talk more. to the Bundy Bunch constantly. I'm out, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, I got my own version of hell on earth right now. Like, you thought my shit was bad? Nope. This might be worse. What if Norman's just, like, really upset by Dundee just saying egg is meat? Bro, he's, listen, just, like, he's listening to his takes and takes. he's like, you know, <laughs> yeah. he's like, I can't die, but I wish I was dead. Yeah. <laughs> Just listening to all his terrible food takes, and he's like, I really can't keep going with this. You know, that would be the deep thing. That would be the deep thing. He's somehow well, gonna, I mean, like, if it's purgatory, annoy his way out of death. If it's purgatory, he, he, he probably just has to do a meth runs back to back, and he's, like, so fucking stressed. <laughs> all you hear is him yelling at. <laughs> oh, no. Um, uh, apparently there was some MC shit today at PDM, yes, by the way. Yes, yes, so that? what's happening is, and I want you there as well, I want as many jackets as possible. Uh, an yeah. hour after Tsunami, there's going to be a big MC meeting, every every single MC. Yeah, apparently, and is, well, uh, did Finn talk to you? Yeah, he, okay, he okay. sent me a lengthy text. Uh, yeah, he's not too happy with it. Yeah, I can tell. I'm going to speak to Edward because, in, in my opinion, Edward here is in the wrong. Yeah, I'm, I'm Did not they call? Speak for anybody else. No? Are you fucking kidding me? Ow! Sorry! All right. What's going on? You don't drive straight into our fucking billy like that. Uh, some guy gave a uh, guy gave us Antonio said it was fine. Fuck's yeah, sake. So Alright, sorry about that. No problem, Colin. It's on the other side, I think, too. Yeah, no, sorry about it's, that. It, yeah, this yeah, whole yeah. Si this it's tough because, like, the fucking markers we get is all over the place. It's hard oh, to yeah, see. no, fuck delivering in the billy. It sucks. Start a war at the HOA right before I have an MC meeting. <laughs> well, that was awkward. Yeah, that's gonna go real fucking well, bro. Oh, uh, they drove into the billy. 
I literally was like, who the fuck are these guys? Hit him with my car. And I'm like, what the fuck? You're supposed to call before you come to the goddamn Billy. And they're like, we called Antonio. And I was like, mm, that's awkward. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, so I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you guys keep talking. Um, uh, I mean, there wasn't too much more with it, but it was, I mean, it was more like, look, if, if, if he know he knows why he was fired though. Right. Uh, something with, okay. I, I don't want to paraphrase this because I'm probably not the right person to tell this story. I got it secondhand from Finn. I'm not, I didn't talk to Ed, which I should talk to Ed to get his side of the story. So I don't want to go between this. So people just need to talk to Ed. That's how I'm going to say it. Something with MCs and bikes and being exclusive. And yeah, he, he was... got fired, not fired, rehired. They threatened to get Cerberus involved at some point because they wanted to make more money on Cliffhanger. So it's no longer exclusive for bidding because they weren't making enough money. Yeah. Finn thinks it's like Bondi till PDM job, civ life, whatever, and is pissed off at Ed. That's a TLDR. I'd rather people talk to Ed about it. Oh, I'm going to talk to Ed about it. Ben. Yeah, I in, don't, in I don't my opinion, if he's if he's hand. pissed because they're fucking around MCs and he's annoyed that he lost his fucking job, tough shit. I lost my uh, I lost well, my job at fucking Hayes. Back. So I don't know. Um, I don't like I said. I don't want to put words on other people's chat. Words, the so meeting is there. in like four I hours. Okay. But uh, yeah, maybe just clarify my situation. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to him. So I don't want to, cause we have a big thing of never really going to the source of people. So you know, just have the actual conversation with people. But anyway. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna go do some <sighs> fucking. Dorky grinding, right? Uh, What's up? Are you going to do dodo? -do? Yeah. All right. I've done my That's crime today. Reach my crime quota. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey. Want to go for a ride? Yeah. Where are we going? To do work. We're not doing that, bank. No. Oh. I was trying to make calls for thermites. Did you find any? Well, I stopped calling because he was like, well, I'm going to get thermite. And I was like, okay. Oh. Well, I think we gave up on that. Oh. Let me just call Pigeon. Uh, I think Pigeon's out because Antonio pretty much said that, uh, uh, he wouldn't be able to source him because Antonio, uh, what's his face is out at the moment. Okay. I mean, there's other people I could call. What kind of fucking... Mingle, you park like a fucking asshole. I'll park you in a grave. Oh, yeah? Mingle, what the fuck? Oh. Fuck you. I see gunfire and coming. I literally saw him reach that, and I was like, "Well, we're getting yeah. we're getting shot." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pingle, Pingle deserved it, honestly. Do, do you have do, food? Do, do. I do not have food. Let's get some food. We're gonna, let's go, let's go. Ooh, we'll never get ooh. Oh, let's go get cute food. I, I could rail back a curry right now. I'm not gonna lie. I could have other things for you to rail. Said that's so shy. I got lost. I got uh, uh, I, vagina. Me, oh. it's me, real me. <laughs> oh, can I, can I? Why can't I hear this dickhead talking? Sir, I'm trying to we're park, not sir. Talking. Sir, I'm trying to park. You're in my way, sir. I'm gonna park my bullet in your head. Sir, excuse me, it's trying to park. Trying to Fuck park. Fuck you, call it! <laughs> sir, I think sir, you're asking could irrationally. Sir, you please move out of the way? Sir, 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 if you could just scooch a little more to the left, I'd appreciate that. Sir, do you need a hug? Colin, I will come down to the billabong and I will blow it to fucking smithereens. Ask me. The only thing that will be blowing in the billy is my dick, bitch. Reckon? <laughs> huh? Do we want to go down this path? I think you'll be going down to my dick, bitch. <laughs> there we go. Thanks, Reggie. Okay. Right, how you doing? What the? the soon. All right, love you, Reggie.
kisses. Nice car. War with Seaside. Yo, yo, two, um, charismatic curry fish. You got it. Uh, just, uh, just the curries or? Yeah, uh, I'll take combos. two combos, two combos. I don't really care what the rest are. What do you want? Yeah, no, right Excited. Swipe there for me. If Reggie oh. shot my tire, I'm fucking flip. Oh, it's class two gun. Um, there it's you go. The and uh, ma'am, I don't know how to say this, but I can see through your face. Yep. Oh, okay. Bye. Why? Jesus. Hey! Oh my fucking god. Oh, what the fuck is wrong with the both of y'all? What the hell? What do you mean you hit her with your bike? It was an accident, twin. What's going on, man? It hurt. I ain't mean it, you know what I'm saying? I just be like, I be doing sick tricks and shit, twin. You know, I did see a pretty that wicked so backflip, I'm not gonna lie. What? see backflip? Yeah, he did a backflip in my eyes. Oh. I ain't do all that, bro. I just did like a little, a little Johnson. You know what I'm saying? Just a little Johnson. Oh shit! All right, well, have a good day, all right? <laughs> this is fine. What? Okay, bye bye. Later. Bye. You on X Games bye. mode? I'm so sad. Amazon is meant to be open. They sell scratch tickets. That sounds addicting. Okay, maybe we don't get those for you. No, I will de I'm definitely getting those. I'm excited because I'm on the board of directors of that company. We finally got some scratch tickets. Nice. Yes. I think they still have Amazon in one other place. Oh, Colin? What? Fancy? Oh. Yeah, my head might be going because you just rammed us into hey. a tree. Hey. Hey. Hey, yo, BBMC, recruit, you know? Mad, thanks for 25 tier ones. I will meet you back here, okay? Okay. Okay. Unless it's you. Oh, I pulled over. I'm chilling. Okay. Nope, it was me. Why am I getting a phone call from Manitoba? Hello? State of Manitoba is calling me, chat. Japanese melon milk. That just makes me think of titty milk. Big Japanese milkers. I'm gonna get Japanese titty milk straight to my door.
Hold on, chat. Now you're in the car. I can't hear you talking. That's weird. Oh, hi. Hi, Roy. Call I actually was muted. I actually was muted, chat. I'm sorry. See, I was so confused. I thought we were going towing. Oh, oh fuck it. Let's go towing. I don't know. I don't mind. I just mean that's where you pulled over for me. So I was like, oh, that must be what we're doing. Why not? She get AK for the boys in the back. Your brain, where were you? I was at my Mega Mall. Yeah. That's not good. Yeah, that's, uh, that's twice I've hit Pop Mountain a bit, so I'm a little. Uh... Now, I don't know if you like my joke. I do like your joke, Joe. I'm, I laugh. I am Wilma Short. saw boobies. Did you? I did. Oh, lucky man. James Charles. That's funny. Get out that old bitch. My... What? 
What? What did you say? Broken megaphone. Yeah, it was yours. Who? Oh my god, we already got a job? Where is it? Uh, it's up by Bob's and PD. Nobody's telling, so. Easy AK. Twirly, that's good. Does anyone sell maple syrup? Canada does. Oh, hmm. Is it the wheelchair? Oh my god. Yeah, it it's this wheelchair. Hell yeah. This is new. Imagine towing in this gold panning age, huh? Yes. I bet the cops called it in too. <laughs> that looks ridiculous. It's no better than a BMX bike, I guess. Bro. <laughs> it's so stupid. Doesn't feel like a devious lick. No. no, you can't sit. I don't think. Very curious how this meeting is gonna go. The MC one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I'm assuming everybody's going to be pissed. Yeah, everybody's I assume gonna it's going to be... Everybody's going to share each other's upsetness. Yeah, it's going to be... Let's blow it up. Okay. And then let's blow it up. Yeah, well... I'm just wondering, because, like, Ed works there. I don't know how he feels about all of this. Um... He should be annoyed. Well, 100%, but, like, also it's a job. It's like, is he gonna try to do something about it? I'm not sure. Be pretty Cause he's on both sides of it right now. I'll be pretty annoyed if he doesn't. <laughs> I'll grab it. Actually, no, you grab it. Your butt? Yeah. Nice. Uh -oh. That that is that's ridiculous. That's, um... That was very silly. Oh. oh, I'm sorry. No, we blew up haze. Oh, I really enjoyed that job, but welcome. Mm -hmm. True, real. Uh, it's uh, always gonna be another job. That looks illegally parked.
the haze days, man. That was cozy vibes. Oh my god, another wheelchair. <laughs> Mark that shit. Oh, the Hayes 500 seems so long ago now. Gotta show you the storefront all finished. That's good. Hey, watch where you're going, asshole! <laughs> He's gonna shoot us. Oh. Oh, oh no. What do you want? Oh, what do you want? No, no, I'm playing. What do you no, want? Play? No, 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 Like Maldini's kind of area. I see him. Need a lift, buddy? Want to jump on the back? Please. Hop on. Jump on the back. Thank you. Where are you going? Mm -hmm. Uh, pawn hub, please. Oh, I suppose. You've been gold panning? What? No. Big I've been robbing houses. Oh, okay. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I've been gold fanning. Oh. <laughs> I, I kind of work there officially, unofficially. What the? How the <sighs> fuck did you get there? Uh, yeah, that you was, had a that massive headache. I guess, I'm, I guess I'm in a rush. Thank you, guys. All right, bye-bye. Okay, bye. Yeah, you had a big You can always uh, hear him before you see him. Mm -hmm. The 
nerds have a car, which is fucking crazy. It's the seven-seater Rolls Royce. I saw it. We've been driving it around recently. It goes like 170 with seven people in it. That is fucked. And a raccoon. It's also a beautiful car. Mm -hmm. You can look a lot better than Monday movie. I know. They have it in Neo Cult Red. Of course, of course they do. That's Marty's. One right here. Oh. Well, I marked it for impound anyways. This car is gone. Damn it. Someone get our job. Appetite's back up there, much. Nice. Topping mug. Very good. Six dress. Thank you. King bong. Someone's got a gun. Did we get it? Oh, no, we didn't. We've got one by... Ooh. And he's got a gun. Oh, I just noticed the food in the buddy. Thank you. Got you. Is it the cop car or the bike? Um, the bike. Oh, the moped? Mm -hmm. See the stack of class twos in front of us? What the f <laughs> Holy sh what the fuck? Oh, oh this might be one of those weird fucking Pull my head. Hi! Oh. What, Hi, what are you two doing? Going. Going. Oh, oh God. Easy money. I just went, I just finally went and checked out your goddamn um, hardware store down there. It's a good looking place. 
Nailed it? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. I love the decoration. Oh. It was a little iffy before, but they kind of revamped it a little, a little bit. It looks yeah, great. Yeah, they, they destroyed it. It looks great. Who the fuck are you? Oh. It's flop. It's flop. <laughs> Get me out of here. Should I know I... that name? Oh. Nancy, was he... W w did, did he hit his head? Um... Fine. Recently? Am I so? Who the fuck? I'm sorry, you guys. I still don't know who that is. Oh, mm, well. I've introduced myself to uh, Colin about 17 times in the last, I don't know, five maybe, days. Maybe be more memorable. He's a cop. He's, he's a oh, cop. In that case, he's a cop. Yeah. Open with that. All right, never mind. <laughs> well, we, we were trying to avoid that. Take more care, my Colin. Life Bye, fuck Colin. You. Yeah, fuck I you, doubt Colin. that, Flop. You piece of shit. Can you fuck you. Oh, yes. Yeah, we looked at that earlier. Um, we also looked at the, was that the like, uh, mm. kind of futuristic, looks like it has jetpacks that look like they weren't safe it. to fly in at first? Yes. Yeah, I love it. We've been exploring the shops for the last hour and a half. So. Oh, fun. Should we, yeah. should we tell her about the week I all set up? Oh, yeah, we got our, uh, What is going on, on back there? Yeah. We're getting everything set up and we're going to pull the trigger on it tomorrow. <laughs> Thank oh, you. Yeah. Bye. Y'all have fun towing. See you later, sweetheart. God, I'm going to be genuine with you. Out of character. I don't remember meeting Bop as Colin. I remember Flop when he was EMS. I have no idea who that is. Really? Yep. You own Flop's shop? Nope. Oh, no, no. Out of character, I know who Flop is. I know who it is. It's just in character, Colin. I can't remember. I mean, I role play a cop as well, chat. You remember that? I definitely know who Flop is out of character. You. <laughs> And also, Colin's an asshole who hates cops. Doing a pretty good job on this one. I think one more. Yeah, banging it out. I'm like banging you out. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm We're gone for long enough, so you better be. Oh my God! A day and a half. Holy shit! I've interacted with Flop. It's usually on ship three, though.
Offline Barry. I'm pretty sure Offline Barry's just gonna be like, yeah, fuck PDM, let's load up. I imagine these, this, this MC thing is going to go pretty quick. Yeah, fuck PDM, let's blow them up. Oh my god, is it here? We all in accordance? I... They're kind of fucking us over with the, uh... The bike. Good night, Joey. Super. Hold up, how? Same way you always have. Fill up with cars. Throw a grenade in. Yeah, lots of towing, lots of repairing. Yeah, his RP was fun, but this is his chat. You gotta keep moving. when a crow held you up with a shotgun? Yes. I just remember getting that text message from you. Yeah. I want my hat back. Want me to buy you a new hat? No, it's not the same. Well, so you asked that as if I was going to be like, nope, don't know what's starting, don't remember that. 
Oh, you know when you got casually robbed at gunpoint with a shotgun? By a crow. It could, it could have happened to anyone. Hello? Yeah, but yeah. Could have happened to anyone. Could have happened to anyone. We stop at an ATM. Sure. Well, I mean, it's one of the impound lot is the last one. Oh, ATM true. in there. Boom. 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 That's what Dice God says. Every time he rolls his dice, he goes boom. Hop out here, okay? Butter's got a quick hand. Boom. Spent the rest of the money that you gave me back. What's that look? The rest of the money that you gave me back? Yeah. I just spent it. Oh, what'd you do? I gave it to Kirk. Why? He sent me a really, really, really sweet text. Um, he said, I was thinking, you're the only head of the stable left. And I'm glad you're my friend and I'm happy for your success, even though I'm forever poor. So I sent him $100,000 and said, I love you and check your bank because you might be a little richer than you think. Now unlimited supply, excuse me? Unlimited supply what? Pool cue. A pool cue. Oh my god, I can eat some all the pool cue. <gasps> we go buy you one? Um, if you want to drive up there, yeah, I need to be in my head because I am my, I feel like my blood sugar is a little low. I got your diabetes, huh? Mm -hmm. Alright, I'll drive us up. I think you should have a fun arsenal of tools to enforce me with. Hey, Nancy, you're pretty cool. Huh? You're pretty cool. Why are you saying that? Just saying it. Oh, thanks. Oh, shut the fuck up. Uh, we beat my head, okay? Uh-huh. I thought it was funny. Alright, chat. Um, you wanna watch some clips while I eat?
only reason we all grab some water. Start leaking clips, the queue's up. Two hundred. Norman Bones is a cunt. Norman Bones is a cunt. <laughs> oh, hey, Normie. I gotta, I gotta. Man, I don't know. The yeah. Oh man, I don't know. Hard to link that. Money's better gaming. Make some plans. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. Let me know, alright? Yep, we'll do. Alright, I'll touch you too, brother. Beautiful, Chad. <laughs> oh, God, it's so fucking good. <laughs> oh, fuck, that's so funny. It's also such a BBMC thing to do. Hello, Andy. Hello, Andy. Hello, Andy. Hello, Hello, Andy. Hello, Hi, Andy. Hi, Andy. Hi, maybe Dad. So, so is it maybe dad or is it no, actually dad? It's we test we got the test done. Do you remember? Okay. Yeah. Was, oh, Andy, that, that it makes it us was, related because Hubcap is also my yeah. father. Oh my God, we're you're related. Ha you're half siblings. You know there yeah. are other people I'd be more upset to be related 80s. to. Yeah. How about Mick Yardson? He's no, also my biological son. Remember him? Like, anyway. Oh, yeah. I guess um, we're siblings. Wait. What are you? What am I even? Like uh, half oh, sister, totally half brother. Oh, okay. Hey. oh, okay. Hey yeah. there. Congratulations. I'll get my minions All right, I'm fine. Yeah. Um, I heard that you're selling pool cubes. Oh, yeah. What else do you have for people with? Yeah. Uh, we got our room. Oh, my God. No shock. <laughs> oh, I'm the owner oh, of a G-Wagon. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, Peach. <laughs> Peach, run the oh plate. my god, Rhodes, I love plate, you Peach. so much. Okay. I'm the owner of a new G Wagon. Well, I guess we can rip the for sale sign off it now. Yeah, yep, sure can. Hell yeah. Seat Look seven. At that. I love this. Like a pretty hop in, Peach, in hop Look in. at that. Wow. To the tuna okay. shop. Yes. I'm going. <laughs> Peach not <Yeah>. allowed. <laughs> I actually love that. Oh, what's her name, Mom? I'm Perry Watson. Oh, Perry, my name's Jesse. I wish I could have met her in different circumstances, but thank you for patching me up, Doc. Jesse, Jesse. Dodo, Jesse. 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 <laughs> I don't know what's on this. I'm a criminal. I mean. 
I think this is Rudy. Hi, Rudy. <laughs> 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 no, no, Jesse. Oh, You're right. That is also perfect. I feel bad for laughing. I feel so bad for laughing. Holy fuck. Oh my fuck. Why would you piss gasoline on that fire? You were tweeting it earlier. Why yeah, well, I didn't know he saw it the first time. I had to make sure he saw it. Wait, hold on. This means Death has a Twitter account. <laughs> no, he, he definitely has a Twitter account. He's been texting us, oh so God. he's very new. Can you stop using Death to take selfies and post them on Instagram? If uh, I'll, I'll keep my delete later. <laughs> Don Healing was right. He is over. I'm pretty sure he has a TikTok. Got, like a Hotmail account. Yeah. Do you think he does the Renegade? <laughs> He just has the AOL disc and he just keeps renewing it. Yeah, yeah, when he, exactly. When he, when he needs to find things out, he asks Jeeves. <laughs> <laughs> no man thinks I'm messing. Ah, so this I is the purgatory is, uh, North. I'm this must be where D is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, kidnap and torture, yeah. it's finally happening! Oh my god. Oh god! Oh, this is a Blackberry message. Um, he's going to offer himself, um, as some kind of fucking tool because I know he's fucked up in the head and he probably just wants a reason to continue doing that. Um, so he's going to offer himself, uh, in replace for D, which Barry would actually not like. That's weird. Barry, I think, uh, would not like that. And, um... Cause that's kind of uh kind of, why is he why is he taking his shirt off? Oh God. Is he trying to woo bones? Okay, never mind. He's going to have sex with Norman <laughs> in hopes that pleasuring him would be enough. I mean we haven't really thought of that. Have we tried just having sex with him? Nancy, just send me money. Nancy, just send me a hundred fucking grand! What the fuck? What the fuck, man? What the fuck, dude? What the fuck? Oh, shit! Oh! Who's Norman? Happy eight months, oh, bud smiley face. Oh, hold it down, Miss okay, Nancy, motherfucking Drew, son. She said, also, check your bank account. What a sweet son of a bitch. That means, she said, also, that means I missed the first text. That means I missed the first. Ah, oh, what a sweet son of a bitch. Dude. Dude, we're going to end up spending that on ramps and wingsuits. We have to now. We have to now. Rink, wing, a little, wingsuits, ramps, soap, and cars. Or in cars. That's what that 100K has got to go to. Paranoid Barry. I feel like a lot of people in the club are waiting on Barry to make. Make good. Oh, it's the fucking radio. Bro, he, he, he's fucking laying in his bed with his laptop, man. He's got a drink and he's just like, man, what shit can I stir? <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you know what's funny about this is that... <laughs> I, I'm not kidding. <laughs> Whenever I'm on during the evenings <clears throat> and after I get done shit stirring... I go lay down in bed, <laughs> I get on my phone, and I hop the different streams of people that are involved <laughs> just to see the shit that I've stirred. <laughs> and then I and then I fall asleep with a smile on my face. <laughs> Fuck those I, I go do. to bed a happy boy. <laughs> The 
that's over there. I, you, you want to talk about purgatory? Try riding in a car with them for 10 minutes when, when, I, when I go unconscious at a fucking lighthouse and drift back in in a car full of those dickheads taking me to fucking Viceroy. That's true purgatory. Very they live in my fucking house now. How do you think I feel? Yeah. Team Norman. Fine. No issue with that. Wait, 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 wait. This seems a little meta -y. What is this? <laughs> what the fuck does this even mean? The house is full of clocks. I hate how many references there are to like RP. I'm gonna be honest, it's kind of weird. agreed. TJ, you down here? What game is this? Time, you gotta talk. I think your little clock thing is uh, getting a little weird, son. A little bit too, a little bit too much for me. Hey, honestly. Colin. Hey, what's up? Get off your iPad. No. Get off your uh, fucking iPad. Oh, I wanna. Stop being an iPad kid. <sighs> All right, where are we doing? Where are we going? Look in front of you. <laughs> that guy is a cunt. Have I ever told you that? He is. I should say it's his face. Yeah. Also, check 12 o'clock. Oh, sick! I was gonna buy it. Uh, well, you were in your head, and I bought it for you. Uh. Okay, it's not exactly what I envisioned. Well, good for you, because I bought you something else as well. Oh, what? Oh, sick! Oh, now we can do... We can do, uh... Plumbing ERP. Ooh, hell yeah. Here to fix your Get pipes, ma'am. I can lay some pipes, something like that. Yeah, I'm gonna lay some lay some pipes. Hell yeah. That's a trunk. That's what I meant. A long day, okay? Long fucking week. Yeah. Hope you like them. I do. Thank you so much. How much were they? Oh, don't worry about it. Going Iron Hog with a bajillion, four million. Yeah, it was like seven and a half grams for both. Jesus. Oh, that's a sick emo. That I always give barbecue chicken wings a go, but they're always too sweet and not spicy enough. Where are we going? I don't know. Back into the city. And then where are we gonna go? No. Oh, the service industry storefront. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's always just tastes like sugar, bro. I haven't picked up my paycheck in days. I think like a week now. Oh, if you guys ever need mats, like really quickly, by the way. Mm -hmm. um, right up here on the left, where that white car's parked. Yeah. See that storefront sign? That yeah. is Mats or Us, which is even Stag's, like the nerd's material store. Mm -hmm. And they have tons of S-class materials what? in there at any given time. 
Ooh, the big reveal. What if I hate it? Well, it's... I don't, know, I don't care. It's meant to be, like, very techy and... Oh my, now this, this is fucking, whoever did this? Freddy Versetti. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. It's, it's bright. It's, the thing is, I think your contacts, or lack thereof, make it look weirder. Because in my eyes, it looks really good. Oh, I think, but, I still think it yeah. looks great. Yeah, Lang wanted like sleek, techy, Apple store type vibes. I feel like something should be on these walls. Something was on those walls, and then we took it down because we didn't like them. We got all our stock in there. Old mate, why are you working here? <laughs> Has to hold down two jobs, huh? Lots Bit of jobs. Bitch of an ex-wife took all your money? Okay. I like it. I feel like it needs a bit of red, you know? Like a little... You're fucking kidding me. I like a little bit of red. Are you... Fucking with you, yes. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, my flashbacks how it used to look. Oh. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Well, no, the thing is, we did have red in here until yesterday. And then Lang came in and said, take down all the red. It's sleek. I just It's just too white, in my opinion. I put red on the sign. Where the f why is my car? What the fuck? I still like this shop. Yeah, me too. Oh, have you seen? Oh, go to um, Up and Adam by Hayes. What the? What the fuck? Oh, that's not how that works. Kiss your homie goodnight Friday. Oh, can you be my homie? That's a dumb holiday because I always kiss the homies goodnight every day. Mm -hmm. It's true. Homies deserve a kissing. Are you going to this complex? Mm -hmm. Act left. Machine is. I think you're gonna like this one. Oh, I do. Oh, yay! This is Gold Rush. Oh, it's perfect. Isn't it great? Oh, Pablo scratch tickets. Yoink. Wait, they sell them here. I'm oh. scratching. Dead fucker. Hold on, I bought them. Better luck next time. <laughs> Wait, I'm about to. I won 300 bucks. Nice. Mm -hmm. It's weird. This, this looks like you can go through it. A little powerful. Oh. Oh. Anything back there? Oh no. Yeah, no, no. No, 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 no. Oh. It was nice being in the city while it lasted. Oh, wait, I have 
have one more. Oh, no, I didn't. I scratched them all. But I won 300 bucks. Nice. Put that towards your getting your 100k back. <laughs> Yeah, we can watch him later. The Honda Civic's been parked there like forever. We have an hour to kill before that MC thing anyway. What are we doing? Well, I don't know. Do you want to continue making want to try a little boosty boost um i think i uh, i need to do dodo just because i think i have to do one more job to reach the like five thing bullshit quota okay i somehow have 42 minutes left on my a i think we need to dodo first Little root scooting boost. God, I don't think Collins had 300k in his bank account in fucking forever. We don't owe anyone any money. Can you show me a lappy? Yes. Uh. There used to be an ATM there. I be pardoning Larry Hoover, the vacuum guy, yo. The fuck? Project, lick everything. I hate the city. Hello, this is Glypey. Hey, Glypey, how are you doing? It's Colin. Hi, how are you? I'm fantastic. I was hoping I could get my uh, my dodo my do jobs. There you go. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. You have a good day, all right? No problem. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Wow, instant. Oh, 
only give uh, 30 jobs a month. Oh? Abbas, Instead Abbas of 800. Have us got some bad news. So he's not in the best place. No, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. I slept it over. I, I told myself I will be salty on the EAU EU storm and then I'll slip it off and I'll be fine. The shit happens, you know. It's okay. Hey. I have my di I have my ditch. As Ruby said, Dodo doesn't define me. My archaeology no. defines me. Yeah. This what happened? Just I'm just gonna get changed. Uh, while you guys talk about this. Okay. So there was a position. Davis. Uh -huh. I. Love you. So there was a position for a lead manager open. Mm -hmm. Jesse would have heard like crazy if I was getting promoted to that because he asked he to quote he said he would lose his best manager. Oh. So anyway, yeah, that was the good outcome from that that Jesse lost me. Anyway, so we were having a discussion about the lead manager position and apparently Serge Cross got it. Okay. And when I spoke with Karina about it, she said sometimes I'm too serious and they can't read the room. Oh. Yeah. So apparently I'm too good at my job to be <laughs> a lead manager. Oh, it's a weird way. Well, well, that's the way I take yeah. it. All right, I'm too good at my job. I'll go fuck myself, I guess. Yeah, Bye. pretty much. I've given this month 800 jobs. He has given 30. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Jesus, it's that's insane. Much. But yeah, I tell, as Ruby told me, like this doesn't define me. Archaeology defines me. Yeah. And then Karina was like, you were the best choice when it comes to work ethic. But that. I was like, okay, fuck it. Uh, I'm just too overqualified. You're too good like, at your job, I know that yeah, feeling. She, she, she said, well, I understand if you don't want to work that much anymore. I was like, no, motherfucker, I will keep working hard to prove you the mistake you did. Oh, well. But yeah, next week, Bob uh, is uh, Bob is opening the dig set and we're going to start moving stuff from out there. So maybe it's better that I didn't become lead because it comes yeah with you can put more time into the, what stuff. you actually really give a shit about you know yep oh by the way can you guys adopt Ruby why wow, Jesus why yeah because she would be happy <laughs> Wait, she, you want you want you Nancy? and me to adopt Ruby or me you and too. you and you, you and too. Colin you and that's what I meant Colin and what why because she would like she would love no. that. <laughs> no kids. Yeah, no kids. Colin already has some. I have one. No. Uh -huh. Yeah, my track record with kids isn't too great. That's it. I can give her fatherly advice every one now and then. That would help also. Yeah. I can teach her about sex. Mm -hmm. Birds and the bees. I can teach her how to use a tampon. I could, I can't. I Mom's wish I could see, right? see you. I wish I could see you both more often. It was in the <laughs> butt, right? The second butt? That's right, honey. <laughs> and up the nose for nosebleeds. Damn right. Hmm? Alright, let's, uh, let's send it. Nice talking, Babis. Guess, you stay safe, fight. Yep, yep. Jade, make sure to get jobs from Kalab. Oh, I'm sorry. I actually thought you were sorry. Jennifer Snow. Um, hello, Jennifer. Good day. Oh, I'm sorry. Ow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> I'm sorry. Give you your hat. Oh, my glasses. Um, okay, here's your hat, though. Thank you. Do -do 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 -do. 
Hold on, can you look at me for a second? For fuck's sake. <laughs> How do I keep fucking... Uh... Oh god, I'm blind. I can't see. <laughs> oh no, god. you shouldn't be driving. You shouldn't be driving. I'm blind. No! <laughs> Side today? Yeah, what happened? It's, you know, it's it's a lot of stress. I'm very stressed. Right. Otherwise. Very stress. Big stressing. Oh. I did that. Good. Can't park there. I should be RPing that Colin doesn't have a hat anymore. Oh boy, Babbitt. Hey, you hear that? He's giving out a, like 800 jobs as opposed to social security 30. Mm hmm. That's funny. That's why I'm like sad because I think he really likes this job and the fact that he got looked over. Oh, he got fucking blindsided, bro. For someone who doesn't. He's been a judge up until last week. Yeah, I d Colin definitely. Radio? Oh sure, I'll get on fifty five. Mm -hmm. Babis is a very good like Civ RP. -er. I think he does a great job. Colin is from a place where there probably are a lot of hats. Ocean dumping your old wedding dresses with your bestie. Yep, that's a way to get a divorce. Or get his dad and his best friend wanting to fuck you, but you don't put out. Hit makes me sad. It does. Yeah, I don't know what this track is. Nintendo Synthwave. You 
got a favorite hat that's gone. Oh. I never played Super Mario Odyssey. Is it any good? There's lots of dogs running around and all we have is a fucking crows. Crows are very intelligent creatures. Yeah, but they work for death and they stole my hat, so fuck them. They did hold you at gunpoint. Yeah, I want my fucking hat back. You, you have a hat on right now. Not the same hat though, that was my lucky hat. I got it from bad. It's not not from Los Santos. It's uh. Back in Kentucky. Better get you that hat back. Then. That my lucky watch, you know. I remember you left it at my house the first night you stayed over. Oh yeah, on purpose. Oh, uh -huh. I just want to see me again. Classic move. I left my earrings at your house one night, too. Oh, I do remember that. Mm -hmm. Don't you think you're into me, Nancy? I might be, just a little bit. Still mad. I'd rather you be mad at me than me be dead. Other side, I think. Yeah, the other side. Edge time. Love you all. See you this year. Love you now, right? Thanks for supporting the sub. I've been here. Appreciate you. Neighborhood, Nancy. You know, but just let me inside. I want to look. A bone down. Thanks for the prime. For Twelve months as well. A whole year. She, she. Fucking hate delivering it. So dumb. Just because it's such a clusterfuck. Yeah. Back and forth. Bluetooth locks on all of my properties, and out of like the eight I have, only one of them is locked, and it's our warehouse. <laughs> my house is 100% unlocked.
Oh, I'm in. Oh. What? This is cash house. Boring. Got whiskey in here, though. Yeah, you'd think of being in a weird standoff with death, I'd remember to lock my door more. Yeah, I don't... I don't know. It's also like, what's the door going to do? Exactly. That's the thing at this point. Like, sure, the SN war made sense to lock your door. Death? Not so much. You do call him cunt, so. I'll do it again. I know. Norman is a cunt. You still owe me a drink. Don't. Hey, what's happening? You already watched that clip today. Nah, no, it's over here. I just got my box to the plastic pounds thing. Maybe it's okay. I do know that the crows can't open doors. They can hold guns, so. They can. But my door was unlocked today. And I woke up and I walked out and Giga Crow is just sitting there waiting for me. Never catching a crow lacking. You know what I've kept on me since we helped Ed take loose for us that night? Mm -hmm. he gave me this silver coin. And it's got like all of these symbols and stuff engraved on it. And it's specifically to uh, like ward off creatures of darkness. And I've kept it on me since that day. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, Jesse carries around a sunflower. Yeah. Hey, Finn. Hello, how are you? I'm good. How are you doing, handsome? Oh, please stop. I live with you. Okay, you can't be doing that. Okay. We're roommates. They were roommates. What would Nancy say? If I called you handsome, she probably wouldn't bat an eye, I think. Okay, He's but handsome. what would she do He's after you called me handsome and then I had to, I had to, you know, do something back. Because I can't, I can't just, well, listen, I can't just let you get away with that. I need the, I need, I need to one up you. Uh. Anyway, <clears throat> anyway, so you got my text message? Yeah, I'm going to speak to him. Yeah, it was really weird. It yeah, was... I don't, I don't like that. I'm going to speak to him. Yeah. Okay. And if he, um, and if, he, if, he does, if he doesn't get the message, I'm gonna bat the cunt. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's just like he cares so much about his fucking job, even though PDM was completely fucking over every single MC in the city. Didn't even quantify BBMC as an MC, and his his arguments his arguments were so weird that he brought up. He was like, "Why do we even care? We don't even ride motorbikes." And it's like, I like. We have the most cliffies of any MC in the city, first of all. Second of all, MC's in our fucking see, name. Third of all, stuff. are you gonna let some fucking car business tell you that you're not an MC? And, yeah, like, no, that's a slap in our fucking something? face. Fuck him. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. He's... Uh, I, I'm sure he's gonna wake up next to him and he's gonna have a fucking host of excuses, but I was just... I was very disappointed with him last night, and uh, the fact that he blamed me for any of it... Yeah, yeah you, you don't think I was pissed about Hayes? Very outrageous. Fuck him. I take it on the fucking chin. Yeah, it's just fucking outrageous to me, uh, considering what I know the club stance is because Jesse was there and he was, you know, voicing support and everything like that. And it's like, uh, suddenly, once it affects Edbert's bottom line, he has an issue with it, which seems to be a recurring theme, but that's another thing. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to speak to him before I do anything. Appreciate you telling me okay. that. Okay. 
Yeah, all good. I'm just getting really annoyed with uh, the way I just can't do any right to him and everything comes back and it's all my fault. Yeah, that's, need jobs. that's why. Need jobs. Yeah, can you send me one? Uh, Sorry, can you send Colin a job? Colin, yeah, me. I can. Give it. Yeah, yeah, I can do You're it. You're doing right dodo. Now. Appreciate you. Uh, yeah. Um, might intercept your truck just to hang out if that's alright. Hey, I can pick you up. Or do you want? Or do you want private time with Nancy? No, 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 I can pick you up. Well, I'm in my car, so I can just fucking yeah, scoot on yeah, down there yeah, and be there in a sec. All right, easy. See you there. You see you. Colin, have you seen water? No. Uh, okay. So, about five minutes ago, Ivy Poppins tweets: PDM silent auction this week closes in two hours. Massacre and cliffhanger. Faye responds, we were told these auctions would be closed for MC, the bids would start next week. Ivy responds, due to threats of blowing up PDM and shooting employees, MCs have been blacklisted from PDM. Andy responds, oh no, we're blacklisted. Looks like the bikes they weren't selling to us are going to continue not to be sold to us. Darn. Ivy, shouldn't be a problem then. Question mark. Who's Ivy Poppins? I don't know. I think she must work at PDM. Yes. PDM is her uh, yellow pages. <laughs> PDM workers standing up to MCs. What could go wrong? What was Finn calling about? Is he okay? Oh, he's just coming to chill with us. Yeah, I just some club issues. Okay. I just heard I'm gonna bat the cunt, and I was like, oh dear. Yeah, Ebert, I need to tweet to Ebert. He's so he's feeling, and if he gives me a certain answer, I'm gonna do it. Hello. Hello. Oh, I need like... to find a picture quickly. Okay. Okay. Get in the fucking van. That sounded, but that's, like not like. Excuse me. That's, that's so <laughs> weird. Not like that though. He okay. wanted to give me a tour of the hold bedroom on. at Colin's house, and he was really sad that I saw it already. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me find this picture. You know what I mean, though. <laughs> yeah. I, yes. Yes. You want to be. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Yeah. I know. I, yeah. I know. Yeah. Finn, now you're making it weird. We're going to Polito. Why do we always get it at the... Okay, we're here with Finn and we... <laughs> Ethel, huh? <laughs> Last time... <laughs> Last time a car business started acting like a gang. He's got blown... I'm retweeting that. No, I was gonna... I was, Ethel fucking... Ah, Ethel joined my thing. I was doing that. And then somebody's stirring shit saying, yo, PDM, personally, I would not let that slide. That's just me, though. <laughs> All right, yo, retweet that. Nice. Reminder of what happened the last time that this was that acted like a gang. A nice picture of Finn in front of... Blown yo, you need a repair kit, my guy? I'm all good, man. Thank you. Appreciate yeah. it, though. I got you. I got one. We talked that. We talked that. I need, I need engagements. Um, <laughs> I need the endorphin. Do it. I, 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 <laughs> my company owns PDM, so. I Damn it! Really. Corporate. Yeah, I know. I hate the. Pretty, she's a corpo. I did, I did my. I yeah, did my a one. <laughs> I did my one. I retweeted Ethel. <laughs> You're a corpo in a nomad world. PDM is really yeah. shit in the bed with this, I'll be honest. They are. Yeah. This is gonna like moronic. I think they shit their pants as well when they die. All they had to do was be like, you know what? Yeah. The you know what? We'll just sure give you one on the wait thing. List. Yeah, make sure everybody on the wait list had the shit that they need, which they didn't do. Give everybody a warning and be like, just to let you know, in a month or two, we're gonna be opening it up for everybody. And then communicate with the MCs 
everybody feels disrespected because PDM didn't do a good fucking job of communicating anything. Just said. <laughs> I think, okay, somebody said, so you let look one at, person look at, look at say Adam's you twat. <laughs> Just saying the tuner shop and Mushkin Motors do not discriminate against MCs. Okay, but look at this too. Someone tweeted at Ivy. So you let one person upset hey. you so bad that you blacklist everybody? I think you missed all the MCs holding down our business lot. It's not because of one person's actions. It's multiple. I end up in prison a lot anyways. <laughs> Alan Crane, PDM <laughs> I'm about to put it on the betting app, honestly. I just, I just saw the crane. That's fucking fantastic. Put it in the bedding up! Put it in the bedding up! Should I? Faye, Faye called Crane, which causes me to do that one, apparently. Uh, okay, perfect. Thank you. Well, I don't, I don't want to, I really don't get it. Wow. Benji got here just in time yeah, for the sauce. Benji's like, holy shit! Uh, oh, he Benji's, can smell Benji's it. On the sauce. Yep, here he is. He can <laughs> smell it. But oh, you know what? He's like, I haven't had tea like... today yet. I'm thirsty. <laughs> I'm thirsty. Uh, what's going on in Twitter? Go, 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 go. <laughs> I don't. The Hello. thing is, I would put it on the betting app, but I also don't know how that would get paid out. <laughs> it would be days and then it'd be like all right oh yeah. oh the mcs blew up pdm crazy didn't see that coming well my guess is it would just come down to like a conversation and it wouldn't really go over something else no, no plus if it's like a unified work between all mcs it would be like some wars where it's like i don't i don't want to oh no like, we're not operating in those hours it's like there's mcs awake all the fucking time mm -hmm. Oh, my man Keith, I've been trying to get a job at PDM during hours when Noah's around for PDM and got ghosted. Yeah. Not surprised the management is lacking. Yeah. Uh, well, <laughs> thank you for it up. Yes, you are. Good, good luck with your plea deal. Yeah, that's fucked up. Thanks. Good you luck. probably just suck. <laughs> Thanks. It's gonna gonna rule. Uh, it is what it is. Oh, I can show Finn what he did. You take care. Hey, bye bye. Hey, what are you showing me? Can you speak up a bit, Finn? Yeah, sorry, I was keeping my voice down because I was on the phone. No, you're good. Um, so the other night, I went down to the Billy after everybody was in bed. Not the Billy, Miss Bougie. And I talked to Keith, and I paid him a hundred bucks to do something for me. Uh, that sounds ominous. Look nope. at the billboard we're coming Give up you on a right now. Sloppy toppy or Norman is a okay dude. <laughs> 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 I would have done it for free. <laughs> I gave I gave him a hundred bucks and a can of blue spray paint, and there's that I one. I would have done the... it for free, Nancy. <laughs> And the one across from uh, Bob Smith PD, closest I could get to Vespucci. This is the last one on the highway on the way to the lighthouse. That was perfect. Mm -hmm. That was great. The crow shit all over the U, though. Yeah. Yeah. But Those damn whatever. censorship crows. I know. Still, worked out pretty well. I'm just, I'm, I'm reading all this fucking fight of shit. I am gulping in the tea right now. This is great. Don't just start hunting and asking who it's me. <laughs> hey, yo, you PDM. You PDM? Why not? Are you PDM? Why not? <laughs> Why not? Sell me a car. <laughs> One MC says PDM, but one PDM says MC. Let's do it. P 
PDMC. <laughs> yeah, it's PDMC. PDMC. That's funny. That's what we did when we occupied PDM with all our class twos and shit. We called ourselves PDMC, and it was home turf, and the cops couldn't do anything when we all ran out and attacked all 20 of us because it was home turf, and we were getting a gang up. That's <laughs> Hell yeah. And the mayhem put their sprays up because they can spray them because they're not gang sprays, so we had we had MC spray. Oh my, oh my god. god. What a cunt. Was that Psycarta? I don't think so. Psycarta's tweeting right now. No. I think that's why he hit us. Maybe. If Leslie was still around and not dead, this would not be happening. Which is very sad. Photos and PDM are two separate things, right? They are technically two separate things, both under the umbrella of Cerberus. Leslie Lingberg owns PDM, and then uh, Otto Delmar, Marlowe, and Cerberus own PDM. But under the umbrella, technically Cerberus owns both. Leslie is presumed dead, though. <laughs> Ivy's upset at me. She texted me to delete her number. <laughs> Who? Ivy Poppins. Fuck her anyways then. Yeah, tell her to go fuck herself. It's like, Gart, it's crazy how no one's at PDM <laughs> right now. Crazy how that happens. Crazy. What, what stake does Ethel have in this fucking fight? I don't think she has any. She's literally just pouring some flames in the beef. <laughs> Ethel used to work at Hayes. All right. Right, right. What the? Okay. What the? Uh, homeless people, bro. Yeah. What's up? Hey, Jerry. Others got a quick hand. I'm really tempted to tweet, like, Hey, remember that autos and PDM are two separate businesses. No, what's that? I would uh, quickly get that stance out. It might help. I mean, I'm going to be at the meeting, so... Uh, All right, then don't tell me. I will bring that up. Yeah, I'm just going to call Mila quickly. Because Mila hires people from... Like, two people from each gang. Because she yes. wants representation there. Uh, Hi, how Barry are you? Owns Barry's thing. Not good. Um, as <laughs> Cerberus PR... Jump back in, jump back in. Oh, uh, I was just thinking Barry, Barry of how get our, in. uh... I, thought we I gotta jump out. out. I have to jump out. I'll meet you there, I'll meet you there. Um... I, 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 I can't say who uses Barry's things except Barry, you know? Alright, I promise to keep it secret. Roth has caught a quick hand. Mr. Dundee isn't... Well, yes, everyone here. knows that. Um, probably around four million right now. I mean, you can still try. You can do. You can get a loan, probably. Okay. But also doing it the way that I did it very hard Maybe. publicly and back on the decision that was mm. made. Ivy did it. Yes. Well. Um, I appreciate the effort, but you should spend that money on something nice for yourself. I don't think you're digging them out of that hole. And then they've been like clapping back at people on Twitter. Oh, they're gonna get clapped, all right. Ah, uh, you know, bad investments. Died. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm not too sure.
all. Yeah. Uh, bye, Nancy. No, no, no. She's going right here. Oh, I get it. Chat, didn't I buy a cow a long time ago, chat? Just hanging out. Yeah, I'm hanging out too. Man. Hey, I'm no. welcome. And I feel like it's. What do you mean, no? I'm already in the. She's car. on the phone. You're not the most important person in the fucking world. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, oh. Wow. She's a businesswoman and she's very busy. Right. right. Ben, are you shouting That's at the Nancy woman? fucking Drew. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> Wait, yes, I Wait, am. Yeah, of course I fucking am. I shout at anyone that fucking talks shit to Nancy. Wait, is, Jesus. is it who? She sounds like fireworks. Oh. Nancy, she's like, yeah, so fireworks and shit. Yep. Yeah. Cool. She's the fun girl. Yeah, yeah. I know Nancy. I used to work for her. I think everyone's worked for Nancy arena. at some point. Yeah. Yeah. She's. she's yeah, she got that umbrella. Yeah. Business tycoon <laughs> style. She's a car, so I don't get left behind. Uh, the van? Yeah. Is the is the van a gem? No, Nancy's a gem. Van. A jade is a gem. Jade. jade is a gem. Yeah. True. Not wrong. Mm. I assume you're going to this meeting. Is is a jade a, an emerald? What is a jade? What 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 semi precious stone is a jade? What are you smoking? Not nothing at the moment, but I would love a joint. I mean, I agree, but that's completely on them. Weed is for hippies. And I think and they, they just don't want to deal with the drama. Colin, ideas. Yes. I didn't recognize you. Like, yeah, just Whoa. stop. <laughs> I just say my that's okay. He doesn't weird recognize in a you uniform. Either. Yeah, I mean, that's fine. I look different than I did when I knew him back a wait, few months ago. Wait, who's that? Kim. Oh, from shit. Mayhem. Fuck me. How are you doing? I. I've already seen you in a hot minute. Yeah, exactly. I, I feel like I should hug you, but yeah, that you, you might be awkward. You finally got Mojito in, huh? Yeah, exactly. It's been that long since we've talked. Yeah, come here. Yeah, it's been a long time since, you know, fucking the market, you know? Yeah, it has been. And I was missing for a while. Ooh, I'm showing Nancy. Take a picture I'm of showing Nancy. A Wait, are you dating Nancy? Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Oh, that's really beneficial of you. Good job. Wow. What? Not my prerogative. I mean, you're like dating up, right? So. No. What? What do you mean? No. She is way out of his league, though. Yeah, she is. Yeah, out of that's my what league. I'm saying. She's crazy out of my league. Yeah, like you're dating I'm, up. I'm a right? giant piece of shit. Not a piece of shit. I am. Come on. No. I mean, we may have been fishing together for like seven months ago but you know yeah nothing still a piece of yeah. shit though you, i mean are you going a big to the, difference uh... between flirting with fisher women and you know dating ceos of some of the most important corporations in the entire city True. uh you go to the mc meeting after storm yes uh well i hope to be there uh i'll be around intend to be around yeah are you, is it just your high command going 
uh, probably a VP and president going, but uh, if I can be there, I will be there. I'm sort of just bringing everybody. Well, anybody that's awake yeah. at the time. Yeah, that's kind of like my sentiment too. Like, uh, not maybe specifically at that specific meeting, but around. Yeah, just in a case of like, oh, this MC thing involves like all of my members. As yeah, a, as let's an MC go. As a whole. Like, right, exactly. Obviously, let's I'm gonna be go. like, you guys shut the fuck up and let High Command speak. Exactly, exactly. That's uh, my sentiment anyway. Okay, so I'm gonna get back to work. I'll see you at the uh, meeting, alright? Hopefully. Okay. I guess I won't jump back in the van. You're not allowed in the van. What? You're not allowed in the van. Oh, okay. Bye. See you, Kim. Nice seeing you again, alright? Hopefully, see you around. Bye, Kim. Kicked her the fuck out of the van. Mayhem, Warrenbound. Yeah. The thing is, chat. I think Barry thinks it's tomorrow. Well, that's that's the thing. I don't want autos to get bombed at all. So if, like, I know you say you have a couple people who work there, which is great, but I'm like. Personally, I would want to get the word out that MCs are welcome at autos. I feel like twining out might might bomb autos. <laughs> Feeling cute might, might bomb delete. Autos. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if autos is the target though. Is autos part of the problem? <laughs> yes, you have the right idea, but What's up? What? Yeah. Oh, Junior I'm... should be awake. I'm uh I'm in the back of Colin's dodo truck. Yeah, you are. Why? I saw. I fucking L fought locked door. Crane, <laughs> 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 Crane knows what's up. This is ugly. Apparently, Faye asked Crane what the legal uh, answer is to an entire, you know, group of people being banned from the store. And Crane said, I'm gonna grab my Uzi and my Oxy and see you out there. <laughs> Hell, my man! <laughs> okay, sorry, that was a long phone call, but it was an important one. Sorry. Just talk to Mila, who runs autos, and she hadn't. She has Twitter turned off, so she hadn't heard anything about what was going on with PDM. And Damn, she she's living had, in the hole. She well, she's drunk right now too. Uh, so I was rock. basically like, it's probably a good idea if you. She's our head of PR. Um, I was like, it's probably a good idea if you mention that like everybody's still welcome at autos because I know that you make a point of employing people two people from each gang if you can um and then maybe she's like I want to talk to the she wants to talk to the PDM people too she might be able to I don't know, make some sense of this yeah I think that uh that I think that uh that ship sailed I think so too Inside. Max Power is hooing Psychata. Oh, it's cozy in here. It is. This is cute. 
He's coming for you, yeah, he's coming for you. I don't want to stop in it on the left up here. Can you stop in on the left? Oh, it might be locked. Probably locked. real hot of the environment and I didn't see anything. This is uh, Bundy and Lennon's. Yeah, you were telling me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I broke into that house the other day. Oh, yeah? oh my god, Babis just tweeted. Yo, Faye, can you stop panning and do Dodo, please? Follow the example of the great Colin as he does his. Fuck's sake. Quit my man out and we run. <laughs> <laughs> Babis, shut the fuck up! <laughs> I don't do that. I'm a fierce criminal. Oh my god. It's gonna be a little awkward. It's like, oh hey Barry, thanks for coming for the meeting. Oh by the way, I made a deal with Norman. You know that guy who we set out to make a deal with and I went ahead and did it? Can we bring Nancy to the MC meeting as a plus one? That's, yeah, no, that's not happening. <laughs> bye, Kim. Bye, Kim. Bye. No, Mila, I think, was on the verge of suggesting that we go to that meeting. She's like, I really want to go and I want to speak on behalf of PDM. And I was like, no, no, you should let the MC. I know Rodley Cos every that time I get naked in the bathroom get, uh, and shower tied cries. To the table drawn and quartered. Yeah, I was like, you should like she's still gonna talk to Andy in private and see if maybe she can like smooth things over or whatever, but um Well, it's a case of you smooth it over with one MC, there's still a shit ton of others that are pissed. Yeah, hundred percent. Personally, I'm just gonna vote that we blow the fuck out of it. Uh, I don't think I can really be swayed other way. Yeah, me too. I, I think if, if if they can't run their business, they shouldn't have it, honestly. Yeah. Dude. Max. Max is, <laughs> Max is awesome shit right now. He's just said, just sold a car to someone. Weird. And now he's saying he's never heard of Cy Carter. He must be a nobody. Ooh, Max really wants to die. Yeah, I don't think a lot of these uh, employees know the, uh, the feeling of constantly being fucking hunted no matter where they go. I just texted him and said, um, you're making things worse for yourself right now. Lang would fucking hate this. I think it's hilarious that some people have their heads stuck so far up their own ass that they can't see which way is the way out. So they keep on, you know, shoving their head in further and further. Mm-hmm. Fuck, I actually don't even know where the meeting is. Shit. You'd probably call Andy. Um, I'm gonna. Oh, she's on the phone. Yeah. Probably on the phone with Mila. Wait, isn't Max pa Isn't he SN? That's Max That's Speed. Max That's speed. Max Speed. Yeah. 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 Um, what? I texted him and I said, you're making yourself, you're making things worse for yourself now. He spent, said, I spent four hours today talking with BBMC 
and other MC members, and we were what? at what I thought was an agreement until now. I woke up what? to see this shit on Twitter. I'm not gonna just sit here and take it. I'm defending my business, and I have every right to do so. Ask him no what, one from BBMC. Ask him what BBMC. Him. Ask him what BBMC. Last night it was me and Edbert awake, and then TJ later. Unless Edbert fucking talked to him. No, oh, no. Oh, yeah. it was... No. Sorry, guys. Was it Edbert? Yep. Okay. Thank you for letting Damn, me know. That's... Oh. Uh, you fuck, PDM. He's now phoning me. Hello, Max. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, I'm gonna enforce him. I'm not gonna kill him. Why? I don't stop. Stop. I'm gonna be like, the stand should be there, fucking around, and they're gonna find out. I don't give a shit about your job. It's not even about the rep amongst the other MCs. It's a case of if the club stance is fuck them, then they can go fuck themselves. And that is your stance as well. I get that. Uh, it's just... Uh, business stuff aside, I just think you're making yourself a very, very big target right now. And that's why, well, I mean, you and Ivy both just went on Twitter, and just like very much on the, the defense and the aggressive side. And like, yeah, I, from, I from what you're saying, you're like, I had a really good up. productive conversation that was going to, you know, be all fine and everything was going to be smoothed over. And before anything can be discussed with people, Ivy is tweeting that all MCs are blacklisted from PDM. It's the wrong turn. Well, the thing is, if he was the highest rank at the time, I understand Chad, you take pride in what you do, but at the would same be time, speaking like, on half of the if BBMC. you said. If you just told me that you spent all this four hours trying to smooth stuff over with all these people and you would come to an agreement and then Ivy backtracks on that entire agreement that you spent all this time with and then blacklists publicly yeah, all MCs yeah, get from em. PDM. Get him. Fuck him yeah, up, yeah, Nancy. Yeah, you're just, you're get shooting em. yourself in the foot. You got him on the ropes. Yeah, Colin is seeing a lot more in Finn, and he's kind of just like, uh, uh yo, Finna might patch this motherfucker. I mean, I, yeah, I understand that side of it, but I just, from a outsider, well, semi-outsider looking in at this point. I just think that if you had put in all of this effort, like you said you have, making, you know, speaking to people and doing everything the correct way, uh, and then just to go back on it and blacklist everybody anyways, even though you knew this summit was happening where a lot of things would get discussed, I'm... the building to rubble. I want to tear up the foundations and put a 
new billabong there. Are these one of those floaty boys? Um, Is, isn't it a thing where the orange tanks, they only blow up if they have the run on the side? I don't know. What? Guess not. That's that's not how that works. That's uh, annoying. I wanted to blow something up. I'll blow up PDM later. It's all good. <laughs> Fucking troll. Hello, Nancy. <laughs> Love you, Pin. Love you too. <laughs> Do it. Give in to your anger. Strike her down with all your hatred, Colin. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Give in to your anger, McKinley. Take your place at my side. Strike her down and you'll become more powerful than you could possibly imagine. I'm already head popping, so... I want to steal your shoes. My opinion, the next patch is TJ and then probably Stevie. We'll make sure to bring you into the next meeting, huh? I appreciate the consideration. Uh, yeah, we'll check out some clips. Let me just queue up. <laughs> oh god no, <laughs> no. Just, someone call colin someone fucking call anybody god. <laughs> i don't know what's going on but we're did norman do this fuck that old cunt <laughs> What did he do, Barry? That's funny. Hello, can you see me? Hello? Chat, are you ready? Are you ready to uh you thought you thought RP was scary? Uh we're about to uh about to step it up a little bit here, okay? It's about to get a little bit more spooky. Okay. Ooh, show tattoo. Look at look at him smile there, chat. Ooh, show tattoo. Key. Look how happy. A bit more. Look at all of these messages coming in. Hold on. Where's the one of him saying show tattoo? Oh, there it is. He locked onto that so Spooky. quick. Okay. Ooh, show look, tattoo. Look, look at him smile. Look at that. Look at the pride in his eyes. Look at that. He was like, yes. Finally. Finally. Someone asked me. Fuck yes. Look at him. Little happy boy. Face reveal. Yeah, this is me. Uh, Vinyl Rabbit. Thanks for eight months, by the way. You ready, chat? You ready? Do you get scared from horror games? No. Uh, God, no. 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 Is this the horror game? <laughs> who the fuck wrote that? That's good. That's good. That? Point him out. Who, who wrote that? The chat went too fast. Who said that? That's good.
What the fuck is this? Why does Stevie look so fucking butch? This is a weird guy. It's good. Yeah, why isn't Keith Kyle there? What the fuck? What the... See, chat, chat, th this is actually very accurate because Pez wouldn't have been able to get away from him in the first place, so him pulling over checks out. That's weird. Meta question mark. That is good. I want to see. All right, bye bye. Dusty took today off. Worth it. And I'll do it again. We brothers. Honestly, bro, we look fucking very similar. What the fuck?
Okay. Chat, I think something moved up in the earrings. That's why this is all on the wrong fucking eye, bro. Yo, yo. So. Kinda. Hi. Tried to call you the other day when you were the demon of gold panning. You've been gold. You've been. What am I fucking? Of course you've been fucking gold panning, bro. I don't know that it's worth it if you can't sell jewelry parts. Like if I can sell my jewelry parts, I would just like earn like I don't know seventy thousand, which is still in for the amount of time you do. Um. Sell jewelry parts or not. I'm gonna figure out when the, where this meeting is, and I want you all just here in the Billy ready to go. All right. Uh, okay. What the fuck you said, and honestly, I don't know. There's a meeting between all the MCs or something. Yeah. Good for them. And you're coming? Okay. What the? Uh, what's the radio today? I don't know. Pick one. For some reason, there are people running. Our locals are running. What's up? What's this meeting about? What's going on? Yeah, uh, I don't know. You kind of just drove away and said, "Good for them." I don't know. It's yeah, it involves us. It's about PDM. Oh, for fuck's sake! Can he just let it go? No. I mean, we're already there. They're already gonna bomb the entire place down, turn it to fucking dust. What more do they need to talk about? I mean, why not? See? The place is gonna be inoperable. They're gonna bomb it. Like, right? yeah, we're all gonna we bomb it. That's included. Okay, fuck it. More, more chaos. Yeah, I'm down. Fuck it. Uh, yeah, when is know. this meeting gonna be held? Like, where is the location? I'm, I'm gonna now? figure it out, but it's gonna be in 50 minutes. <sighs> okay, 50 minutes it is. All right, I'll update you, please. Totally Easy. Forgot. That was a lot of what the fuck. Your radio is too much responsibility. I can't think of a single number. Oh my god. 299.9. No, that'll probably be used. I don't fucking know. Oh. Get on 187.1. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, it sounds like he just woke up, Chad. So. I'm a bit of a cranky asshole when I'm tired, chat, so I don't really blame anyone. Um. Where's my cliffhanger? Probably blown to fucking pieces. Uh, can you give me a lift? What? <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> can, you, can you give me a lift? I need to go get my cliffhanger. All right, you just stopped like all obviously in the middle. Like, do I really want to talk to TJ right now? Do I actually want to ask you a fucking question? Uh, you know what? I'm going to back up and actually do it. Was that your thought process there? You no, fuck? no. I literally was just like <laughs> thinking. Yeah, exactly. You know, oh, you were thinking. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> That's your first mistake. Where is it at? Um... Pound lock. How do you get a bike in Poundlock? Oh no, it's not. It's parked there. Uh, oh, right. When you were towing earlier. Got it. No, it's actually been parked here for like fucking ages. <laughs> so when you were towing months ago, yes. or the many times you towed between them. I like towing. I'm not I'm, counting. I find it pretty theory. peaceful. I find it like, kind of like calming. Hello for the 50th uh, time today. Kind of hey, I just want to hear from you. That's all. This time, just time I'm just calling to hear to see how you're doing. Yo, that's we're all. both taken. Calm down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Too much, too much. I'm just kidding. We um, can be friends. Where the fuck is um this meeting? <laughs> Did Barry not make it? Huh? No, I, I, he's not awake at the moment. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, do you want me to just? How about you text me your ping and I'll remember to ping you when we get down there. All right, bet. bet send it now. Sound right. good? It'll be still for like forty-five minutes. Yeah, no, all good. Oh. Just want to get ahead of it. All right, sounds good. Oh boy, boy, boy. Okay, bye boy. Hey, it still works. Augers. A better duo than Barry and forgetting? Colin and falling off roofs. Hello. I do not. I'm okay. I just got off the phone with Max. And how's he doing? Oh, it's not good. I explained. I explained everything. I told him all the stuff that I would have done about like the warning period and the this and the that. And he was like, "Well, you know, the MCs came and shot me, and so that's why they're banned." And I was like, "Who the fuck shot you from every MC?" And he's like, "Well, it's just the lost." And I was like, "Okay, well, bro, like." Ban the lost then, don't ban everybody. And I just tried to like talk him through some stuff and I was like, this is not Cerberus, this is not MC, this is just like Nancy reacting to what's going on and how you fucked up. And he, I don't think it was just like sinking in kind of what was going on. But it's, it's not great. Well, he's, you know, I, I think I know what's gonna happen, but obviously. I don't know how this meeting's gonna go, but I can make an educated guess. Yeah, I'm also sorry to be the bearer of bad news about Ed. I feel really shit about that. About what? About Ed? I already know I was gonna speak to him, so. Apparently, he went to the Lost as well. Do what? Speak about this to them? I may have misunderstood that when Max told me it, but I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Okay. Uh, so I'm pretty much just meeting this meeting thing and then probably uh, just going to go sleep in the billy. I'm gonna go sleep in the billy? Yeah. Oh, wait, my house isn't done. Yes. Fair enough. Yeah, you said we're slaying at yours, so I can't go to your house. Okay, fine. Then I'll, I'll come sleep in the billy too. Yay! Yay! Um, right, I'll see you later then, okay? Okay, you be safe at the thingy and I will be in bed by the time you're home. Okay, alright. Love you. See you soon. Okay, also don't disappear on me again. Uh, okay. Okay. No no fucking deals with him and then disappearing for days on end. Alright, alright. See you soon. Okay, bye. I am having a good day, thank you. Uh... Jesus. All the work Jesse did to get that car.
That custard, don't you, big boy? Hello, everyone. It's me, LT Custard, and I'm fucking awesome. Yo, LT, thanks for for seven months. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for the right here. Appreciate you. being a square. Chad, you want meth? Because your cool uncle's here. Hey, yo, chat love, you want drugs? <laughs> oh, you alright? Yeah, I think, I think I need to, uh, Talk to Edbert a little bit in a stricter tone. I think he needs to understand what position he's in. Um, did Finn text you? No, he did. Okay, what was it? He's like, thank you for firing me from PDM. Now I'm jobless. And he said, said that uh, to you? Oh, well, basically he sent me a text message. Basically the following words were your actions the other day is what got me fired from PDM. So now I'm jobless. Thank you. I'll, uh, I'm gonna let him know what position he has. Yeah, no. He's under me. Don't me, you this... worry. Actually, you know, actually, you know what? No, you're the enforcer. Yeah, no. I was gonna say I already know half the shit that he's done. I I want to hear half it from his shit. lips, and then I'm gonna fucking b bat the cunt. That's what I'm saying. You know that um, the way me and Finn got down there in the first place was um, Rudy called me. He said, "Hey, could you come down here?" And that was before we even knew anything. Then he mentioned so... this um, bike thing. Right? And I was like, oh, that don't sound good. I guess we'll come down there and check it out. Uh, yeah, let's just say the BBC had the smallest representation uh, there. HOA were there, Mayhem was there, Loss was there, uh, you name it, you know? And it was only me and Finn. Me and Finn literally spent two hours sitting on a bulldozer, basically not saying a word, while the cops came down or even agreed with all the MCs. Did we fuel the fire? No. Did we know that this was Edward's fuck up? No. I knew that the day off. It's actually him who started all of this, and we had no idea. Wait, what? Yeah, it was his fuck up that led to the mayhem guy being pissed off. What? Well, well, so, hold on, I'm a little confused. I'm lost. Something got lost in translation there. Okay, so basically the riot came down to a mayhem guy bitching about not winning on, the what, auction. What riot? So, so okay, so there was a gathering outside PDM, right? Okay. That gathering consisted of HOA, yeah, Mayhem, and... Yeah, basically VMCs, gotcha. Right, they're all down there. Um, Lost being the most vocal about being pissed off the fact that PDM no longer has silent auctions for MCs. We apparently lost that quote-unquote privilege because a Mayhem guy decided to throw a hissy fit because something went wrong in the system. Now, apparently that human error was Edbert. Okay, and what was the error? That he didn't fill out all the paperwork properly. And that's what cost it all. Now, I'm not saying that that's not okay. It's all right to fuck it up, you know, and all that. But when me and Finn were down there, we didn't know of this information. Not, neither me or Finn had an idea that it was Edward who had initially fucked up the deal. We didn't know that. We also didn't know that just being down there and not saying anything was apparently going to get him fired. We we didn't know any of that. Did we know it was going to cause a reaction? Yeah. 
Did we know that he was going to get fired as a result? No. We were down there for two hours. Maybe said a couple words. Cops came down. Agreed with all the MCs and then left. And then we kind of left as well. There really wasn't anything else to be said. Basically, the moment I was there, I talked mostly to HOA Lilith and just tried to bridge more connections with them. Mm -hmm. And it worked out flawlessly. Next day, they started giving us bank codes and now we're in good relationship with them as well. That was basically what nice. I was down there for. Yeah. Um, and now I wake up to a text from him saying that your actions the other day down at PDM got me fired. Thanks. And your actions were just sitting there chilling and agreeing with them all. I, I don't even think I said anything that would agree with them either. I mean, you already know I do agree with them, but I didn't say anything. No, not officially. My presence was there. That's apparently what caused it. <laughs> and that was enough. Wow. You know me. I couldn't give less fucks about his feelings. But uh, had I known prior, maybe uh, maybe I'd have swayed the other way, even though that's not really what we should do. We should uh, definitely agree with the other MCs because this affects us as, as well, so. Yeah, I'm literally at the stage where it's like, PDM actively said that they had a list of people that they were selling these to. We weren't on that list because they didn't think we were a real MC. So at that point already, they can go fuck themselves. Like, we've literally bled in this fucking city back to back to back to get our name out there. I'm not gonna have a bunch of fucking salesmen tell me I'm not an MC. Agreed. So it's a case of, like... Um... I'm just gonna talk to him. I wanna hear what he has to say. And if he's... If he's pissed at you, and he's giving you that fucking tone, I'm not, I'm not having that. Finn, did you get a uh, text message from Edward? I got, I got more than a text message. I got the whole fucking eruption of, of fucking anger from him. It was all my fault. It was, it was, Finn and Jesse, you, you fucking ruined it for me. You didn't even think. Uh, and the slew of excuses that he came up with. We're not even a real MC anyway. We're a motor club, not a motorcycle club. Why do we care? It's not our fight. Pissed me right the fuck off. It was, it made me, it made me really angry because this is something that I believe in. And yeah, it sucks that you lost your job. But you didn't hear Colin, Antonio, Chain, fucking bitch and moan when we had when the time came to fight Hayes. I don't know. And I it, mean, it just feels, you know, it's just fucking... I'm not gonna do anything more than say this, Finn. I, I uh, got a message from him saying, your actions the other day got me fired for PDM. Thank you for that, I'm jobless. Which I find yeah, interesting, because yeah, we he's were been, down he... there... We sat down there on a bulldozer, and I don't think we did anything. We literally showed up, didn't we not? Literally... Literally, he was being the most passive-aggressive person last night. It was really annoying. He was on Twitter. Literally, every time anyone tweeted something about PDM, he'd reply to them. Oh, I would, but I don't have a job anymore. Like, it, once Edbert's bottom line gets affected, everything goes out the window. He doesn't. He just gets all up in arms about everything. But, but it's, I'm confused, uh, Finn. We would even like we went down there because Rudy called me down to talk to him, and then that yeah. was there. And then I told you, hey, let's go check it out. What's going on? We weren't even told why they were there. When we got there, we were informed what was going on, but we had no idea that it was actually Edward's mistake that caused this entire ripple effect. Had we Wait, known what? from the get-go. Yeah, so it was apparently it was his human error that lost his mayhem guy the bike. So Edbert's the crux of this whole thing and he has the goal to fucking point the finger at us? Uh, well, apparently, I mean, he told me we were on a fucking run, um, told me that it was just a normal error. It was an accident. It wasn't meant to be that way. Oh God, I gotta um, pop this on apparently he had try and reason with this mayhem guy saying like if you came to me uh, we could have remedy what's the word remedy the situation let me fight whatever and maybe we could have gone to the bike but apparently this mayhem guy went around bitching to everyone and i don't know that that's what started it all but i'm not saying that edward is at fault for making a human mistake that's not what i'm saying I i'm saying that. shit happens just... yeah i mean exactly it happens to the best of us but what pisses me off is that he's under the influence that we somehow like knew that this all went down oh, I, and... I i did know that it was going on i did Okay. Well, I I was kind of half I'd, and half. I I'd been approached by all like uh, Andy earlier in the day and uh, Lilith and shit like that and Rudy. Like I, I I talk to people from other MCs, right? So in my stance is I'm gonna Yo. stick up for my other MC members. Hey, I just this, is, so text. this is our yeah, no worries. Uh, come in the front of the Billy. And if Edbert is coming. valuing yeah. his civilian job over our fucking culture, our life, the things we fight and die for, uh, I mean, what's the point of having that one percent on your back? 
truth of the matter is, this does affect this. I mean, I shouldn't be a hypocrite and say hey, that this affects me, but it affects my club, right? I don't drive a cliffy. I don't drive bikes in general, because if I do, I'm probably going to murder myself around the next corner. Bro, you are an awful bike driver. Right, right. But when it comes to it, my club is bike drivers. We have seven cliffies, probably more than right. any other gang. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go it's more them. than any other gang, yeah, the most. It'd be quite hypocritical. How you doing? Yeah, I've been better. Yeah, I feel it's a common occurrence these few days. Um, uh, I want to know your entire stance on this whole PDM thing. Uh, I think it's an opportunity. I mean, at the baseline, and without going too far into a story, I think it's an opportunity for us to get more benefits from PDM. I can figure out a way to get MC exclusivity back to the MCs, boost our relationships with the other MCs. And, uh, you know, quote unquote, stop PDM from getting blown up. I came up with an idea yesterday, and I think uh, it'll make the Lost love us a lot more. Since it'll be something they've been looking to do for a long time. And uh, on the flip side, PDM will love us for stopping their fucking employees from getting killed. And what idea is this? Uh, it's pretty simple. I don't know why it hasn't been thought of before. But uh, PDM sells the cliffhanger and the gargoyle to Ironhog uh, at just above import price. Ironhog resells it to all the MCs. It's controlled by an MC, probably the biggest MC. And uh, no one can complain that it's some civilian driving it around or that it's a civilian deciding who gets it. The flip side, the loss, you know, thank us for, for helping them get something they've wanted for a very fucking long time and, and let's be honest it's a very slim chance of them ever being able to sell those bikes organically if we could still boost bikes maybe and they could they could do what we do at bbm that local back there bro uh, the stands, you so spin me right round soon. and then uh, you know the benefit for pdm is they make like 10k 20k whatever selling it to iron hog every time and they don't get fucking blown off um, do you know why this whole PDM bullshit started? Yeah, yeah, because uh, I took a silent auction bid from a Mayhem guy. Uh, it was like my first week at PDM. I fucked up one form because for some reason they make you throw out, fill out three. Uh, and he went to all the MCs and he's like, what the fuck? And then uh, they, I guess they went to PDM and I don't really understand how it went from there to, you know, let's blow up PDM. Something must happen. I mean, I, there was there was a whole thing of where at Max Power, the CEO was just like, I'm taking exclusivity away. And he still hasn't given anyone a decent enough reason for that besides drama, which you know, he refuses to elaborate on. Uh, apparently also um, one of them shot a Lost member. I haven't heard that from Rudy. I haven't heard that from anyone at PDM. That's, this is literally the first time I'm hearing that. Um... The reason I'm pissed and it's why I'm taking the fucking stance is I am not gonna have a car, a bunch of car salesmen tell me that we're not an MC. And yeah, you could argue, oh, we're a motor club, we're not a motorcycle club. I don't give a shit. Literally, they can go fuck themselves. Yeah, I'm, I, I, I'm not gonna have this patch on that's on my back spat on. Because, oh, a bunch of them don't agree that we're an, an MC? Go fuck themselves. We're still an MC, and I'm not going to have someone disrespect that. And I get that you're probably pissed because, you know, you lost your job. But leaving a shitty-ass snarky text to Jesse? I can understand in the heat of the moment, but... Is, is getting fired worth, like... Pissing uh, your fucking club off? It's it's not getting fired that, that pissed me off. It's the fact that there was just no consideration for, for me at all. No even question of like, hey, is there any way we can turn this in, into a way to benefit us you know, at all? So when all that hay shit went down, and I three out of, I don't know, four members lost their jobs? It sucked, but you stand by your club. 
But wasn't that a decision we made as a club to go and attack Hayes? Yeah, and as a club, we are going to go fuck PDM. Yeah, but we, we hadn't have made that decision as a club yet. Also, to give a little context, I think the day prior I'd spoken to Andy and asked how I felt about it. And I was like, I'm pretty sure I can speak for the club when it comes to someone disrespecting us like that. We're going to go fucking do something about it. Well, this is the first I'm hearing that yeah. know, they didn't fucking you know, think of us as an MC. Because yeah. I'm hearing very different stories on, on, the, on the flip side where they're saying, no, 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 we have no issues with BBMC. Well, do you, you don't think they're going to double back on all that shit? Literally, last storm, you should have fucking seen the shit on Twitter. Ivy twatted out that all MCs are now blacklisted from PDM. Max has been saying different shit, so... Well, uh, they need to get their fucking shit together because we are all... I think all of us. I'm not sure if it's high command only, which I need to figure out. Are going to go to this... And we're pretty sure it's going to be a unanimous decision where it's we're all just going to go fuck up PDM. And I can't have a member annoyed that they lost their fucking job because of it. It sucks, but I need to just nut the fuck up and move on. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it, it's, it's not the job thing. I mean... It's just... I don't have a lot outside of this club in the city. Oh. Right, right, right. I, I don't have a Nancy anymore. Right, she's in the fucking ground. And she's not gonna turn one place on her, is there? The best friend I once had is fucked off to another country and hates my guts. I have no friends outside of this club, so every fucking day, I'd go down there and sell some cars, and for a few fucking hours, I would forget that, you know, when no one is awake in this club, I'm not alone. And there's a few people I can talk to down there. With everything fucking going on with D and the constant shitstorm that we seem to face, it was just... It was just nice having something. It's just nice not feeling alone. And not being inside of my head for hours at a time. It was nice having a distraction. And when I wake up and that's all just ripped away from me and I didn't even get a say in it, it just... It just... made me... I don't know. You don't think waking up and uh, being told I gotta kidnap and shoot the people that I used to work with sucked? I didn't have Nancy then. I literally had Hayes and PBMC. Yeah, I guess that did suck. Oh yeah, that, that's all I fucking had. But it's just one of those cases where shit fucking happens, man, and I get it. But I think this is something that's just, just gonna happen. Okay. And I know having, having preaching to the choir when it comes to enjoying something that's outside of the club. I, I love having Nancy. I think everyone deserves an equivalent of that. But I think there's a lot more out there than just PDM, brother. I just, I, I, I can't have a, a member like that being snarky because of that shit. Uh, I don't want this to turn into a moment where I gotta start beating some fucking sense into you. I feel like I don't have to. I feel like you're brighter than that. But when it's a case of... Actually, I, it makes a little more sense now. You didn't actually know we had a, I had that conversation with. But if like, you're on Twitter like saying, Oh yeah, I'd help you, but I was fired. And all of this and all of that. It just looks bad. It makes looks bad for us. And I can't have you... Treating other members badly because you think they might have been a catalyst for that? I mean, I'm going to defend myself there. I don't think I've treated anyone badly. 
I'm just I'm just basing myself off what I've heard. Okay, well, what have you heard so I can defend myself? Uh, being snarky to Jesse, and apparently you went off on Finn. I I explained the situation to Finn, and then hung up. He went to call me back. Uh, literally, as he made the phone call, he, he, I don't know, he must have fucking, you know, something happened to him, and I spent the, the next 10, 15 minutes searching. Went all over the city, found him, brought him to a fucking hospital, then brought him back to his bike, then bought him a replacement bike to get out of there. So if that's treating your, your, your jacket badly, uh, I, I need a fucking re-education. All right, where's Finn? I want him over here. I even texted him, actually. How the fuck an is hour a rabbit over there? That. And literally said, uh, hold on, let me get you the text. Oh, that's you. I literally said, call me if you need it's something, I'm around. Finn, come over here. Okay, I'm at Dean's web. Uh, one second. All right. Yeah, uh, I just want to hash things out. I don't need people being, you know, lippy and shit. We're, we're all, I want everyone on the same fucking page, especially now, considering what this club's going through. I just want to make sure everyone's on the same fucking page. Barry, wake up! I don't like this! <laughs> I don't- I, uh, I don't think he's waking up, Chad. I'll tell you right now that, uh... Still in the Discord, and I saw uh, they named the winner for the Cliffy. Yeah, and it's uh, it's that Beach Crew guy, Larry Johnson. Beach Crew. What the fuck? Mhm. Mm hey, Andy, how you doing? Hey, hi, only uh, hi, best or, friend. Hi, only one, or, only one or two um, with you for the conversation, but the rest can come and observe and listen in. If we have too many people talking, it'll get very difficult because there's like six different groups coming. Uh, okay. So let's. But yeah, I think I'll come. All right, bet. Peace. All right, bye bye. Why the? F an exclu. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. An exclusive list and beach crew. Well, they hey, they I opened the. Okay? They opened it on this week, like halfway through, I think. Uh, doubling back, I really she says a lot. Ah! Mm -hmm. Thing back. is, from the people I've talked to, like the other employees there who I, I didn't even know, like, gave a shit about me because I'd never really talked to them, but they all fought to get my job back. They, uh, they all agree that it's fucking stupid taking away the exclusivity from the MCs. It's literally one guy who wants to do it. Well, it comes across as two now. Oh, yeah, that Ivy Poppins, yeah, yeah. Same with Hayes, one one fucking bad choice, and the next thing you know, all your employees will be kidnapped and shot. Well, I, that's what I said to him. I'm like, dude, I know how this story ends. This is exactly why Hayes is in the fucking ground. That's why no one goes to Hayes. And that was just one MC. Did like, I get you're pinged? Off five. No, I don't yeah. know if you can count Neon Tigers as an MC, because they like, sound like a fucking joke. But, okay. Yeah, that sounds like a synthwave pop band. Honestly, I'd listen to it. I mean, I'd, ch I'd check them out. Maybe if this show was like $5 entry, you know. One so I got a hunch Finn head popped, so we're going to be standing here awkwardly for a little bit, so. <laughs> Your hair's looking <laughs> different. <laughs> oh, thanks. It's a new, um, new pomade I'm using. Yeah, it looks more colorful. Thank you. It smells like apples. I've, uh, I'm genuinely, um, I'm entranced by the locals on our left. That guy's been driving around in a circle and chasing that car for since we started talking, and I can't. I've been trying to take this seriously. I'm, I'm gonna be honest, but it's so fucking hard when that's happening in the corner of my eye. <laughs> the spirit of Dundee, fucking, oh. with, uh, fucking with the locals. I mean, my head broads, like right. Barry, wake up! I need. I, I just want to say real quick, I know it's hard with the distraction there, but... I... I feel like we're all close enough that we can have disagreements, you know, like... 
like we we all should talk more right that, that's something that we've always made a made to be one of our biggest issues is, is, is we don't communicate enough so i 100 percent i communicated wrong with jesse but with finn yeah i absolutely i can't see anything wrong with what i did there i literally saved his life 10 minutes later if i can't communicate with my with my fucking boys and babes when i feel like you know well hey i think that could have been handled better I don't know what I meant to do then, because I don't want to come running to you like a little crybaby bitch every single time when we're all fucking adults here and we can handle it. You talking to me? Yeah. I Wait, who I was, else would I be talking to? I said I was going to be my head. Oh, I, I, you, I don't think you said that. I haven't heard uh, a fucking word you just said. God fucking damn. <laughs> Sorry. One second. I do need to be in my head. Literally just give me like 30 seconds. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Why did Colin fall for the sob story? Oh, he's not. I already have a sentence I know I'm going to end this with. She just doesn't come out much, especially because I know you're scared. Oh. Uh. What? Oh. Just, uh, Antonio, look away. No, uh, no, 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 no. What? The rabbit. He doesn't like rabbits. Why? I don't know. Look at her. She's a baby. All right, delicious. she's back in her carrier. You're good. Probably she's so not on the menu. Mm. I love walking past like the Chinese restaurant. Oh shit! Them, like, inside so out. Jesus. I need to make it. Why are you afraid of rabbits? I'm gonna think about coffee. Do we know when this is happening? I'm waiting on a ping. Hmm. It's gonna be a case of uh, I want everyone there, but it's literally only gonna be high command speaking. Yeah. I'll need to ride with somebody. I don't have an appropriate car right now. Just come in the Haley with me. Yeah, thank you. I love water.
kisses. It ain't easy being calling, bro. Yeah, chat, believe me. Adding me and saying, you know, go talk to him. Like, email him. He already knows, chat. If he was here, he'd be here. I head popped. Yes, and fucking Edbert's head popped. You got a med kit? Oh, I got out. Fuck's sake. You got food? No. Okay, I'm starving. <laughs> oh. I swear I get so hungry now. I get so hungry so quick. Uh, what's what? the radio again, Faye? What did I say it was? 685.1, I think. Oh, uh, okay. What was it, Faye? Uh -huh. Check. Let's go with 685.1. Six, six, Make it out. There he is. Oh, fuck. I can't hear shit. I'll be right back. I don't think we even said anything. Nope. 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 Okay. And then to respond, can't you hear? We did, one of us should have said, can you not hear me? Instead, we just <laughs> stood here silently. <laughs> yeah, we really, we really I mean, were I, just like, all right, bye. All right, bye. I, I bye, shouted, have a great time. None of us, I shouted none of us had said anything. So, you know, if you could hear then. Oh, oh well. man. See, Stevie, tell Jesse I was freaking um, you out because I was happy. I wasn't, you were freaking me out because you were happy. I thought you were manic. Which is a different problem. <laughs> Does anyone have food? No, I can take you to Burger Shop, though. And feast upon Nobody the flesh of PDM. Burger okay. Colin, can I borrow you? Pardon? Just can I borrow you before we leave? Yeah, yeah. Minutes, yeah. Minutes. Uh, it's actually Ed nine Ed minutes now. Edward Finn, we're going to hold off on that conversation, all right? All right. Okay. Oh, Bondi Blue. That's, that's the OG, isn't it? But how to, I mean, like the actual jacket. I feel like I don't wear this color enough. I always wear the white, but if I ever go to something like this, it always has to be the blue. I kind of mm. put my war cuts on, but it doesn't feel right quite mm. yet. I mean, I'm just bringing this. Maybe you should do the same. Oh, the Bondi blue AK. Oh, oh no. All right, so uh, what's, um, yeah, what's get the on. premise? Uh, everyone get on 685.1. Uh, basically, um, it's only me and you, High Command, right now, so we are going to be doing all the talking to voice our part. And I feel like you and I need to be on a unified kind of idea, and we both we both agree, fuck PDM, right? 100%. Okay, but I mean, I already knew that. I was more like what you and Ever talked about. It seemed like you didn't fucking kick his teeth then, so I was curious. No, because I want, I want, um, Edbert's basically saying, like, you know, PDM is, like, what, the only thing I have left outside of the club. And I'm like, bruh. I was like, I fucking left Hayes. I didn't give a fuck. I, w I want him and Finn to, to talk it out in front of me because apparently they had a little bit of beef. Uh, but I'm basically just going to say to Edward as, as a whole, uh, I really don't give a fuck. Fuck PDM. And I... Um, that text message to me, if you're not going to kick your teeth, then I will. No, I'm going to. Okay, fair enough. Because I, um, I want him and Finn to talk this shit out, but I can't have him talking to a high command member like that. Um... <sighs> Right, but we need to get going. All right, fair enough. You want me to ride with you? Um, yeah, you're gonna be running bitch on my bike though. You can, uh, you can take a demon if you want. No, I want some cliffhanger presences considering it's about cliffhangers. No. Right, I'm gonna grab a class two and then we are gonna get some food and head there, all right? What radio are we on, Colin? 685.1. Okay. Make sure if you guys have bikes, you take them tonight. Faye told me a radio that you told him. And it's nowhere near. It's like a 183. Bro, I completely <laughs> forgot. <laughs> As a call in, I agree. Let's just fucking do black cuts. No, you like black no, for everyone. No, stay in those cuts. No oh, man. Test. We are right We're gonna grab some food from Boogie Shot. War cuts. Ah, uh, yeah. Fuck. I'm getting my war cuts. Everyone in black. Oh, are we? Let's do black. Let's have a presence. We're okay. not happy. Are you on this radio? 
you want us bringing C2s or not? Because it's meant to be a friendly meeting, right? I want us to have C2s. Oh, okay, I might need to grab another one. I've got one. I got one. Beauty. Get away from my AK! <laughs> Giggled. Yeah, see? <laughs> Jesse, did you sell my AK? No. Did you sell my AK? No, Chat, it Chat, got destroyed. The earrings. Did you sell my AK? No, but we also have AKs in the house. Come to the house. Look at you. All right, I'm gonna go uh, uh, to the um, lifeguard real quick, and then I want uh, I want everyone lined up and ready to go. So make sure you get me food Here. as well, please. Yeah, I just, we just got a bunch of shit. Someone on a bike has almost took me out. Holy shit, Con. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> Face falling asleep, standing up. Like an horse, mate. Yeah, just throw her into a car. Stevie, I got a Uzi for you. Okay, uh, we're just about down there. Bad secret. Uh, really bad secret that you suck at changing your clothes inside? I was just gonna say I like you, but okay, that works too. <laughs> Go put black cuts on, TJ. Yeah, yeah no, black cuts on. Complicated. That's the best way. Do we have access to any more cliffies? Sounds for you. I can get juniors out, maybe. I think Barry's got can. one. You can grab a Helion. Literally, go check right now, and then we need to send it. You need to drop it and uh, and TJ as well has one. No. I'm also hungered. I'm good. <laughs> it's okay. I've got a side. Um, can you maybe don't worry, don't worry, pull good. another bike or something? Hey. I look for bike. Okay, I can. I don't know where anything else is. Yeah, no pink Helion. Why not? It's cute. It is cute, and I'm not taking that away from you. But today I today's want... the last day that Helion stays pink. I want. I want Bondi Why? Blue. Why? Uh, fine. Strawberry million. Butter million. Faye, I'm gonna teach you one. This is not Faye. Uh, Steve, I'm gonna teach you something. To change the wrapping on that car in mere seconds, where you can have best of both worlds. How about that? For the price of zero. I don't know what you're talking about, um, but I just want I just want pink. I think Max Cow. Max is not here. Pink huh? is powerful. You can check. Um, Max Cow, the CEO. You can take, check Barry's house. To die. Why? Otherwise, we can swing past the inbound lot and see. He just called me. Uh, Barry's is there. And, and he uh, he just said, uh, you know, I had a chat with Andy and it didn't go well. And I said, yeah, well, you know, you've kind of kind of fucked it this point kind of let it go on for too long and yeah, uh, so he decided to, to say well if like these big so bad, bad bikers want to come get me then and TJ just getting his bike we do. yeah he was doubling down on Twitter I was like we're I not said, doing strawberry million I'm gonna lose my he's shit a, I'm gonna he's a fucking egotistical prick I don't know how many times I have to tell you it's a barbell <laughs> Rebellion, yeah, okay I like Barbie the other day when he just kept saying shit like, I just oh, got brain freeze I didn't even have ice cream there's a fucking idiot Right? He's saying, oh, if I do this for the for the MCs, Cause... then Chain Gang's gonna come down. And it's like, dickhead, five MCs would wipe Chain Gang off the face of the earth. Yeah. Yeah, it's fucking stupid. All right. He needs to die. 685, everyone's on here? Yeah. All right, so just to premise this, uh, High Command's gonna be pretty much doing all the talking. I just want you there as, just to look pretty, all right? Uh, Where's anyone have access to Barry's house? Uh, I do. Uh, I'm just grabbing the bike. I'll be right there. All good. I take my Does anyone have like a bit of food? Blue. We can we give you a few minutes today. Yeah, come here. If his if his bike isn't there, then we can go to the impound lot. I gotta get this fucking thing fixed. Oh, it's blown the fuck up. No. no. Uh, we'll only be like a minute and a half. I mean, I I've got a repair kit. And I can swing it to Benny. A minute twenty. We gotta do. I got an advance. Okay. 
Oh, no, I don't. I have no oh, clue. Oh, so hop in. Go in advance, we're good. I need keys, I don't have keys. Okay, don't shout. Sorry. What the fuck are we <laughs> We're leaving me, I was scared. <laughs> I don't have keys! I, I will still leave just Mr. Binney's for body work. That should be like three seconds though. Yeah, I gotta do the same thing. All right, let's have I mean, as many bikes as possible um, and the heli on. Your TJ's just repairing. We'll be sick. That's Should we all just uh, fit in the heli in then? In that case, I'm going to send it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you're not on a cliffy, get in the heli. There's a cliffy still in the billy. I don't know whose that is. Mine. I'm on the way. Okay. All right, let me uh, grab my cup. Grip. Bringing the binnies. I'll be very quick. I'm coming, Faye. Hold on. Oh, Edward, I'm a little confused by you, bro. Maybe, maybe, maybe he just needed to hear that from Max to be like, "Wow, these guys are actual morons." Right on. If been you. Yeah, I'm here. Paying attention. Where are we meeting? It's gonna be down south. Yeah, where are you, Colin? Wow, this thing is nice. It is. I gotta go. Kisses. Oh, yeah. Down south? What is that? Um, we're gonna be going to industrial. Like, docks industrial, not industrial up by the uh, oil field. We're basically going to Dodo. Uh -huh. uh, I'll stay with you, Fair. All right, I want everyone here at the big top top. <laughs> Don't even mention it, just fucking go, come. <laughs> what did he do? I we, just hard to the, we just hit the hardest U turn of our lives. <laughs> Back to Billy. It's kind of doing circles in the middle of the fucking road, honestly. Oh, I love him. He's a crackhead. You missed when the other local was chasing behind his car. Where's the uh, blue helion? I'm uh, with Faye. I'm just making sure she's alright. We're coming back right now. The docks. Okay, let's try to keep this orderly. I know it's hard to do with um, cliffhangers. Let's keep all the cliffhangers in the front and we'll keep the charger and the helion on the back. I... Did you try to kick me? No, I was just going backwards on this. No, we're out. Oh, never. We look you sick, bro. Well, Thanks, man. So the helion passed. Oh, fuck. I got rid of the bit. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> all right, we good to go? Already. Edbert. <laughs> Speed deficit, you're facing the wrong way. Yeah. Let's keep it around. Uh, I got I'm gonna, three I'm, box lengths. I'm going to keep a limiter of about 80. Four. Oh my god, my head! He just died. Uh, uh, unfortunately, Four. shit is uh, kind of, you know. Bussin. Seeing some paranormal Bussin. shit right now. Uh, I'll, I'll blame the Australians for that. We should have turned phasing on. <laughs> good call, good call. Yeah, can we make a race and turn phasing Okay, that's <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, can we do that for a bank call in? Do you think that's oh okay? Oh my god, that's so fun. Oh that'll go great. But really the no one will notice when they try and pit us, they just go through us. Jesus, Jesus speaking of pitting. Oh, right. I think the Hellion got just... Yeah, hold on, let's wait. Wait, 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 w
Hey, I think we need a wool seaside next. Reggie said fuck the BBMC. Yeah, it's because it's it, I was trying to park my car and he wouldn't move, so I hit him with my car. Huh? <laughs> No, we're not warring Seaside, just specifically Reggie Mate. Yes, we're trying. No, 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 we're at war with no, no. <laughs> Reggie Veggie Mate, is that his name? Sold the bike. Oh. What up, guys? Yo, welcome, yo, yo. welcome. Uh, just up the stairs, be mindful of the beam. You might need to uh, crouch, run at it, and try not to fall. Oh, Hi. God. Oh, yeah, God. What? Why is it on something well. high? I am going to fall off. You'll be fine, all right? Lucky it's only a water. Yo, what up? Yo. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Head on up. Oh. All right, well, 07 me, boys. I am I'm not making it off this thing. Colin, you're going to be okay. I believe in you. You can do it, Colin. Hello? You get that ping? Oh, hello. Hello. This is so fancy. Uh, I can't. No, 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 no. Colin's fallen. Is he okay? I will get... <laughs> bro, I fucking told you, bro! I have band-aids. Colin, don't embarrass me in front of our new cool friends. Can we not, can can we not lose the staircase, please? Can we not? Any of you talk about this? Commit to getting through that. Just whatever you do, don't jump. Yeah. Kind of, uh, kind of really look through your eyes and uh, Push your way crouch. Through it. Yeah. Crouch it yeah. Yeah. Walk up to it, and then even if you feel like you're stuck, uncrouch as you're walking. The, the worst part is. Give it a wiggle. Yeah. Ever, you're there. in our way. Oh. I know, oh. I've been BBMC forever. Hello. Hello. Oh, what's up? Hi, Name? Colin. Go ahead. I'm making sure no weirdos. It's me, Colin. I have band aids, by the way, Colin. <laughs> this is sick. Hi, Colin. Sure, we'll start it. Hi! My favorite daughter in law. Look, I'm intimidating. Kachu, kachu. You are scary. <laughs> this is fucking sick. Right? I love it. Look, yeah. up there, you can see your... your... Hey, the, I'm a Bondi oh, boy. That's me. You are. Oh, that's, that's you me. up there. That's me. That's you. <laughs> that's, <okay. laughs> that's you up there. Hi. This feels uh this feels like when you show up to a party and like everyone's sort of already in their clicks. <laughs> Bing, get the fuck over Only here. Only a little. You know what you did? You did it. Stop talking to the other people. I was saying hey. Where is Jesse? <laughs> Tonyo. Jesse, are you good? Tonyo, how are you gonna make us look less cool than the fucking neon tigers, bro? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Bruh, everybody's wearing Colors. black. We should have worn around, baby around, blue. It would have been a power play. Yeah. Leaders, take your seats at the table first. I guess if your number two wants to sit by you, go ahead. Oh. If ten chairs, fight for them. Oh. Take the chairs, sis. I sit at your right you? hand. Jesse, Just you're the leader, like motherfucker. You're the leader. Here, let's see. <laughs> chill, chill. Can we all make sure we're shouting as well? Yeah, yeah. make sure we're shouting. Yep, yep. I don't know if we want like prospects or whatever you your equivalent is, R H O B, whatever. I mean, we could be have up the on top. Go play with each other if you want. Yeah, go up top. Make sure nobody's gonna come. Yeah, in. Go I mean, you, off and go play with each most, other. most Friends. people know right. what this is about, so it's uh, completely dependent on you guys. I mean, if you want them here or not. Yeah, it's up to each individual group. Uh, I will say for H O B. 
Uh, I would say go up top. I would People say, look yeah, out fuck for a while. prospects. Rotate out, out if you want to listen to some of it. No, I'd say fuck the prospects, man. They're all bitches. <laughs> Uh, I want you guys to hear this. It involves the entire club, so stay here. Look at them. Does that ball go play yep. with each other? Or get to know each other? <laughs> Jesse, Do not Jesse, jump, Jesse, jump down there, nerds. All it takes is one person to throw a bomb down here and we're fucked. What a beautiful fucking I think they slide. fucked themselves more than they fuck us, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, it's really cool. I don't know, it probably hit all of us. Hey, <laughs> throw it right on the table. All right. What do you get to help? Alright, are we good? There you go. I think we're good. Um, just put the food on the ground. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if anybody needs food, just take it as, as needed or whatever. Colin, yep, sit. No, that's not Willis his chair. Has the buns on top of her head. She's got a shit ton of it if you need any. Yep. Um, feed, feed me okay. Jesse's he's equal. He's not going to do that. Yes, but yeah, just throw all of it, I guess. All right, everybody good? Can everybody hear me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Maybe meet your phones as well. It hasn't been said right. yet. Yeah. Good luck with it. All right. Uh, as most of you know, we are gathered here today for one common goal. We have one common problem, and that is PDM. We have uh, been stifled when it comes to buying hogs. Each of us, I mean, I'm sure a lot of people have uh, come in contact with the new system that is at PDM in regards to the silent auction bullshit. Uh, basic rundown, if you do not know, uh, they have changed the way they sell the hogs now. Uh, instead of it just simply going to the MCs or at least having some yeah, sort of activity uh, to us because we are MCs, two. they decided to take the bikes to silent auction. Uh, when pressed about this issue, they told us that they were going to then give us, all of us, a bit of an exclusive silent auction in which we could bid for hogs for our clubs. And not even a week later, they have gone back on that deal to line their own pockets so they could sell the bikes. Oh, HOA is huge. People don't because realize that. They deem the price too low. Flip hangers, this is what 60K, I stuff their fucking pockets. Too low right. of a price for them. So they need to drive it up 300, 400, 500K so they can line their own pockets. This mm. meeting here today is to discuss what our solution will be to that problem so we can all come together and we can get the fucking hogs that we feel i would hope we all rightfully deserve a shot at here, here. all right uh, uh on top of that right before oh sorry go ahead sis no go for it, go for it. That was all. Uh, uh right before this meeting man. actually um max power has been made aware of this meeting in some capacity and seems like he tried to get a hold of me right before I came to this. So he said a lot about um, how he wanted to come to a conclusion, but also had a massive accountability issue, uh, saying he doesn't understand why he got shot. He got shot for no reason. Um, he doesn't want to deal with being bombed there and there's been threats and I'm gonna blacklist all of you. But at the same time, uh, also stated that <laughs> he wants to come to a conclusion. He wants to continue auctions. The only thing he put on the table was um, that he will keep it MC exclusive, provided that at least five people bid on the bikes. Otherwise, it'll be open to the public. I told him personally, I thought that was fucking stupid because then one person who really, really wants a bike and the specific bike that he's offering is going to be at the whim of four other people who have to put down money who may or may not want it. Um, I told him there were a lot simpler solutions, like following these lists they claim they had in the first place. He said that all of this shit either wasn't him, it wasn't me, I wasn't in charge of the time, yada, 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 yada. Um, I tried to kind of gear him in a way that would potentially work out, engage if he would even be so logical as to engage in something like that or make a deal with us. Uh, but I can honestly say that my opinion is he probably will not. At the end of the day, he wants money. He will not take accountability for any of this. Um, Cerberus doesn't give a flying fuck about what happens with all of this after he ran to them. 
Uh, oh, yeah, elaborate on that. So, uh, to elaborate on that, this individual, the one that she speaks of to catch everyone up to speed, said that they would be getting servers involved on this front to deal with us. We've also all been completely blacklisted from PDM already. Oh. Before we even, you know. Yeah, to, it, to me, it's a little counter fucking productive if they're like, yeah. Uh, we're happy to work with you guys. Here's the deal, but also you're already fucking blacklisted. They can suck my fucking balls. I already want to bomb the place. Also, Reed shot him the other day because he was a mouthy prick. Yeah. Fair. Um, Mila Smoke from Auto's dead call. She says she doesn't support anything that they're doing. None of us are banned from Auto's. She wants to make that clear. Um, she would appreciate if it weren't on the lot of Auto's, but she knows shit happens. Uh, she wants to be in control of PDM and has wanted to for a while. Uh, she said that this meeting Max had with Cerberus only made him look like he's doing a terrible job in the eyes of Cerberus, so there's a good chance he might not even be who we have to deal with in the future. Um, she also said that Autos is capable of bidding on the bikes that go up in the silent auction from PDM, and she offered that if anybody wants a bike for somebody really, really badly, she would be willing to put a bid in, like, via Autos to then resell to the person from the silent auction. It's all willy belly. Yeah, to be honest, I think I think they should have lost the right mm -hmm. to fucking sell bikes after after what they've. This has been going on for over a year. It's been going on for literally far too long. Like yeah. no, I think we, we, we were we, we were really anymore. lucky because we managed to get a lot of our bikes really early. But I know yep. the HOA because I've spoke to girl a lot, and she's been saying like a lot of you have been struggling for fucking like bikes like cliffhangers, cargo stuff like that. There's only a couple of, couple of years with them. Yeah, let's not get this twisted. This isn't a Leslie thing. When I dealt with Leslie to buy my mm -hmm. bike, it was, uh, you know, yeah, you're an MC. This makes sense. Of yeah, yeah Le Le Leslie bike. does make sense. This is whoever is uh, currently running the show. This Max guy, uh, whoever else is running the show to line their pockets. People obviously benefiting uh, with monetary value. These are the guys that are trying to stick it to us. And I agree that we are well past that point now to make sure. a deal. We've come to the table multiple times individually to make a deal. I feel like we are past that. Oh, yeah. yeah, I mean, you say that, yeah. you know, we're blacklisted now, but I feel like a lot of us have wanted bikes for a very long time. And fortunately, I'm not one of those people, but I know for a fact, even in other clubs, people have wanted bikes for a very, very long time and they just haven't been able to get them. So in effect, we've been blacklisted. Even longer, yeah. honestly. Yeah, this affects yeah, nothing. They blacklisted us from yeah, what we can't something already we get. already can't get. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, Max's argument was, oh, there's been MC exclusive bikes for so long. I'm like, cool, then why does nobody fucking have them? Then he the says, they're going to shit to start with. They Literally, the, the list goes, started ruined. Yeah, he goes, why do the Lost need cliffhangers or gargoyles when they have a personal Lost bike? And I'm like, it's not for you to fucking say. Just take their money and sell them the goddamn bike. The thing the thing with that Lost Damon as well is we don't mind if other people buy that because I, well, only one of us ride that in the club. So if yeah. any of you's ever wanted to get one of them, obviously the Lost Damon, you know, we wouldn't give a shit. Yeah, just just, put, hey, a, hey, just hey. put a towel on the seat or something. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well... Uh, I feel like everybody is pretty pissed given the fact that you've shown up here. Uh, I don't feel like Max is somebody worth reasoning with. Um, if Mila came in, honestly, if Mila replaced him, I feel like we'd have a better chance because from my experience, uh, Mila does tend to run shit pretty well and actually gives a shit about the people instead of the money she's making. Uh, but that's not our situation right now. So, like Sis said, we need to figure out a solution moving forward from this. And honestly, my personal preference would be to not deal with these places at all. Yeah, let's have me. I fucking wish they took the bike business up in, to the north. Like, even like if you Ironhawk could take over all the bikes, that would be the perfect Yeah, I, I, I don't know why a bunch yep. of fucking car salesmen are the people determining who and when get, you know, fucking MC bikes. But to me, it makes Agreed. sense that Ironhawk should be fucking doing this shit. That also brings up some love up there as well. I don't know what that can work out, but I'm guessing Max going to fight that too, right? To be honest, well, why, do they, is, have, why is, do they have to do uh, silent auctions like, anyway? Do they do silent auctions with everything at PDM? They, no, they did, they, no, they did no, silent auctions to, to get the price up. Auctions are the bikes. Exactly. Half the list is the bikes. Yeah. So I don't understand why they actually have to do the fucking It's because they're why fucking money hungry. The fucking sale price, though. It's Instead three, of being it's greedy too, bastards. It's because yeah. yeah. Southside gangs keep wanting to buy them. That's, that's why. Just cash grab. If I if I can say a couple of words. Uh, first off, um, thank you, HA and Andy, for uh, making this um, happen. All right. This is really appreciated. Also, um, I admire your patience because my, my patience is old. If I would have it, if I would have it my way, 
I go I, I go down there on a on a daily basis. I will fuck the place up. I will I will fuck those people up because I'm just fucking over it, right? I am I will um, inter intercept their freaking shipments of bikes. I will steal all that all that fucking shit instead yeah. of making with my fucking trousers down and show them my my bare fucking ass. <laughs> that's how I that's how I wanna deal with those people. So, that's it. I know there that many people want uh, wanted a diplomatic solution for it. Um, we need to come to an agreement there. But if I would have it if I would have it my way, for me talking is fucking over. Yeah, I think we're I, I, far I, past a diplomatic solution. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I yeah, that's why we're here. here. <laughs> so look, yeah, I, uh, well. I, I will go on record now, and I, I, I've heard the suggestion a couple times leading up to this meeting about blowing up PDM, and that is that is great, and I am, I would be for that, and I'm sure a lot of people here would be for that. However, yeah. I do have it on good authority that I was told that uh, if we did go that route, uh. The money from the city will more than likely be funneled to PDM and street sweepers will probably come and, and clean that shit up like they split. Meaning it will not last very long. We would oh. potentially be risking the nines here uh, and not complete the objective that we want. If we want the bikes, if we blew it up, it could just get swept under the rug and we wouldn't get what we want. So that he says I have fought the fucking Senate once. I'm not afraid of those guys. I understand. Look, I'm just saying I talked to our favorite terrorist, and that that was the that was the retort. You know, is that uh, if we did go that route, and I'm not saying we do, we can't, or you know, Shouldn't I'm just saying it, it could I mean, very well get wiped away instantly. Well, I mean, they, I they do the have the expensive cars and shit out in the parking lot. We don't have to blow up PDM itself. Just take out the fucking cars that they have there and actually give them a reason to have the fucking money for the bikes. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I honestly, and the idea of stealing their shipping manifest and trying to get those bikes mm -hmm. ourselves and taking them up north and having something for us, something under our fucking collective banner, even if it even even if it does go to just Iron Hog, if we fucking yoink them from PDM, then yeah. at least we would know it would be under a banner that would treat them right and would you know divvy them out accordingly and not with bias based on how it, how much it lines your pockets. I mean, that would actually be a be a good uh, be a good thing though, um, like intercepting the shipments, just put them up. It's um, just it's just a question though, um, how we do it then with the don't don't they need to be registered or something? I mean, um, the local terrorist might be able to fucking hack the fucking database or something. Who knows? Who knows? He's he's a very he's a very handy man. No. Yeah, I don't I don't know shit about it. Heck. It's a shipping I manifest. I fuck, I have no idea either. Surely I mean, they keep the, a track the of their meantime, imports and exports. If that is Plan A. Plan B would obviously be the. These guys are so worried about their their money supply. How do we cut off the money supply going into PDM? I mean, to Rudy's point, I guess about fucking up their business. Yeah, I don't yeah. think car salesmen can sell cars if they've got a bullet in their head on the middle of fucking nowhere. Mm -hmm. Fair point. I mean, when uh, true, ba true. back when we fucking blew up Hayes, they had a a heli on that we wanted off them, and they weren't gonna fucking give it. So every day we would go to Hayes, we would kidnap every single employee, drag them out, and leave a fucking message. You, you stay with Hayes, you're staying with the wrong fucking people. We put a bullet in their fucking heads, and at the end, we got what we wanted. I mean, I do get it. Like, um, dragging in civilians that have no, that has nothing to do with uh, the, the positions of the guys that are on the top is, is, a, is a bit out there, and people do not, do not fucking like it. But from time to time, stuff like that gets the message across. You know what I mean? So, you heard him. Um, yeah, the BBC... Got it, got it done, right? With yeah. The, um, so it's 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 also one. I, I, it's it's. I will say it's the least elegant approach that we could do. I I know if we bomb it and you know they clean it up, it's not like a concrete solution. But for me, I think it's a good like keep, keeping as much pressure on them as fucking possible, so we can like hurt that kind of money that's coming in, and then maybe talk to the big man upstairs and see if we can get our hands on a shipping manifest and whatever the fuck that is. Yeah, I mean, once you uh, explain to each PDM employee what's going on and what their management are doing, 
And uh, if they continue to support that and continue to advertise as PDM in the yellow pages, then they're supporting what the managers are doing. And so did they just have a bone in the head, in my opinion. Well, well we all... Th Go ahead, Jason. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, we're, we're not just fucking dragging out workers and putting a bull in their head. We're always giving them a choice, right? Like like you said, you explain the situation, and, uh, you know, nine times out of ten, they'd be like, I didn't even know this was happening. I understand. And they kind of walk away. Um, that's also an effective way to kind of let them know what's going on. It always doesn't have to end with a bullet. I'm well, pretty we sure that Max guy was saying to Reed that if we did manage to take the bikes off him, it'd be, he, he'd, he'd love that. Which, I, again, I don't understand then, then why he's doing all this shit. I don't believe one fucking word that uh, Snake is um, actually saying. So, yeah. I think, ju I just that, yeah, judging yeah. off, like, the miscommunication they had on Twitter, of, like, Max being like, yeah, I'm just trying to help out. And you got Ivy twining about, like, uh, yeah, they're already blacklisted. It sounds like there's just no fucking communication. It sounds like one person saying another, one person saying another. I, I agree with you. I don't fucking trust them at all. I think at this point, they're just trying to save their asses from, you know, every fucking MC hunting down their fucking employees. 100%. Why would, why would the guy that's lining his pockets uh, be okay with giving up the bikes that he's driving up the price on? That's what I'm. That's what I'm uh, yeah, saying. Don't make, don't make no sense. I don't. I don't believe him because you know, you know what I mean. This 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 guy makes no fucking sense in the, in the uh, first first place. He uh, he was talking about oh they are not making enough enough money on your, your bikes. Yeah, maybe then don't stifle your own fucking business in like like having your thumb on them fucking bikes that you only get like like one or two every fucking blue blue blue, blue moon sell those fucking things you know don't don't put a fucking auction out there no sell actual bikes i don't I mean, fucking I've, get I've, it i've known max for a long fucking time since he first started working which at mc PDF. is that he's literally been about the money that's all he's ever cared about like he he won't fucking just give that shit up i don't think especially if it's lining his pockets yeah another kevin ram can I actually, uh, out of curiosity, if everybody can hear me, can I see a show of hands just pointing there? Who is waiting for a bike that has wanted one or currently wants one? I'm gonna raise my hand because I have a member that's currently waiting for one. Yeah, or if you got members that aren't here. All right. A lot of bikes. All right, go ahead and say. I just Jesus. want to say How again, my, right my entire experience with PDM, even from back in the days with these lists, where is that these PDM employees, you can't trust what they say. They will say whatever just to get past that situation without any foresight into the actual future. They, like, I uh, can't tell you how many times people have, quote unquote, been on a list and then were never actually on a list, etc. Oh, I, I really don't think um, a lot of talking is going to solve any problems here anymore. That and I think people people putting their hands up there shows a lot. They're claiming they're not making enough money. What? There was probably about ten plus hands up there. That's hundreds that, that, of that, that, that is hand, literally yeah. eight hundred. Like, what you what is eight hundred grand? Not a fuck enough money. You want just eight oh eighty k? We need more. Fuck right off. Mm. I hate you these. You know what they're selling the list. bikes for though, right? They're selling for like half a million for seven hundred k when they're auctioning these things off. So that that's why they're taking that stance because like, they're literally it's filthy yeah, yeah. how much money they're making. Like eighty eighty fucking grand bikes that are that are in there for like 80 90 fucking mm -hmm. grants they they go over the fucking table for like five six seven eight hundred thousand dollars it's it's some fuck country out there it, i mean i've talked I to victor direct and his, his reasoning is that they don't feel like the 60k price point is enough for the way the current economy is in the city they can feel they, my fucking nuts says yeah, well, i'm over there you go that's, <laughs> what, that's, that's what they're saying dude, dude, fucking right. the, the only reason why the economy is so fucking high with bikes is because they keep selling them to fucking people who just want to flip them for the fucking price of oh, and i know how we can keep so, the like, pocket of pdm really like, high you just yeah. fucking sold them to mcs you wouldn't fucking have the prices going up as high you'd fucking that? sell them for what they're worth see he brought that up so, to me on the phone he said when we're they pull out a car flipping them i'm like okay motherfucker if you're the leader of this business and you've heard of a thing called a it's fucking gone. contract and sue the shit out of them if right? they break it. It, it, it doesn't just, you know, hard. get swept back really into the garage. It's, really it's gone, gone. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I've also so made we would get people to go up as we, decoys. We don't do that. Ask for <laughs> test drive. Have the cars pulled out. Go for the test drive and then anyone from any one of these MCs is waiting somewhere with their guns or whatever. Takes the car and blows it up. They've just lost a three, four, five hundred K fucking car. Nobody here is flipping. That's something I would want to get, you know, someone's way in on first. Yeah, that, that's pretty. That's pretty smart. No, that's not gonna happen. Sell them. That's a man upstairs. I wasn't sure if it was murky or not.
Yeah, 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 okay. Well, maybe we can ask the terrorist guy. What do you think about that? Yeah, I think that's actually a good idea. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't want to say anything and, you know, I, yeah, I'll just tell you any ideas I have. I don't know. Yeah, it's a bit... Alright, well, look, uh, it seems like we're all in unison here about the main goal being to get the bikes away from PDM as a whole. Get them away from the shop. If we can get them under even the Iron Hog banner, if we can get them under a banner that suits us, obviously that would be the play. That's the main objective here. The secondary objective being keep the pressure on PDM and what that looks like, I guess that's what we should decide. If, if, if we heart bombing the shit out of them, if we're fucking shooting them, if we're doing all that, by all means, we all need to know going in what that could potentially look like and how the cops would spin that because a lot of us, handful of us, could end up, you know, Maybe in the lost position fucked. where we're, you know, in for the nines or something like that. If we're okay with that, you know, let's uh, let's come together and decide on that. My, uh, At least I'm getting, personally, getting I've gone in for treason before. I'll do it again. Oh, yeah. And look, you guys, I know the lost guys are already, you guys have yeah. been there, done that. <laughs> I, 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 want, I want everybody to at least know the weight of what that looks like, you know, because the cops will piece that together and they will try to have that stick on us. My, uh, my patch brought up the idea there, um, that what if we test drive their cars and rob them? Rob them. Now. A person yeah. doing then the your, test drive. Yeah. We then get your deposit is gone, though. Hmm. Oh, shit, yeah. Fuck. I mean, can we even <laughs> test drive it for blacklisted? <laughs> true, actually. We can't oh, test yeah, drive well, shit. Well, <laughs> oh, yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if, if, they're, if their big problem is, you know, the bottom line of, oh, we are making enough money, that's when you cut off their money supply. You sit there and you drive away every single fucking customer that comes in and tell them to get lost. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send an email, Everett. I think that's a good idea. I, think I, I agree with that. Yeah, that, I mean, 2500 to destroy a fucking 500k car, like, I, it, you, with, you know, know, they're not going to survive off $2,500 fucking budget. deposits when they're losing $500,000 cars. No, he does. Obviously, they already caught and the whole point is you use a decoy, you use someone that's not MC, you know, in an MC, to go in there so that they're not blacklisted, get them to take the car, and then we blow the fuck up. That person doesn't get in trouble because we're also going to, you know, quote unquote, harm them. And we just keep doing this over and over again. I'm, I'm not saying it is or isn't, but I'm saying this is how the cops are going to operate. You know this, right? They, they will definitely see the reoccurring theme. Because everybody, the fact is, everybody here. I mean, we're going to be able to cover all fucking time zones. These guys aren't going to be able to breathe. I was actually and thinking. And if that it. is the case, I mean, they will eventually link this together. Yeah, that's true. Well, I feel like we're we are, okay with that. We're okay with that. I feel like we are all dancing around the topic of just bombing this shit out of it. I know, I know, we as uh, the Bondi boys are quite happy with that shit. We've been on multiple business. We blew up PDM once before. We'll do it again. Hey, Amen. Did it a few weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, hey. I mean, if that's uh, if that's where everybody uh, is at in unison, then we'll fucking do that. We keep the pressure on them every day. I mean, yeah, I really um, I think what um. um... Yeah, no, we need to turn their employees against them for sure. I would say trying to get the I mean, shipment manifest. Like, there's cooler well, rooms to stay, but a literal sit in is really a So, like, you just literally have people sitting there oh, at the shop as this, often um, as we possibly uh, can, keeping stuff. people from buying things. I know a couple of people that are really handy with, like, computers and fucking shit, and that I also have good um, contacts. So, let's see if I can. If we if, if we can get our hands um, on some of these um, shipment routes or what's so, what's so fucking ever to intercept that stuff. You no? Know? Mm. I um. What if we just pay the employees not to show up and sell cars? What? <laughs> I don't think anybody I'd be honest with you. Pay these people <laughs> I don't want to give them a dime. Fuck off. I think showing up in fours, like showing other? up in fours, will just be enough. I'm pretty sure. I think once, what if, uh, um, once every time a PDF employee gets a call, uh, they start shooting themselves, wondering if this is actually an MC member laying a trap, then they're not going to want to show up to work, and they're going to want to stop advertising as PDM. I mean, instead mm. of instead of you know, why don't you just give them like anonymous phone calls? I suggest you don't turn up for work today. You know, something bad might happen. Are you good? It's not where you tell yeah. them they're one of the good ones, Gary. What if we could talk to the? Um, pictures of me yeah, all the time. I I keep hearing that fucking shutter. What if um we could get in contact with the um 
the puppet master and if he's able to get his hands on the shipping manifest and maybe we could get um bikes in that way in the form of a of a an m boost i mean even if we're just joining the parts i mean we could probably forward the parts to mm -hmm. iron hog and then you know yeah. these guys could probably and then you, you could build the bikes scratch yeah you know honestly know. that um, <laughs> sorry this no it's I fine um go ahead i don't know about the puppet master though i think he's a bitch um <laughs> i <laughs> Oh god damn! Oh my! I mean, I am saying openly. He um, he um, he is a fucking scary ass bitch. I um, um stole stole his fucking tools. I told him that on the on the um uh, fucking phone. And to this day, I'm waiting to I'm uh, waiting for him to actually show up and um, get get his get his stuff stuff back. But so um, you far he's just hiding in the fucking bushes somewhere. But, um, <laughs> so I don't know about that. Uh, I'm just trying to think of y'all you know, cover every base. You know, I just think it's an idea. Uh. Yeah, I do agree with that. When we when we have that information, if we can creep in there and grab that information, we can start hitting their supply chain from the source direct. Obviously, that mm. would work towards our uh, number one goal. As long as we continue with the secondary goal of keeping the pressure on, I guess. Yeah. I think um, like every every individual group out here. If they just do their 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 best or take some um, time of their of their day, I mean, I think we basically cover every every um, time zone there, and if every everyone out here does mm -hmm. does his part to um, keep the fucking foot on their stupid ass neck, like like day in and day out, they will fucking feel it. So they actually, will. this can be a case of like, okay, Monday to Tuesday, lost, you hit it. BBMC, you get the kids from Schedule. Wednesday to Thursday, like <laughs> every other weekend, bro. <laughs> <Because of divorce. laughs> no, I mean, like, like keep the pressure up, you know, all day, all day long. And while that is done in the um, background, um, we can we can think and talk about bigger um, um, things to actually um, do to them. I you know what I mean? Details done. Yeah, yeah like 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 stealing a temporary approach while we figure like out something more concrete. Things. Yeah, I like that. I feel that. Same. Agreed. All right. Everybody is down for the calls in unison. Fuck yep. yeah. 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 the dogs. Right. Right. There may be casualties along the way, but we know what we're signing up for now. It's for mm -hmm. the one common goal so we can get these fucking bikes. Hey. Absolutely. All right. All right. Well, hey, I just want to say thank you all for coming and, and making the time out to fucking do this. This is really cool. I know everyone was probably busy Absolutely. gold panning. Oh God! Please, please not this. Let's go penning and penning about. Listen, I got all the mats I need for want... like a month. Oh no! <laughs> that's you don't the problem. problem. You really don't want to know, honestly. Mm, okay. Just know you can rob a lot of people right now. Oh, good. <laughs> all right. If anybody else wants to say any piece, by all means, before we let everybody go back to doing what you do. Fuck PDM. Yeah, please. Fuck PDM. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck PDM. Fuck PDM. Fuck PDM. Right. PDM. PDM. Oh, PDM. God. I'll Cheers keep to that. Uh, great right. Just, right. Roll just to clarify real quick, so I don't waste my time. Uh, I'm no longer gonna write a business proposal for what was suggested when we were all at PDM last time. Correct, because we're trying to get bikes to go to Iron Hog. Is that what I'm understanding? And I, I completely support that, by the way. I just want to make sure I'm not wasting my time. Uh, maybe do write one just in case Iron Hog doesn't get it. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. Know. I mean, we don't okay. know. I, I, I think like, I mean, it might have a better shot if it was like an in unison like all clubs thing. Yeah. You know, there's a lot of people there. You know. I mean, that's how I would structure it, it regardless. Honestly, I would want there to be like a board oh of directors. Oh my God! There for every Holy club. shit! I, I like that actually. I think that would be no, really neat. Yeah, cool. It would not. It would not be like us controlling. It would be completely for the MCs. I mean, that would you know, even if anyone group was at war, I would expect that not to be involved with anything. You know, business is yeah, business. Yeah, this, this issue is uh, yep. besides mm -hmm. any any kind of exactly. other shit that we may or may not have going on. Absolutely. Actually, I do, I do have one question, and maybe it's looking ahead a little bit into the future. But say uh, hypothetically, Iron Hog were to be able to get the uh, the bikes, right? Um, how, would we continue doing silent auctions there for the MC gang? So how would you run it? So if we, if we get and, the bikes, what? we'll just and, sell, and, just sell them. Yeah. Oh. Right. So with my original proposal for Iron Hog before it opened, um, I proposed that you know I could build bikes for people, and yeah. the way that the waiting list would work is doesn't matter what club you're from, it goes by rank. 
president puts in a request for a bike, they get it first before some prospect puts in a request for a bike, regardless of when it was put in. That would be the waiting list rather than, you know, blah, blah, blah. But if the president of a club said, hey, this prospect really needs a bike, they could put their name forward for them. Fucking love that. Thank you. I think it sounds so that fair. way it isn't, you know, it, it's all transparent. Everybody knows what's going on and there's no special treatment, you know. Oh, well, you know, this guy from my club really wants this bike, so I'm going to give it to him first. No goes by rank like that a lot thank you yeah i like that idea nice. where a rotation would be good as well i think i think it would be also so, important to note like okay yeah let's say a lower rank's been waiting for like god knows fucking time. long i think it's important to note that as well oh yeah. nice yeah. all yeah, right exactly hold on guys. i like we the idea of a like club rotation yeah, we, we have a guest yeah. outside really? oh who yeah oh. his name is bloom Person. Stinky. <laughs> Somebody got a little nosy. Yeah, bring him down here. Bring him down here. Hey, what's the problem? All we're doing is just drinking and talking. Well, hold on. You, you told me you told me he drove around the block, saw the bikes, and didn't know where we're at. Is oh, Blue's up the center about? of attention, man. He, he needs to he needs to make himself known. Yeah, know? he wants to know what's going on. We should show him what's going on. Yeah, I, agree. Uh, I, I haven't I haven't shot day. a cop in a day or two, so. I would leave. I feel like never mind. Actually, actually uh, that's a good point to bring up. Uh, since we did, we were down at PDM and we had uh, Vale and Snow come up, and they, weirdly mm. enough, just straight up agreed with all of us. They yeah, thought the system that we're doing supportive. was completely fucked, and they said we yeah. support all of you in this. That's crazy. Yeah. That to be honest, crazy. when I was, uh, when I was, yeah. turning some <laughs> there stuff are in sprays around. This is yeah. all turned. Yeah. PDM C. PDM When I was turning some stuff in the sanitation over there, Bill Mays was there, and he was talking to Reed about. Reed's case and we brought up the fact about we want fucking bikes out of PDM and he was on about talking to the mayor's office I don't know how much Fuck the, the mayor's, mayor's office, office might fucking you know they're probably blagging us and that but the mayor's Blue office would be saying that you should just be ready for anything they at this point. would be up for helping us potentially get bikes or some shit like that. Or joints, I got I'm, um, I'm saying it now and I'm, and I'm and I'm not saying it because I because I've got any friend She's also from a, from another MZ. She was the only mayor that actually did for shit. All the others. That's what I love it. Shot us, yeah. Come on, Bloom. Who asked for the drink? I think there's a hundred people. Bloom, get over here! I'm telling you right now, if I yeah, see Bloom... Bloomer's market was still the best thing in the entire city that ever happened to the mayor. If I see Bloom touch that radio, I'm gonna shoot him. He already did. He's he, he already hit the radio on the top of the, uh, the top of the stairs. Not committing a crime, it's for us to look at. Oh, welcome, Bloom. There's a seat just for you, buddy. Yeah, right there, Bloom. Yeah. Yeah, sit right down, Bloom. Welcome. If you if you fucking touch if you touch this fucking radio on your on your on your, on your shoulder, you can't collect your teeth. All right. Okay. Well, up? just telling y'all, you're going to want me to touch my radio in about five minutes. But okay. Uh, Why is that, Bloom? The table? He called out a status check every seven uh, well, minutes. No, so. I, I told them to check out me every four minutes. Oh, and then, four minutes. Uh, I saw Get on the table. I... Stop giving those fucking excuses. Okay. All right. Um. Oh, dance, bitch. <laughs> dance. Uh, Dance, yeah, 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 do a little sexy dance. Let's see, let's see what sexy there, dance? Come on. Yeah, let me yeah, see what you're working with. Dance for us. Oh, don't run away from this. Don't run away from this. Sexy dance, huh? Okay. Yeah, man. Oh, oh, oh man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, okay, there we go. What brings That's you to it. the MC Summit? Mm -hmm. your, your mom must be uh, fucking proud of you, Bloom. Well, she's dead, and... What brings you down here, Bloom? I miss her a lot. Sounds like she's not... Your fucking mouth, down on Sounds like she's not missing out. Uh... I, I'm really... You're really taunting me right now, you fucking assholes. Um... So... Uh -huh. How's it going? Hey! What you, what you doing down well, here, what Bloom? What the fuck do you want? What's up? Uh, you were question. being nosy, and now you're here. No, no, uh... Well, you character. know what? This might get me out of... A little bit of trouble and maybe focus towards yourselves. I, I was pinged here anonymously. Really? You're f <laughs> disgusting. Really? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I don't. You think I, you think I'd come down here? Who the fuck comes down to Cum Street? Grinders. Wait, is this actually Cum Street? Yes. Cum Street. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, the H is silent. Oh. Yeah. Oh. All right. Oh. What'd you, what did you see down here, Bloom? I just saw like a bunch of cars, here. and then I was going to leave, and then so I was. So what are you seeing right now? I don't. Do I don't now? believe that. <sighs> Why do you make me say this every time, sis? What do you see? 
I don't see anything, sis. Someone get his phone and see who's called him throughout the day to know what his actual PayPal thing is. good. I'm a good boy. I'm a good boy. Yeah, you are. Glad to hear it. Cool. So, uh, should I get? I could get. Uh, look at the time. Sent that Wait, can I have a look at your ID first before you leave? Um. Uh, my ID. Yeah. Uh. I just want to see where you live. Uh. Uh. We might not have any, but I, I, he I, has I, them I, on him. They know where I live. They. They. they... Yeah, but some of us don't. So. Yeah, some of us don't, Bloom. Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, might as well just read it off. Yeah. How's your beachside mm -hmm. app apartment there going, buddy? Yeah. I live. Uh. I. I, I live at. I believe it's 13 Bridge Street. That's my home. What's your sign? Uh, I, I like the yield signs. Uh, okay. You're the worst. What's your zodiac sign? Oh, like the killer. Uh, what what is it in December? Is that kid? Sagittarius. Christmas. Sure, that's when I was born. In December 19th, right there. Mm. I don't. Um, uh, so what's what's happening? What's what's popping? Like you said, nothing, Bloom. Nothing. Yeah, nothing, nothing. So I. You're just having a fucking drink. I got it. I got a chair too. You know. Uh huh. Why don't you go find whoever sent that ping? It's so anonymous, and there's like 200 people. It didn't, it didn't come from in here, Bloom. It came from that lip. It came from that lip. Uh -huh. That's why I drove around, just because I thought it was on that side. Uh huh. So it's Cy Carter. Cy Carter. We could just chalk it up to Cy Carter. Bloom who? We could just shot right ask. now. Um, I don't think Cy Carter is here. I don't think anyone is here. Wow. Bl of... Blaming the lot. Wow. Oh, this no. guy. Oh, nobody wow. is here. Oh, 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 Any other MCs you want to blame? Want to pick one? Go ahead. Me, me next. Me yeah, next, yeah. please. Can you say Bondi uh, boys? Because I love really that. Know what no, do no, the BBMC, no. Let's I go. don't. Who are you guys? I don't even recognize any of y'all. Yeah. What guys? You just who us? What guys? Bloom? The workers down here on Cum Street. That, that time to wake these... up, Bloom. Uh. It, like, like in what way? Why are you standing in an empty? Is this a empty... bad dream? It's not a dream. It's very much a real blue. Yeah, but it's very real that I don't see anything here, and that I I should just leave. Yeah, I should just leave. I feel like that's a good you idea. Checked the call. You found nothing. Hey, I. Uh... You went on your way. All right, I'm. You can you can do me a do, oh, do me a favor. The... It's camera. The what? I'm sorry. Your camera. Yeah. You you want the camera? There you yeah, go. Give me your fucking camera. Make sure you didn't fucking take the yeah. uh, SD no. card out. No, I. You, you can you can check me for an SD card. I'm just letting you. You know what, guys? I have a feeling this will go bad. You really want me to touch my radio right now? No. Okay. Hey, Boom, you, anyway. you got you got your money money on you? Anyway. Yeah, yeah, you're leaving. Uh, I got six hundred and sixty-nine dollars. Oh, oh, oh you, you gave that to me? Thanks, Bloom. Come on down. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm giving it to nobody. I'm yep. just gonna walk over 48. here. Forty-eight. And... Thank you. He dropped it. Oops. Hey, you dropped it. That's crazy. Oh, that's Thanks, crazy. bud. Happy oh, birthday. Guys, I just found 600 bucks. Crazy. All right, guys. Wow. All right, wow. nobody. I'm going to leave. Empty, <laughs> empty plan. Bye. All right, goodbye. Sorry, I think I missed out on three zeros there. I fucking hate the books. Don't we all? I think we all fucking do, brother. Mm -hmm. And we're going to have some company in a second if he doesn't actually touch his radio. Oh, I welcome it. I will. So I would I welcome it. You know what this means behind us right here? You know what that yeah, is? Yeah, this turf, baby. Home turf, Let's go. <laughs> Does anyone have, like, an extra body armor on them? There it is. Oh. 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 Coming in. Oh. Hey, yo, what radio are we on today? Drop it, uh, <laughs> you know, like, a, a body armor so we can do it, like, mid-fight you know mid shit. 40 versus 40? God damn. We're just talking. I don't know what, what their deal is. We're just they, talking. Are they going to come oh, down here? Oh, okay. What are they going to do? Come in? There we go. Okay. What are they going to do? Arrest <laughs> us? <laughs> one by one, walk down the staircase. Make it easy for us. I'll probably just fall off. They're going to take one look down these stairs and shit themselves. This location was chosen for a specific reason. 
You what? Hey, hey, hey. They're not gonna come down here. Um, no. Ah, once Bloom tells them what's down here. Yeah, I don't think. All right, Just check I your pockets. Make sure you're ready, guys. <laughs> I, th I sure think sh was. Ship Three is pretty reckless, I but I don't think they're dumb. I will reach reach out to a couple of people um, about those many many of new fests, and I um, will let you guys know. Right? Appreciate you. All right. All right. Good luck, everybody. Let's hope that nobody gets the nines through this, but let's keep the heat on PDM. Fuck them. Fuck them. Yep. I agreed. Fuck them. Fuck me and fuck PDM. Fuck they are I coming. Mean, let's be fucking honest here. If, if, they, if they give us all the fucking nines, how do they want to fucking do that? They, the fucking court um, system can't oh. handle their uh, cases any, any fucking way. And if they put another hundred on them top. <laughs> I mean, I mean didn't the happen. fucking like inmates just take over the prison not too long ago? Oh, easy. Crap. Yeah, and then <laughs> surrender the next day, which I thought was a little odd. Oh, wait, really? Yeah, someone that agreed that choice either. Yeah, yeah they fucking they fought for that shit, wiped them, and then the next day we're like, okay, bye. Surrender that. I really, I don't get why, 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 why fight to protect your home and then hand it over to someone? Yeah. yeah you so know man, what? If they, if they toss all of us in there, then we'll just fucking take it over at that point anyway. So. And that become our new turf. <laughs> they don't have enough cells for all of us. True. <laughs> and them your food. You know? Just for the think of the food. They, they have can't feed us all. Speaking of, I'm starving. Alright, well, that's well, hey, that. Thank you all again right there, for coming Cole. out. I'm glad Thanks, that guys. we uh, are all together on this. Yeah, yeah thanks for setting this up. Help, help. Yeah, appreciate hey, all, all your All, the, all credit up. goes to Anne for setting this up. She set this yeah, up. Yeah, thanks a lot, Anne. Thanks, Anne. Thank all you, credit for the idea goes to Sue. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Credit for the credit for the spot. All right, for the well, we'll see you guys soon. Yeah, thank you for hosting, Anne. I appreciate it. All right, yeah, absolutely. Later. Is this going to be like an awkward thing where one group rocks up to do something and we're just awkwardly staring at each other? We're all going to be mindful of the cops, We're all saying bye and we're all walking the same way. Don't worry, I'm going to fall down the stairs. Of course, you were the only this one level did, of the parking lot too, man. A single file line. Oh my god, I see dead people. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, Bonded boys, let's not fall off. All right, I know it's coming uh -oh. from me. I, I know that's coming from me. All right, it's coming from me. <laughs> just, just look through your eyes, you know. Make sure to keep your guns out uh, in your hands, guys. Yep. Oh my god. We're like Conga lines. We're like fucking lemmings right now. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta run and crouch quickly, you'll be fine. Surely this is safe. Push and chop. Push and chop. Escalator. <laughs> this is a very right, MC guys, exit. Oh my god. You're pushing me forward to like... Yeah, I need my turn to use the Xbox. Move Hopefully away. Hopefully someone didn't lose 20 no, no, grand. I'm stuck! I can't stop! Do you see the line? I can't go through! Are you crouching? Oh, yes! Colin's causing a fucking scene. I'm sorry! Colin. <laughs> oh, I'm good. This is old age. Can't do it. Bro, like I, like, I'm just the guy... Bend the knees. I'm just the, the guy knees, holding on. <laughs> 49 years young, brother. Uh, Mr. Bean fucking show. Jesse, just like try and un- Yeah, there you go. Why'd you lock your bike? I didn't, I just wanted to know which one's mine. Didn't know. Uh. All right, mount the fuck up. Let's head back to the billy. All right, to the billy dome. Yeah, let's keep it at about eighty. Same thing. Yo, pleasure as always, boys. Catch you on the next one. That's it, guys. Yeah. Alright, I guess, um...
Tomorrow we're bombing the BDM. BDM here on your weekends. <laughs> we about to have six fucking squads of six hunting for him at all times. We're all Jesus. hunting for a bunch of sims, man. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> The message, I don't know what will. Uh, it's that classic, just one fucking boss's choice and everyone's fucked thing, you know? And Ivy seemed pretty on fucking board too today, so. You know what you do then? You're fucking king. It's free the subjects. Also, maybe kill some subjects. Oh, no. I mean, I don't really just get. Oh, Watch out, Colin. don't hit my bike, don't hit my bike, don't hit my bike. <laughs> instantaneous big explosion. Lucky we didn't do that in front of everyone else. I'm rolling for the Bondi Blue Vespa, dude. <laughs> Let me know if uh, you need me to teach you how to ride a bike later. Gotcha. Okay, this fucking <laughs> guy, bro. Sorry, I'm trying to see your doggo name in the top ten of the drunken room. I can't find it. Can you help me? Dude, Collins? Yeah, I know. You can't find it on there. Patriots nowhere to be seen. God, we did look really fucking good, though. I'm sorry. I don't want to be that guy, but who the... Neon Tigers. Uh, Sebastian Ableton Simsy. He started them up drunk some party shit. I mean, the question still remains. Yeah, I know. The, the, the... Yeah. Oh. If a war broke out with the wasteland instead of the Neon Tigers, I don't think anyone guys, would feel uh... the impact. You know what I mean? It's gonna be thinking about something for a hot second, then um, Finn and Ever. I need to talk to you. I need to pee real quick. I too will pee in this garage. I will watch. <laughs> no, I think that's just how they be. I don't got another set of binoculars. I need a second set. Also, we got 25 cookies, 25 bags of chips, 25 fucking soda pops. I'm gonna put them oh, in the trash bin. You guys can take all you want. Hi, Hungy. Yo! Diabetes. You park the cliffhanger in a different direction. Crackhead. I, I did so I could be reparked because it's not mine. <laughs> oh. oh, fuck. Where's my water? Fuck me out of parking spaces. Son of a bitch, cock sucking. Fucking parking! Sounds like you're a little annoyed there. Why can't we have more than fucking red fucking red fucking red fucking? Have you thought about injury okay. management? <laughs> hey. I need a lot more than anger management. <laughs> There's a lot more fucked up shit with me than just anger issues. But, look at you. He's not kidding. There is some really uh, fucked up shit I mean, with DJ. I mean, what? I, I don't know. I swear to fucking God. <laughs> There's what if we, uh, got pea shoes now. what if we just killed every <laughs> TDM employee and then just moved the BBM in? Let's okay, go. Next time I punch you, I'm using my knuckle dusters. Fuck you. <laughs> <sighs> it's only joke. Okay. Make a deal with that Neela chick. If we, if we help oh, get her back. power of a PDM, she lets us run it with BBM as well. It becomes P B B D M. The skull was in the yesterday. Oh. <sighs>
EVMPD. I like the idea of using the Puppet Master to, uh... Um... Get the boost in like that. Um... Right, uh, can you guys fuck off, Finn? Can you stay here, please? What was that? Sorry, Colin? I, I need to speak to Finn. Alright, uh, yo, go. Finn, can you come to the garage? Not Finn. <clears throat> Edward. Alright, I want you guys to kind of hash this shit out. Alright, I'll let uh, Finn go first. I don't really... Like, what do you want me to say? Like... Let me say how you were feeling about yesterday. Oh, right, yeah. Uh, when you woke up and blamed everything on me and Jesse, uh, the fact that you lost your PDM job because they decided to fuck over all MCs, yeah. That kind of pissed me no, right the fuck fine. off. Because, uh... Uh... Because... I, I, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I wrote a little notebook. Hold on. That's cute. I'm gonna I'm gonna bring up some of the things you said in that uh in that conversation. Mm -hmm. You called me a social warrior for going to the PDM protest. Mm -hmm. You said that this was not our fight. Mm -hmm. You said why not chat, even sure a motorcycle club? Chat, why should we care? Chat, chat you want to be honest? Mm -hmm. You want to know why I'm doing this? I want a little tea. I want a little spice. You made the point that we drive muscle cars <laughs> and hellions. We don't even drive motorci motorcycles. <laughs> then the you brought up that PDM was the only way that you could make money <laughs> because the bank system was fucked. And that BBM is currently fucked. We got that part. Go on. Oh, that was coming next. Um, and uh, that it was all mine and Ziggy Jesse's fault. POV. Never said that, but go on. Well, Not you, in those you words, that, anyway. You said that you lost your job because of me and Jesse. That is what you said. Never said it was all your fault. Go on. Your words? Well, I have lost my job because of you and Jesse going to the protest. That is what you said. You okay. did not Some provide a second reason with, or anything. Go on. That is what you said. Okay. And... All of those things piss me right the fuck off. I will not apologize to you for feeling this way. You have made me feel ashamed in standing up for myself, my club, and my culture against something that I think is unjust and, quite frankly, disgusting. I have this patch on my back for a reason, because I will defend this fucking club and all of the beliefs and the lifestyle that we live that come along with it. This 1% on my fucking back means I do not care about civilian jobs. Even if it means that it's my only source of income, I would, if, if I had to fucking give up Dodo because they were being bitches to the club, I'd do it in a heartbeat. I don't care. This MC on my back, the reason you said we're not even a, a motorcycle club, I don't give a fuck. Because that, uh, the, the fucking part of my lifestyle that means motorbikes and vehicles are an integral part of it means that I care about this fucking issue, and you should too. You belittle me? You don't care about my opinion most of the time. You pull rank on me a lot, which is why I don't want to fucking deal with this with you. Why I went to Colin instead of talking to you that night, because I know the way you are. I know the way you deal oh, with me. Shit. I didn't, I didn't, and okay, a lot of no, it is, no, no, uh, hit reverse. Is quite frankly, fucking... Hit, hit reverse, man, it. hit reverse. It's getting too fancy. Off with it. Not everything right. that goes wrong with you <laughs> is my fucking fault, and I'm sick and tired of it. Okay. I'm gonna start with the uh, the rank pulling thing. When was the last time I pulled rank on you? Ed, but you... No, 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 Finn, I'm asking you a question. You've made a statement, back it up. When was the last time I pulled rank on you? Um, Probably a month or two ago. It was actually longer than that, it was three months ago. And since then, we've had many talks and we've become a lot closer. The last time I, I had a potential chance to pull rank on you was when we dealt with the chopper Fuck. in Vespucci, where I told him he was free to go. He pushed his car into the water. Slash me. And what did I say to you after that, Finn? Slash me tries to put fire out. 
You said or, it was fine. I, I, I did. Pour his gasoline I said I have on. your back. Doesn't matter if you make a mistake. You're my brother in denim. I have your fucking back. Now, Finn, what did I text you last night after we had our disagreement? I regret this arc! <laughs> Call me if you need something, I'm around. Exactly. And what did I do 10 minutes after our phone call <laughs> when you me, called me and the phone suddenly died? Um, you were driving around and then you come across my body. I was dead on the ground. I was driving around to find you because the phone call cut off suddenly and all I heard was a scream. Finn, the idea that you think I pull rank on you at all anymore is fucking insane. I have been so goddamn fucking supportive of you. In the amount of times I've pulled you aside and said, are you okay? Do you need someone to talk to? Can I do anything to help you right now? And the fact that you don't see that, I'm done trying to prove myself to you. For the last three months, all I've done during this tsunami is come to you and make sure you're okay. I try and invite you on jobs. I brought you along with me so we can investigate Norman Burns' fucking lighthouse. Truth be told, I didn't need backup but I wanted to spend time with my fucking brother. Then why, do you, why did you come at me yesterday like that? Why do you, why because, did you come because at me? Because it's not even the, Finn, it's not even the loss of a job. And you would know that if you would sit down and actually take a second and realize we're fucking brothers and we can have a conversation. You came at me first. Fuck you attacked yes. me and said it was my fault. Why would I want to talk to you after that? Because the <laughs> thing is, Finn, the thing is, all I wanted I was a little respect and I got no respect out of that. All I wanted away. was a fucking heads up. Hey, Edbert, we did this. That's probably why you've lost your job. <laughs> Fine, I don't care. You know as well as I do, and I don't need to prove this to fucking anyone because I've done it tenfold. That is Bondi till I die for me. I have shed blood, I have killed people, and I will fucking do it until I'm dead. So you should know already that it's not about the job, it's the respect. The fact that my two brothers didn't even think to drop me a note, a letter, anything to let me know that that's what's going on. I feel like you don't fucking respect me, you know? and it's not about patch or prospect or anything. It's about the jacket. What's that thing? Where I don't it's think like, even if we were both prospects, you would respect me. It's like putting salt in a dish and you drop. And I have done so much in. in the last three months oh, to fuck. improve myself as a better fucking leader, to live up to the patch on my back, to be better for you, to see what I can provide to you, because you're the main prospect during these hours, and it's my fucking duty to do the best I can for you. I have tried and fucking tried and fucking tried to make you feel like you have somebody here. Because I know you struggle with that. I know with D gone, I know with what happened to Stevie, you have been on a fucking a journey and you're not doing okay. I have tried countless fucking times to prove to you that I am there and I'm done fucking trying, Finn. If you can't see that, if you can't trust that we both wear this fucking jacket for a reason, then there's no point in me fucking trying to prove that to you anymore. Because if it's not sunk in in the last three months, it won't sink in any further. Yes, I was pissed yesterday because I didn't get a common sense of decency from my own fucking brothers in denim. If something had happened to Lizzie, let's say, because I don't have a fucking uh, decent example of you in a job or something like that, I would let you know. I would, I would text you. I would call you. I would fucking email you, drop you a fucking letter in your house, whatever it might be, just to give you the heads up, just to show you a common shred of fucking respect. The fact that I didn't get that from either of you makes me feel like, oh shit, fuck Edbert, right? He doesn't even get a heads up. He's just some fucking crackhead who we don't fucking care about. I don't give a fuck about anything outside of this club, Finn. And the only reason I had an issue with what happened yesterday is because the people in the club couldn't even give me the fucking time of day to let me know what happened. I completely reject the idea that I'm fucking belittling you, that I'm pulling rank over you, because I'm the one who had to sit oh. Jesse down and say, stop fucking bullying him. He's uh, been through enough. Uh, Huh? Huh? You were just as bad? Huh? I was, Finn, three months ago. Then we had our conversation. Oh my then we God. moved past it. Then oh. Jesse tried to reignite the fucking jokes and I said no. Oh my God. Edbert. 
I will, uh, I will, I will... not as innocent as you're saying. Yeah, I will premise this, uh, real quick with, um, Edward, I don't ever want to hear you say you're, you're gonna give up on a jacket. Like, I get it, you can say I'm you're not calling. If I was, I wouldn't have gone back for him yesterday. Uh, fuck yeah. I, I wouldn't have dropped everything to save Finn. Uh, let me finish. I, I'm, I, I won't stand here and let you dismiss how Finn is feeling by saying you're done trying to help that. I won't allow that. Uh, like, clearly, clearly, there's something going on between you two, and it, it, it's hurting you both. Uh, I, I think it's important, Edward, to own up a little bit when it comes to all this, a little bit of this PDM shit, considering what you told me. And I think to completely dismiss how well, Finn can interpret it is, is a shitty fucking thing to do to your jacket. Uh, I, I think it's important to talk you like talk this out stop, stop stop shouting at each other like you're fucking like you two haven't bled for each other not just one way or the other i know right now if someone came busting in here you two would have each other's back am i wrong no of course so think of that please like it, like i said Ebert, finkin is allowed to feel this kind of shit right so it's important to hear him out instead of dismissing that shit we're all fucking brothers in this. Care about your jacket. Torque that shit out. Like when it came to the um the dungeon master shit, I uh, I was really upset with Barry. So instead of just shutting my fucking mouth, I told him. And then we obviously hashed it out here in the fucking garage and we moved on. We're we're, we're brothers through the thick of it and it's very clear that these two brothers are going through some shit. So I want I want right now neither of you are walking out of this garage until you sort this shit out. And I'm gonna make sure of it. So continue, please. What do I need to do, Finn, to prove to you that I've got your back? Just that we're brothers that can have disagreements. I just don't want everything it. to be my fault. I it's just Everything. What else have I blamed you for? Like, I'm genuinely Edward, asking. What, Edward, whatever. a week ago, we were in a bank, and you were negotiating, and you got angry at me for not holding a gun to the hostage when I'm the hacker. It's little things, all the time. It's it's always, Finn. you got upset at me, and you were like, we're having a discussion about this afterwards. I'm the hacker. I'm going to the back. What? Huh? It's it, it just feels like there's a bunch of times when something is either not my fault, explicitly an accident and it gets held against me forever oh. you still bring up to this day the fucking conversation <laughs> at grandma's which you call the I island i just wanted to blow up jest. pdm because i thought jest. it would be fun i don't find it funny yes i did tell barry you had shot me in the head twice because i think that's a little bit over the fucking top for for knocking you out of a car or bumping you with the car i do think that's a little bit over the fucking top and you will not stop bringing it up it's just annoying Everything is fucking annoying when you when, bring it when up When was the so last long. time I brought that up? Like two weeks ago! You said we're going back to the island. We would get the fucking VPN or something. I remember this shit. It's tiring. It makes me It makes me just not even... I, I, I just don't even want to try sometimes because it's so fucking tiring. It feels like I'm not getting anywhere. It feels like it, nothing is ever going to get let go. You know what happened I when honestly... I fucked up? You know, what happened? you know what happened when I fucked up during the SN war? Colin said... All right, you fucked up. That's it. That's the end of it. You know what Barry said? You fucked up. That's it. That's the end of it. You know what Edbert and Jesse say after I fuck up? They bring it up every two weeks for the next five months. That gets fucking tiring. I'm over it. Don't gaslight I... me into thinking that I can't feel these feelings. Hold I the fucking, fucking phone. Don't you just fucking said I say I'm gaslighting you. you. Just what said the fuck? I give up on you. I don't know why you're feeling this. You just said, if you're feeling this after three months, then I'm give up on you. So don't tell me you're not saying that shit. Oh, fuck, you just said How it. is that fucking gaslighting? I'm Ziggy, explaining to you how I'm feeling. Ziggy's Colin been, just you said, are, I should tell you how I'm feeling. You are negating how I'm feeling. You are negating how I'm feeling. This is what Ziggy's been feeling like, like the do. fat side three, I feel four, this. Like I, I always feel like do. shit. Okay, hold on. <sighs> Take a breath. There is no way that is a correct statement. Because I can count on my fucking hands and feet how many times I've had to sit you down and and check oh in on god. you and make sure you're oh okay. Oh my god! When have you ever done and that what, for me? And what's come of it? No, what's come uh, of it's it? a serious question, Finn. When have you ever called me and checked in on me? 
When shit happens, Ed, but you know I'm when? always fucking there for you. You have never called me. You have never texted me to check in how I am. Oh when God. Rainy died, nothing. Is that what is... I can, I can do better then. If that's what you want from me, I can do better. I can do that for you. To, to, to say that, and I understand that's how you feel, but I'm trying to tell you that it's just not the case because I can, I can prove it. The amount of times <laughs> that I've, I've, I've taken time out of my fucking day <laughs> to make sure you're okay. This Even doesn't if I think make it better. Small. That doesn't just make it better. That, that, no, just, it's, it's not about five making nice a better thing. Five nice things over the period of fucking however long doesn't make up for it. Finn, it how am I going to it. talk to you if you're going to keep overriding me? I'm trying to explain something to you. Take a breath. We're here as brothers. Colin's right. This shit needs to stop and we need to move past it. Thank I'm you. trying to give you examples of how I've tried to help you, how I've been there for you. And you keep saying, I'm not there for you and I'm not supportive. And I just, I, I, I don't know then, Finn, because I've- I didn't I, I can... say that. I didn't say you're not supportive. I never said that. I never said that. What, what I said you is then? you keep bringing things up that have happened in the past that I want to let go of. I never said you're not supportive. I know you fucking are. But then please, the island thing is 100% on me. On. I thought just I stopped it. I... On. Okay, okay. The island thing is on me. I own up to that 100%. It's right? also all That's the That's my fuck things, up. You know, it's, like it's what? not that you're not being supportive. Uh, like I said, like just like one example, the bank thing. When you've got pissy at me okay. for not holding a gun when I'm the hacker. It's like, I'm Finn. not saying you're not supportive, man. I know you're there for me a lot of the time, but it's these... It, it, it's just it's the little <laughs> negative Colin things along the, the way that add up to a lot, and I'm just really tired. If, 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 if I can explain the bank thing then, right? I was in charge of the bank. I had to go out and talk to the cops because for some reason that night I couldn't hear shit through doors. You were, you were in the bank. You were, you were, you were, hold on, let oh, me look. finish. You were done hacking. Jesse was also at fault for this and I even told Jesse that as well. I was not as done As soon hacking, as I walked actually, out, I went back there. I, 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 at that point I saw you with the hostage. That's why I called you out, and that's why I called Jesse out later as well. It's the same thing I would have seen Dundee do. It's the same thing I would have seen Barry do. When we're in that situation, it's about survival. If we don't have a gun to the hostage, we all fucking die. They storm, we all die. I have never once brought it up since then from that night. We never even had a discussion afterwards, did we? No, but in the moment, you know... So it was a heat just... of the moment thing, Finn. We're in the middle yeah, of a fucking job. It feels job. like there's a lot of those things, though. Name another one, then. Oh, my God. I'm not going to fucking go through the fucking files in my brain. I know it uh, happens. You can't invalidate that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to interject here. I'm not this... invalidating it. I'm, I'm asking for a chance to explain myself. I think this is just a case of... If you spend your time... Constantly bringing up someone's fuck-ups... Yeah, I fucked up in the club. I've made some wrong choices. I'm the one that has to remind myself of those choices, you know? I think the way that I'm kind of seeing this is Finn is just asking something pretty simple here, and it's to not really be fucking bullied, not be reminded constantly of every fuck up you've made. And I, and I, I think he's right in asking that. Am I wrong, Edward? No, 100%. That's why I just said the only thing I didn't even realize I was fucking doing it. Yeah, okay. And I'm going to make a massive conscious effort to stop it. Yeah, there we go. But... but but to be told, you know, like I'm belittling him constantly when when I'm doing the opposite of that, but I'm trying to support him, bring him up. You can do both. You can you can do both. It is possible to do to be doing both. You can be there for me at one point and then belittle me at another point. It, it's not just a 100% yes or 100% no. It's a mix, and the mix is fucking tiring. Oh yeah, uh, I'll ask you something, Edward. Do you think yeah. you should apologize? Yeah, I, I I just did. I even just said I own up to it. Because uh, to me, this is uh, this is something that's been building up for quite a hot minute, and uh, I can't have um, I can't have one of my members, any member, feeling that way. So the way that I see this is, you've got everything out in the open, right? Everything on the open. How are you both feeling? Sad. Good. Edward. Yeah, same. Good. Angry. I'm not. I'm not about to have two members boiling this shit up. Like maybe this. Maybe this happens in the middle of a fucking war, and you just start beating the shit out of each other. I can't have that. So uh, the, the way that this is gonna make me sound like a, a fucking angry dad. Um, I want you to apologize to Finn for this shit. 
I don't think I want you to say I want you to say it. No, no, I'm not innocent. I'm sorry, Ed, but no, no, no. I yeah, apologize. I'm, okay, good. Vice versa. I apologize, Finn, for for belittling you and not being there for you probably, bringing shit up from the past. Good. Um, this just seems like, and it happens a lot, a little missed communication, checking in on your boys when you think they need it, but even checking in on them when you know, just give them a call. Figure that shit out. We we walk out of this gate every fucking day, not knowing what the fuck is gonna happen. We walk out there, maybe some random gang is not feeling too fucking good about us and takes a shot on me and I'm fucking dead. Or any of you. Um when I walk out of that gate, I wanna know that. Every jacket that's behind me doesn't have any kind of resentment ever. N none of this fucking horseshit. We're all on the same page. We live our lives on the fucking verge of death every fucking day. Uh, I want you to look your jacket in the eye and be fucking proud of who that person is. Yeah, okay, a bit of riffing and a bit of fucking banter goes a long way, but... Drawing the fine line between banter and just literally criticizing and pulling someone down is... And I'm not saying that's what you're doing, Edward, but it's how it could be perceived. So, keep that mentality, boys. I, I don't... I, I want you guys to walk away from this with a more open mind, and I want you to literally just check in on each other as often as you can. Because that's, that's, that's what being a fucking Bondi boy is about, having that person's back. Not just, you know, with a gun in your hand, but checking in on them as often as you can. And I will say also in Edward's defense, in the heat of the moment, you can easily say shit that you don't mean. What, right after an SN war, uh, what is it? Chip said something on the radio that pissed me off, and I, I, sh I shot back almost fucking immediately over the radio. Because war is tense. War is, war is, there's so much pressure nonstop to like try and fucking perform. And then in the heat of the moment, you might say, you say something you, you don't fucking mean. So, I spoke to Chip yeah, I mean, right after the moment, and I just to air it all out. I know I didn't mean. I I want to say I don't. I don't mean that shit. It's heat of the moment. If if this, you know, this, using the bank as an example, if that had been brought up to me even just once, Finn, we would have had a chat about it, and it would have been sorted. But it wasn't even brought up. Yeah, I mean, if there's one straw in the hay bale, I mean, you get used to it. That's why you get, you get rid of. Get used to what though? Get rid of that I, I've, hay bale. I've, I've opened up the conversation so many times. I, I, I can't even count on my hands anymore how many times I've asked you, you know, is there anything, you know, you need help with, anything you want to talk about? If you're not bringing it up to me, Finn, I, I, I can't fix it. What? Okay, Finn, what would you like to see change here? I just don't want to... I don't know, I just don't want to be, I don't know, I just want, I, I, I don't know how to put it into words, brain small. Um, <laughs> well, hard to, hard to ask for a bit of change if you don't know what it is. I know, I know, just give me a second. Respect? I just want, I, yeah, respect and for shit to move and not get stuck on things that are clearly annoying me i mean that's all i'm asking for as well that's that's why i was annoyed yesterday i just wanted that little bit of respect just the heads up hey this Re happened respect is a two-way street boys you got to meet in the middle there and i don't yeah. i i think i can honestly say i've been trying neither of you are asking a lot here i feel like finn you sound overwhelmed Everett, you sound like you just Maybe couldn't read what was going on, and now this is all being laid on your lap. It's like, holy shit, okay. Uh, I think this is a pretty easy solution. It might take a little time. All right, just right. It's a two-way street, boys. Remember that. Okay. Ben. Okay. Alright, good. 
Anything else you boys want to get off your chest? I'm good for now, but if I have anything else, I'll come to you. Please do. Then. No, I'm okay. I'm gonna sit somewhere. Take your thing and take your time. And I don't know. Go blow cars up together, some shit. Okay. Or, or, or you could kiss. Yeah, club order, Damn kiss. Good. No, nothing wrong with that. Whoa, you cannot club order that. that. Club order, kiss each other. Yeah, how I about this? You don't want Finn, Finn and I think about oh, this. Right? Oh, it's you Bondi till I have to kiss a jacket? Okay. Well, hold on, hold on. Well, right, you kiss me then. Get well, my no, whoa, I'm a committed well, man. Whoa, whoa. On. <laughs> no, come here. No. Uh, no, let, I me, let me get a trial run of those lips. Come no. here. Come here. Stop it. Get away from me. Oh, well, uh, the, the truth of the matter is, you could walk out these gates and fucking GSF is fucking spray you down, and that's the last time you ever see each other. You know okay, what I mean? okay, okay. And what they would you say beforehand. GSF, oh. we've never had an issue with them. That was a dream, remember? Right, right. A fever dream. What the fuck are you yeah. guys talking oh, about? Oh, you weren't here oh, for that. No, oh, no. Call it doesn't know. Apparently, so apparently walk, something never happened, so never nothing happened. happened. So I don't know what the True. fuck exactly. you're talking so about. True. About anything. True. I have chocolate. I don't know. Sugar. Too much. I don't know. Yeah, it never happened. GSF stands for great social form. And oh. What? Yeah, it, we're, all, we're all in really high standing with... Anyway. Not okay. commenting on them at all. Uh, okay. All right. Colin, um, I thought about something at the big meeting, by the way. Completely different. If everyone in that little silo whatever we're gold panning while having a meeting we all would have made over a million collectively oh, fuck okay because hey, you can't sell anything anymore is marcus too yeah this is like you, you, block. It's you just so have to know fucked. people but yeah it is so i, I, um, I see that i saw someone buying mats for like five per i was like no fuck jesse you got me to buy one for 30k and i've made 10k back Oof. well i mean you were a little okay well, you went to sleep when it was booming i'll have you know all right listen this is to my defense. After you went to sleep, I finished it, right? And I managed to get 97 grand out of that pan. But you can wake up next tsunami. <laughs> okay, true, but you decided to go to sleep when you were awake. There's only an hour left in tsunami. I know, but that's still like 50k right there if you got lucky. <laughs> okay, dude. Oh, fuck. So I'm, not, I'm not gonna fuck. sit here and defend it. I might make you a cup order no more fucking gold pan and gun. <laughs> this shit's so <laughs> dumb. <laughs> it's only me and Finn has been doing it as far as I'm concerned. I just use that one thing and then I don't I haven't used it again. Oh, you made your money back at least, right? No, I have 10k. I got 10k back. Wait, you you asked you told me get the 30k one? I can't sell anything. No one's buying them. All right. Um Finn, I want you to step I want you to step out for a sec. Okay. Jesse. What's, wait, what, 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 oh shit, you gotta jump. Oh my god, you're fucking. Oh shit. I think we should talk about wait, the uh, the PDM oh. idea, by the way. Oh yeah, we got. I gotta deal with. Uh, I gotta do uh, some shit. Uh, Jesse, pretty much explain why what I'm about to do. Oh boy. All right, Ebert, listen to my man. Um, you know we're good friends, don't we? Yeah. Uh, not only that, we're uh, also pretty fucking close. Um, the problem is, my man. I know how it is to lose something. I get it. Right. And I know what you said came from a place of anger at the time. But we gotta respect the hierarchy. You know it more than I do. But uh, this isn't really... Actually, I'm gonna go pull Q. I appreciate moving forward. And I do think it's really fucking important to remember the tone. I understand anger. I understand frustration. Gonna lay some pipe. But we can't be fucking talking to higher-ups like this. Understood? Understood. Can I... Can I ask one question then? Go right ahead. In the same vein, and when Finn speaks to a higher-up, uh... A patch or whatever. Mm -hmm. Do we do punishment send as well? I mean, the enforcer's right behind you. What's the question? I'm, I'm opening it. I'm, uh, when we when we've got prospects speaking to patch members in high command, in that same tone, are we doing punishments then? Who's speaking to who in that tone? Uh, there's been a number of times where Finn's spoken to me in that tone. Uh, but this is more of a case of. I feel like that shit's been boiling up forever. That's why he might have given you that tone. At this, at that point, I feel like if he's giving you that tone all the time, Edward, you could speak to me and I'll be like, okay, I'm gonna figure out why the fuck he's giving you so much lip. Okay. I'm ready. <sighs> Out of character, I hate this, man. 
No, no kicking, no kicking. Uh, can you get Finn to bring him to Viceroy? My radio's fucked. Hey, Finn. Finn. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck! Honestly, Colin right now, after listening to that whole conversation, Chad. This, this is all I can think of after they walked after all of this. Boy, that escalated quickly. <laughs> I mean, that really got out of hand fast. Colin, can you move forward? I can't get through this door. Well, how'd that conversation go between oh them? Oh my, that literally came out of nowhere, dude. <laughs> Wait, what? Them, the, the, that aggression that they had for each other. What, what, did it get real bad? Oh yeah. I literally was like, I just want them to talk it out because it's clearly, I, th I thought they might just be annoyed about the PDM shit and they just went off. Why are you robbing him? Oh, the gun. Oh, carry on. <laughs> Don't you just... Thanks, Antonio. Yeah, they just... You know that scene in, in The Anchor Man where he's sitting at that table and he's like, boy, that escalated quickly. Oh, was it that uh, bad? Yeah, huh? it was immediately that. Because they really started going off on each other. Yeah, no, I understand that... Um... Edward said what he said in that text message in, in a heat of the moment. I get it. I, I could have looked the other way, but the truth of the matter is that's maybe why that conversation in the shit happened in the first place. Yeah. And I don't think he was talking back on the punishment. I think he tried to understand why does this not happen to Finn. Yeah, but it's like happening to me. Right. But it's a case of like, oh, uh. Fuck, hold on. Let me get my train of thought there. I feel like all I've done is talking so much this past couple of days. Um. Oh my god, chat, my brain is shutting down. <laughs> my brain just shut down. I am not. I'm staring down the video right now and I'm like, what? Just, just gonna look at my watch real quick. Uh. Oh, no, it is on 31 a.m. If he was like, Finn has been talking back to me and not respecting the patch, I'd be like, okay. And then I would go speak to Finn. And would be like, oh, it's basically because of these reasons. I, I trust I trust Edward to, you know, use his rank wisely. I, I think he still does. But if, if you, I, you, I want most patches and, you know, everyone really, if they're going to be a leader... To be level fucking headed. Yeah, I think I think this is a case. I think this is a case of why am I getting enforced and he's not. Yeah, I can understand why he feels like that way, right? Because he's higher rank and he feels like he shouldn't be getting through this. Or if he is, then Finn should as well. Um, uh, it is what it is. To me personally, uh, don't fucking disrespect me like that. Don't say things like that in that tone to me. There's a different story coming to be like, man. I really wish there was a different outcome. You know, that comes from a place of grief, I understand. But uh, for me, literally sitting in a bulldozer for two hours made him get fired. And you say it in that tone to me? Yeah, if, if, uh, if, if, um, if he I'm get that tone, I'm calling to fuck you up. Yeah, you know, if, if you give that kind of tone to any high command, I, I would beat them. Yeah, so it is what it is. If you want to be uh, resentful now, whatever, then so be it. Like, I give a flying fuck. Anyways, what, uh, what's been happening today? Any, any news on the horizon outside of the drama? No. There's only... What are you talking about? BBMC's only drama at the moment. <laughs> Come on, man. Let's get... I have no good news. I have none. Mm. Norm, the skull went missing. I saw a skull inside of the shed. Yeah, it was missing when I came. And apparently Norman took it. Gave it to Bundy. What? 
gave it to Bundy while they were uh, having like a big cop meeting. Like, uh, this crow dropped the skull off around a bunch of cops, and they were obviously like, what the fuck? This is a human-ass skull. Uh, Bundy took it and ran a bunch of tests, and it is confirmed to be your one Dundee skull. Huh. So now the entire city is going to know. No, I spoke to Bundy, and I was like, who, who knows? Basically, the Bundy bunch. Wait, um, you say Bundy bunch. Is Koya included in that? Probably. Okay, so the entire city knows. Anyway, let's continue. So it's basically a case of... Uh, then Norman got Bundy to gift the skull to Nancy. A little weird. I think it was maybe as like a warning to me maybe. Like, I can hurt this person and I will hurt this person if needs be. And then, you know, she was like, I don't want this. Like, this is not mine to have. I want to put this back in the billy. So, he's back. You're telling me Nancy got gifted the skull? Yeah. Why do I feel like that's really fucking weird? Yeah, it is really weird. If anything, it should have been you or Barry. Like, yeah, I don't know. Uh, it's, it's hard to read Norman's motives. Fucking Looney Tunes looking motherfucker. Yeah. Looks like a fucking... He's off. So, moving forward, um, have you, like, have you been able to talk to Norman at all? Like, uh, yeah, I have. You know, I went to sleep last night. Last time we saw each other was, so you're going to go and talk to him, remember? I, I don't really know what the follow-up was from that. Yeah, that's, that's something I gotta, I'm going to talk about that the entirety of the club. I need, I need Barry to be around. But I want the sauce. <laughs> What's up? Anything else you guys want to talk to me about? Oh. Uh, I uh, guess, yeah, you know, the, uh, the the skull was missing. The no. skull inside the shed. I didn't notice that. Yeah, it I know about it. Yeah, it, was about it. it was missing when I came into the Billy this morning. So obviously, I was like, what What the fuck? Like, did the jacket move it or some shit? No, it turns out Norman Bones took it. He took it and got one of his crows to drop it in front of Bundy and a bunch of cops. <sighs> Mm -hmm. And obviously Bundy and them were like, why, what the fuck, this is a human skull. So they went and ran bone tests, scrubs or whatever the fuck, and they confirmed that to be Erwin Dundee's skull. So now some cops know. And then Norman got Bundy to deliver the skull to Nancy. Uh, mind you, Antonio and Edward, when, when he says that Bundy knows, uh, you can be damn sure that the Bundy bunch yeah. knows, and that includes Cleo, so the entire city knows. So if anyone asks you, you have no idea what the fuck they're talking about. Yeah, I was there this morning. Oh, no, I'm yeah. gonna take this. Yeah, sure. Um, no. Do you guys need anything before we go to sleep? Nah, uh, you're good, brother. Alrighty. Uh, I need your right nipple. Uh, two hairs of your right arm. Uh, oh. I need a toenail and your they're left all eyeball. In, they're all in your fireplace because I've got fucking. Oh god, it looks that, like you have both your god, eyeballs. that right happened now. to me yesterday, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna oh, see some GoPro for that. I shit myself. Fuck that. <laughs> Why did it look you... like you moved backwards like this into it? Fuck that. Like, that's because I did. <laughs> he just says, hey, Antonio, run into the house as quick as you can and just run forward. But a sucker. And why you do you listen to TJ? Because I trust my jacket. Well, also learn to go. And also, yep. <laughs> also, <laughs> um, fuck the dog. Bone says he has good news for the club, but he's only gonna tell us it when there's like majority of the club awake. So never. Yeah. So. Right, good night, boys. So 07, we're never getting that. <laughs> good night, Antonio. <laughs> you're gonna hold that news until the day he dies, huh? And he's the god of death, so he never dies. Yeah, no, we'll die before we get that news gun. Fucking Overwatch 2 is going to be out before he gives us the news. What's that? Really? Come on, man. Don't do me like that. <laughs> Isn't that just like old Overwatch, but just with a 2 slapped on it? Kind of. It's kind of like the public count. Never mind. <laughs> How long have you been awake for? Um... Nine and a half hours. One and a half hours. That's not too bad. Nine and a half, I said. 
Well, how's that possible if the storm has only been up for half of that? Yeah, because it's just a storm. I don't go to sleep. I'm not sleeping. I just go inside my house and wait the storm out. You have your eyes open? Yeah. Damn, good shit. What? I feel like I'm going to be awake for a very long time tomorrow. I have this feeling. Why? Subway so sandwiches? I think so. And I fucked myself. I kind of regret it now. You know, there's a twist to it. Um, what the twist? Well, like... They get to choose, like, almost unlimited horror games for the month of October. And you're a massive bitch. Yep. Hey, Edbert. Yep. You said you had ideas about uh, PDM? Yeah. So um, is it, is it 200, 250k per car, regardless of what it is? No, no. No, so every car is, you know, it's got its own import cost, and I still have access uh, to that, so... Uh, Max Power hired me back last night because he realized Victor's been leading him astray. Victor is the one who's uh, who's hated the MCs for a very fucking long time, and I didn't know about that. That's, but Victor uh, used to be a clean guy for us. Yeah. Yeah, but Victor is getting a bit mad with fucking Power. Wait, so were Victor not being honest to you as well then, Edward? Like, he's like I, been like filling I, Max with information then. Maybe. I, I don't know anymore. What the fuck? I just... I don't know, man. That's why when I say it's nothing outside of this club, I fucking mean it. But um, I believe that. Yeah, so I'm 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 still in their fucking database. I can see everything, so I know what the import cost of things are. Yeah. And uh, we want to hit their pockets. I mean, we get a decoy, we send them down there, get them to do a test drive. That person won't be blacklisted. Have them pull out the vehicle, go for a test drive, take it to a fucking alleyway where we're all set up. We take the vehicle, we blow it up. Him doesn't get that vehicle back. I feel like I don't know why I think about it this way, but I feel like we need to email someone to see if this is okay. Oh, Colin's already done it. Okay. Yeah, no, I gotta, I gotta message, I gotta email someone and double check that shit. Yeah, yeah. I, feel I like, mean, as um, long as that's okay, then I think that's. The I think it's, way a, to I think it's a really fucking it. good idea. I didn't even think about that shit. I think it's a great idea. Well, the thing is, they don't tell you unless you work for them. They don't tell anyone oh. that their cars operate differently to how our cars work. Because, you know, it makes sense for us to to have the government help us with our cars. Because we're not a fucking giant corporation. We're individuals. We don't have 10 mil in the fucking bank to keep buying new cars. But they're a corporation. They do. But wait, if we blow up the car, it's gone? That's what I'm saying. It's <laughs> gone, gone. That's what they fucking said to me. That's why I have to get details whenever oh, I want to do test drives. That is so fucked. That is so fucked. Holy shit, that is actually fucked. Which means, yeah, if is. you do a test drive for anything that isn't one of those imports, because only the senior people can do it, you can still make a shit ton of money, as in, like, you know, money taken from them, yeah. by blowing that motherfucker up. Like, here, give me give me one sec. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to double check an import cost for a car. <laughs> Pull out the $17 million center. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> <laughs> That's the sound of me. Looking at the bank account, huh? <laughs> 17 million? Gone like that? Like a flash <laughs> Crazy. Yeah, well, it happened. Man, I need to get rid of some fucking... So, dude, this new system, Colin, where... Um, uh, you can now bid on B contracts. Fucking buying Bs for one genie each. Bro, it's... Oh, it's, oh I love it. It's not bad, eh? When they attend and getting married to each other. Okay, here we go. For instance, a Dominator GTX cost them 223k to import it. Oh. Sales price of 258, 500 before tax. That's so a lot we, of money for import. That if is. we would have pulled, yeah, their their margins are fucking razor thin. So if we were to get them to pull one out, take it for a test drive, hold someone up and blow that motherfucker Cure up. for Havoc right now. Then, uh, you know, it goes nearly a quarter of a mil out of their bank account. And that's yeah, just no, one if you guys care for that too, we might be able to get it. At least one bank would make me happy. No, uh, th yeah, you're not wrong when you're saying their margins are so fucking thin. Jesus fucking Christ, I didn't think that was that small. I've never gotten codes. I, uh, 
my other thing, and I was telling Colin about this before, and I still think it's a really fucking good idea, and makes us look really good in the MC's eyes if we can make it happen, is uh, put the pressure on Max, obviously, for a few days, and we convince him to start selling wholesale to uh, Ironhog. Ever, you heard everyone at that meeting. They're happy with Ironhog taking yeah, over. I think every MC is happy with that. I mean, it'd be nice so if, if, we... if we could get BBM involved in that as well. I mean, I love the way they were going to run it, too. Um, they'll talk Well, we don't have a precedent. Never mind. Yeah. Well, uh, it cost them about 64k to import a Cliffy. Or a Gargoyle. I can't remember. i got to double check. It cost them how much? They would have 64 to 70k to import. Okay. So if they were to sell that at, let's say, 90k to Ironhog, so they're, you know, oh yeah, they're still a business, they still don't make money or whatever. Sell that to Ironhog at 90k and Ironhog has full resale rights to do whatever the fuck they want with it. Interesting. I've already implanted the idea in Max's brain and told him, if you don't take it, you're basically going to die. <laughs> I like that. That's a good ultimatum. Yeah. Uh, that's a very, that's that's a, I told him. Yeah, that's a pretty good is, incentive. <laughs> The thing is, even if he's too chicken shit to go down there himself and he's going to hide, uh, everyone else who I've sure, talked to, okay. Isaac and Nico oh, Morales, who again? doesn't okay, agree yeah. with Max and supports <laughs> the MCs, they'll fucking die. And their blood will be on his hands. Well, you know how lame the traffic is? Well, it's just a little bit of a long conversation. But uh, I think he finally got it. So if we can harbor that, I think that'll, you know, boost us in the loss size as well. Yeah, I think it's a good idea. Yeah. I'd say, I'd, I'd, say, I'd say, yeah, like, I'll pursue that. Also, how many so, fucking members do HOA have? What the fuck was that? Bro, I, no, I knew that they were big, but I've never actually just seen them all together. Jesus. I'll, uh, I'll keep pushing that with Max. He's been trying to call me all fucking day. Yeah, go for it. So, Edward, this is the weird thing. Max called me, of all people, um, like a couple days ago. Uh, first of all, mm -hmm. I've talked to him once in my entire life. Once. Um, he was he was like trying to reason with me and I was like reason with what like I, I told him straight up like straight up I told him I have no power what's happening I don't know what's happening I don't know what the reason is I don't know who you pissed off I literally have nothing to help you with oh, that gotcha. was before we even showed up at the place and he was just like yeah but like I mean you should like you know you should try to figure out what's going on I was like I don't know what's going on like I don't know why he called me of all people but that was like before we even showed up like he yeah, was trying I to fucking so find solutions for things I can fucking give him. So I don't know. Gross. I've talked to him once. And he was like talking to me like I was his best buddy. Fucking weird. Mm. Yeah, cool. I think uh, he's got a massive ego. And uh, that came out a lot last night. And I basically called him out on it. But um, he's also a fucking scared child. Uh, I don't fucking I'm, uh, I'm going to go meet with him real quick. I'm going to change into some oh. civilian clothes. Yeah, and, do that. Uh, and uh, try and drive home this fucking thing for Einhog, and if yeah. we can get it working, then cool. Yeah, obviously you need someone with you, or is it want to be like a private thing? Huh? Say that again. You need someone with you, or do you want to be a private thing? Uh, I should be fine. Uh, I probably need some alone time anyway. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, you do, you brother. I'll uh, let you guys know how it goes. Yeah, hold it down, brother. Dude, Edward walks so weird. Uh, yeah, no, he's like he didn't wipe properly. He looks like he's happy about holding in a fart. Yeah, no, he is. It's like you don't trust your own butthole. You kind of like let it go. And you don't know if you're going to shit yourself or if it's just going to be a little warm squeeze. You know what I mean? You, you, know, you know that feeling. Yeah, that like, was me this morning. I drank so much last night. Ate a bunch of seafood, like oysters. Like, I ate like 30 yeah. oysters last night. In the middle of the night, I farted, bro. Danger zone. Y yeah, you, you kind of like, you're unsure. Even after you let it go, you kind of like, did I... Or did, no, I'm, I don't know. And there's a little fart bubble stuck, and then you're fine. Oh, dude, you know when you got like a really upset stomach, and you have like, uh -huh. like, like cramping, and you take a shit, and it's just, it's just pa instant pain relief? Oh, yes, I have IBS. I know that feeling. Oh, you have IBS? Yeah. What a pussy. What, I mean, <laughs> it's not like I had a choice, con. You probably did. Okay. Yeah, you probably, probably did, because when you were in the character creation menu, you know, and it was like, you, you're like, plus one to strength. <laughs> Get to pick all plus the positive. Plus two IBS. Yeah, plus two IBS. Uh, everyone likes a flawed character, not a perfect one. Yeah. <laughs> Your one flaw is you've got, uh, you <laughs> fart a lot? Okay. Are you sitting in a very important meeting? Yeah. 
Also, oh, apparently Rust is like self imploding. Kim has called me. I, I kind of want to see what this conversation is about. Hold on, I want to hear this. Hello, Kim. Sorry about that. It was a little bit of a meeting. What can I do for you? I might. How, how much would you need, hypothetically? Helen, are you the gap's Ten boxes? I can go and check. Give me, I don't know, five minutes Chat, and I'll let you know. I'm really like fighting the oh, urge right. to go grab my Easy unemployment job. check. Other oh, 100% at war. <laughs> Who? Listen, I, may be an I don't know. Apparently, ever said that uh, they just got out of a war and now they're in another for some reason. I, I don't hey, know. I, they're, I feel like they're constant. They literally just left the war with BSK. It's been one day and they're in another. What the fuck, Babis? What is that? What? <laughs> the fuck? That's my response. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I can remember when we walked together, sharing a love I thought would last forever. Moonlight to show the way we can follow. Waiting inside her eyes was my tomorrow. Then something changed her mind. Her kisses told me I had no loving arms to hold me. Hey, did Stevie. He did, he lose, did he lose a round? Yeah, in, I, I in think he just got State? dumped like hard. <laughs> Stevie, come over here. What happened? You, you got a vagina, right? You're a woman. I mean, yeah, what? I I have a vagina Stevie, and I'm also Stevie, a woman. Are you sure? What do you think of that yeah. that poem that uh, Babis twatted? Yeah, can you check? Oh. Wait, hold on. What does that have to do with Stevie having a vagina? Oh, because, you know, ladies love poetry and shit. Oh, right. Uh, Which one? Are we looking at the... Babis. Uh huh. Okay. Um, do you want me to do a dramatic reading of it, or do you just want me to read it in my head? I want to go. Oh no! I want a dramatic reading of it. Let's hear it. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh, Twatter needs to stop moving. Not all women have vaginas. I, can remember I know. When we walked together, my, sharing my the love I thought would last forever. Moonlight to show the way, so we can uh, so we can follow. Waiting inside her eyes was my tomorrow. Then something changed her mind. Her kisses told me I had no loving arms to hold me. Would you guys like that? That's good. Oh, that's good. Thank you. How would you like if a man wrote you a poem? Um, I think I would throw up. Oh. Stevie doesn't like steak or any nice thing for dinner. She likes a cut off ear. I've heard this that's myself. Not, I like fancy things. I just think public declarations are a little overdone. You know? Oh, you're not. You're What's not a fancy like... thing. What? You both spoke at the same time, and my brain shut off. What's a fancy thing in your opinion? I don't know, well, like I appreciate y'all paying my helicopter rides or like going to a nice restaurant. What about a purse made out of human skin? Ugh, no, ill. No, okay, well, fair enough. I'm just checking, I'm just checking. And we end up at Vespucci Beach. Oh, and also I didn't eat the ear. I only ever ate somebody's finger, okay? What the what the what? Mickey ate no. his own ear. She ever heard his brother Ricky Roos, who was really upset about that. Hey Pez, I didn't kitty. Hmm. Well, he can eat his ear too. Nom nom. But it mm -hmm. tastes like a Tim Tam. Crunchy. Oh, crunchy. Yeah. Babis. <laughs> <laughs> Is he okay? Every, every day I wake up and then I start to break up. Lonely as a man without love. Every day I start out and then I cry my heart out. Lonely as a man without love. Um. Okay. Um. So he's going through something. He's going through a lot. You know someone's down bad when they're they're live writing poems. Yeah, like I haven't even gotten to that point, and I think I've been pretty low in my. As time. a bitch, you wrote a poem about Colin yesterday. Jesus I'm offended. <laughs> oh God. What's the poem? Uh, how you doing, Colin? Wait, whose bike is this? Oh fuck me. You want to use mine? No, it's just um. Hmm. Hold on. Is this an advance? Yeah, probably. No, it's not. Oh. What the fuck? Really? It's 152. All right. I gotta, I gotta deliver some stuff for, uh, for Rust. There's apparently in another war. More money for us. Who cares? Oh my God. Right. Rust is um, always in war. I am going to go to sleep. Uh, Stevie, I'll okay. ask that you please check in on Finn and Edward today. Thank you. 
uh, I already checked in with Finn. Uh, Edward said he didn't want to talk about it. He just needed a second. And I said, okay, but I want to talk about it later. And he said, okay. Yeah, good. Please check in on him. Thank you. Yeah, yeah make sure he has all his teeth. Already on it. Don't worry. I appreciate you. Thank you. All right, I'm going to sleep. All right, night night, Colin. Sleep well. I am... I'm sorry, Jesse. I'm actually not sorry. Oh, motherfucker got in the car. I was gonna kick him. I was gonna fucking kick him. You are a vibe, Stevie. I was gonna fucking kick him. Son of a bitch. All right, chat. I'm phasing the fuck up. Oh my god, chat. Remember when we just like boost and rob banks all day long? You remember that, chat? Dude, are we brothers? Honestly, bro, we look fucking. Okay, chat. We're gonna watch a few similar. clips and I'm gonna eat. Holy shit. We're gonna just... What the fuck? We're just gonna detox I mean, for a little bit. My you know? whole drip, for I real. What's your state ID number, huh? Uh, one, two, two, three. I'm lying. It's not that low. Yeah, um, what is it? Three, three, oh, not seven. I'm stealing your drip? I'm two, zero, two, zero, six, bitch. I'm the fucking original. I'm the OG. I'm the one, the only, Edbert Ropeburn. <laughs> Edbert? Your name is fucking Edbert? Cunt, how long have you been talking? You just figured this out? I have I have your number saved as Mr. Jester guy. I've got you saved as Jester classic guy. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, we are alike. Bro, just, this uh, is sad. Bro, we just this is dip, dude. We are different people, bro. Wait, that okay, must so be uh, By who? Of course, I'm, I'm fine. I'm the VP of. Oh, what oh the fuck? What the? Me? <laughs> 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 you look. Why? Oh, what? why did that happen? Of course, I'm, I'm fine. I'm the VP of. Oh, what oh the fuck? What the... Me! <laughs> <laughs> you literally kissed the door and fell over. Oh, you're gonna have to. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what is the timing of that? Me! Oh. Guys. Tell me if I want to kill Pez, I just go down to fucking Bunning, spend uh, like 50 bucks on a fucking mower and just do some gardening at Pez's house. Mate, a I mean, mower? Get, flower, get a little hand clipper, what are you talking no, no, no. about? You don't know which flower? You're going you're gonna to cut one flower at a time I individually? Know which flower it is. You said a white one. Can you, can you make it's a specific trolls? flower? Yeah, he showed it. Yeah, yeah mow the whole trolls. fucking lawn. You're done. Easy. Oh, shit. Must have something. Um, fuck, fucking hell, I know what I should have done in those meetings well. It's Colin. Oh, he's. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Why is Bl um, this is me, me bloody pez out. <laughs> a blood pez out. <laughs> there he goes. Hold on. Sorry, pez. There you gotta do goes. this. Uh. Oh. 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 <laughs> the plan was, is that Dundee was never gonna get shot, and then Baz is like. Pfft. Fuck that. Fuck that, bro. Damn I'm right. Like, okay. I did not predict this story outcome. This was a, it's like my entire arc was based on them not shooting me and then fucking unexpected plot twist. So when he shot me, I'm thinking, what the fuck do I do now? Because the whole gist is that if I were to be shot, I died. Ha 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 ha. Matt, look, uh, look, uh, dude, dude, I love Whippy. I love him so much, but you created a club that literally, if you aren't a Bondi boy, we fucking kill you. <laughs> that is all our good. <laughs> it's based on not getting shot. <laughs> Oh, I love that guy. I love that guy. 
So I guess I have to live up to the to the arc that I I say, bro. Hey, look, I guess the perma edition came true. Yeah. What happened, Philly? He's gonna fucking kill me and throw it all the way. And why am I actually anxious? I feel like I'm literally not this pair, not this pair, no. What? Oh my god! Not this pair. Why does he not like this pier? Oh thank God, it's just to the left of it. World of difference. Definitely not where 2.0 BBMC fucking fractured and died. Oh fuck. <laughs> Fucking I'd hate myself if it happened again. He uses my old he, he uses the music that I used to use. Uh you know I I gar I know exactly what this motherfucker does whenever he wants mood mood music. I know exactly what he does. He goes on YouTube, types in scary background music. And he clicks this motherfucking video right here. Oh my. Because <laughs> <laughs> this is the exact music that I used to use it's, it's on not Norman. Wrong. Do a fucking T as well. Fading away right after I sent a text. I'm definitely I'm fading feeling. you away. Ah! Oh shit, you really weren't feeling well, were you? <laughs> Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Are there any other clips you want to throw in chat? Feel free. Sweet dreams. Um, talk with TJ first. Uh, oh shit! Oh sorry, the clip key's not open. Ah, oh, god, dramatic. Put him in again. Ah. Why can't everyone just be as emotionally stunted as I am, IRL? <laughs> Why can't everyone just be a fucking robot? Actually, say why no. is that? Come on. It takes more effort to role play. It, you know what it is? It, you know what's fucked? Is it takes more effort to role play Barry because I have to give <laughs> I have to the give games. him more emotion so you guys don't think I'm a fucking psycho. <laughs> <laughs> I have to like, you know. Okay, that being said though, if you know, if this happened to be IRL, I'd probably be upset. I would die, obviously. <laughs> I think so, yeah. Hey, we're not even gonna let him in this. All right, BBMC is finally here. Ooh. Damn. Lots of blue, lots of blue. Pride can't even come. Guess he could be guard for duty. Stay down there with him. I, was I wrong? I wasn't wrong. I immediately fell off. Come on down. Go on down. Special guest. Come on, Bloom. Um, How about you extend those status checks to like no, 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 seven no, minutes? Come on. How'd you think? You're not a guest. Uh, hey guys, Special I just. in the area. Uh, you must have wanted to come. No, I got told. To, uh, no, come on, man. I, I wonder if he actually got pinged. Damn. One eye McKinley? I mean, it's. it's kind of, wait, that's actually kind of true to character. Because his left eye is blind. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so he gets a fucking see. <laughs> Dude, plus one? Plus one? <laughs> you didn't even know it? <laughs>
Neither did I. Natural, natural role player chat. <laughs> Holy. We could just and do then the. You have the gun back to me, even though I kidnapped you. We could just do the junior right, special and just shoot, shoot hubcap and just jump off the water <laughs> and then disappear ah, and never be nice. seen again. Like, <laughs> we'll do the junior special chat. We'll just shoot hubcap and do. You and you, I gave you a gun no. and then you gave it, you gave it back to me. Because I knew you wouldn't shoot me, D. Oh, uh, chat. I'm gonna be honest. Hearing hearing Dundee's voice immediately makes me like miss him. I can't. If I shoot TJ, no, sorry. If I shoot. Hubcap, I feel like something fuck's gonna happen to TJ. And I know TJ isn't scared to fucking perma. And I fucking love hanging out with fucking Doc. And I really don't <laughs> want TJ. Like, that's like OCs. I don't want nothing to happen to TJ. Oh, I shouldn't have heard that. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> He's I shouldn't a, have heard that. He's such a f <gasps> no. Be my head one sec, and then. Do you know who last night tweeted out at Norman and said Norman Bones, you pussy? Do you know who tweeted that? <laughs> do you? Do you know? <laughs> um. So Brad, I was talking it. to someone who knows. Um, someone that was his biggest fanboy about a year ago. He met him on Dean's World Pier, and the guy was driving a taxi and trying to murder people. Uh, this was Norman Bones, was driving a taxi and trying to murder people or some shit like that. Oh, you're not and even... You're, I thought you were joking. I thought you were joking. I'm not joking. <laughs> oh my he god. Wait, you're being serious? Driver. I thought you were just Why doing not? really good sarcasm. I was like, oh my god. No, I'm yeah, really I'm serious right now. He was <laughs> driving a taxi and trying to murder people about oh, a year wow. ago. God, Wait, you're talking about Norman so, the taxi Norman driver? Norman is also a, no, like, a taxi driver. Yes. Norman Bones. I thought this was like really old stuff that I'd forgotten. Yeah. Well, yeah. no, then. because it was this storm. So I don't know if the really old uh, stuff is still, uh, but at this big. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, I've never seen that clip. Oh, God. Oh. They're, they're trying to chase everyone. That was a weird kid. <laughs> it looks like he lost him. Did you lose him? Jesus Christ. Any more still into the back? There was a lost MC they member with a, the with a gun Meteor. on his... Yeah, stop at the LSPD! Go! Oh my god! <laughs> what the? Now that's terrorism. Why? You're under arrest! <laughs> I'm good. At this point in time, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you do or say will be used against you in the court of law. What? You just... have the right to an attorney. If you can afford one, one will be pointing you by the stomach. What to the just back. happened? There was a lost MC you member with a, a gun. Meteor! Get yeah, oh. stop at the LSPD! <laughs> Go! Oh, my... oh Meteor. Uh... Lane. Ow! Oh, you're, like, you're like having the worst time back there, bro. You just gotta drive to the checkpoint. So let's do a backflip. How do you do a backflip? Don't oh, go near that rock. That rock fuck, fucked me last time. I'm trying to get my favorite bangers on. Bro, there's cops. Bro. Fucking six cops for this. Stop being a fucking idiot. You can do It's literally oh, a tutorial no. mission. It's a, it's a tutorial mission. How are you fucking up a tutorial I'm, I'm mission? I'm literally ahead of you. I don't even know where you are. I haven't even seen you. Uh, where, where the fuck are you, huh? I just jumped over a fucking water What bowl. is that excel- Fucking up a tutorial I'm, I'm mission. I'm literally ahead Chat, it looks like he's barely going quick at all. And he literally- I haven't even seen you. Uh, where, where the fuck are you, huh? I just jumped over a fucking water bowl. Oh, so what is this character, bro? Are these? Uh. Oh, you- <laughs> Let me on your bike! Let me on your bike! It's gonna fail! <laughs> Oh, no one yeah. else are going. Hey, uh. Oh, I don't like this. There's a new sales cost of how many hike. Whoa, I might be dead again. Oh, I might be dead again. I might be dead okay. again. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> He's actually. He's actually. Good shot. Oh, my fucking gosh, man. Oh, my fucking gosh, man. Take the venom and just lock the car. Yeah. On here. Just, just <laughs> go get him to the hospital. I'll chill. I'll stay here. 
Alright. Get your brother. I don't want to be PM anymore. Fucking hell, cunt. I don't want to be in charge. Stab. No one important. Alright, that's all I give a shit about. Yeah. Are you acting out? Oh, the whole club is going through a fucking. <laughs> Just move on. Uh, you, you do what you need to do to deal with. He's this dead. Uh, yeah. you. Thank you, Duck. Already seen that one. Hello. You can do it. I believe. You can. Oh. Oh no. Ah. Uh, he was so close. Name. Oh. Antonio. Go ahead. Oh my god. What a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, name. What? Ophelia. Go ahead. I'm making sure no weirdos uh, slip in. Name. Tom, who will be here soon. Jesus, sorry, these fucking <laughs> dumbasses falling off everywhere. <laughs> Finley Milton. I have more than one phone. Go ahead. You're fine. Thank you. Hello. 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 Name. Stevie. Stevie McQueen. Oh, uh, go ahead. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. Are you okay? Stop coming. Holy shit. Holy moly. Oh my god. That is that is just good fucking. Oh my god. Are you okay? Stop coming. Man, he is lucky. Holy shit. Also that motion number. Jesus is a friend of mine. <laughs> he's fine. He's got two holes in his hands. That's fine because he's uh pretty. Pretty good guy, and he died for <laughs> sin. He died for sin. Everybody. <laughs> Fucking weirdo. He never wanted to hurt anyone and was just a pawn used literally by death. The club. <laughs> <laughs> because that's actually what's just happened yeah they're just like these <laughs> cooked he's a fucking scumbag no he we did it to save they called he... him a coward they called him a coward for being afraid of dying <laughs> no shit uh... <sighs> back to the billy okay. you can ride alone son i'm riding with dad Come on, Buck. Let's get out of here. Look, I ride in the trunk. All right. Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's keep walking like this. Yeah, I'm still pissed at you, son. So is your dad, and so is Buck. They're all annoyed yeah. and upset. Angry, angry TJ. Very angry at you. Disappointed that you would talk to death. Yeah. And I said not to. Oh, fuck. I said not How to do that. Listen to his dad. He doesn't listen. Very, very upset. So, yeah, did you, no one's. Did you have a car, you fuck. You know, you know what causes true chaos? It gives someone hope that they actually have any kind of control over the situation that has fucking taken place, and then just take it away. I think that would cause a lot more chaos than you actually fulfilling any kind of deal. Would you not? I am not one for chaos. Now, while it is helpful, I just want death, very. That's it. <coughs> oh, Becky is here. Let me knock on the door. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> this is such a good clip. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Occam's has got such a, he's got such a, there's only one I can put this, he's got such a shitter's laugh. He's got, <laughs> there's a few distinct laughs on NoPixel, and I think Occam's definitely is one of them. He's just like, oh. BSK might be asking for 500k soon. I ain't do nothing. 10% to go chat. Who's that guy?
shot. No idea what you're talking about. Why has about. he got such nice lips? <laughs> 50 seconds. What the fuck? Why does he have such nice lips? Is he talking about me? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Does he A unvotes it? Mm. Mm. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know about these clips, guys. <laughs> what is hap this isn't what is this? Oh, it's a fucking... Oh. Wait, this song's DMCA as fuck. Right, well, um... <laughs> rip my career. But chat, when, Na when Nancy was told to, like, lock down in her house, she, she fucking ripped it back to her house in her friend's, like, uh, elegy or whatever, and this is what happened. <laughs> what? Hey! What the fuck? <laughs> Holy fuck! That was Nancy, and she hit one of her good friends and just absolutely rolled him. <laughs> Hello. Good evening. I've seen that one. I have to wait and find out. Is Colin considered Barry's best friend? Uh, I'd say so. I think like the relationship with D is a bit different. D is more of like family, whereas like Colin and Barry Aww. like were friends even before BBMC. Obviously, it's like different now because they're in the club or whatever, but. Yeah, I'd probably say so. Aww. Similar relationship to like Wolfie and Barry, you know? Oh. What a fucking pussy. Colin would fucking shoot <laughs> that gun. I fucking love like, Barry oh, so nice. much, dude. Ooh. Oh my god, that was such a that was such a good interaction. That is fine. Okay. I'm not disagreeing with that. <laughs> that was such a it's so hard uh, to be serious right now. <laughs> With how awkward that was. Bro. I've seen this one. If your answer is always going to be just all chaos, right? Okay. You know what's more chaotic? You know what's even more chaotic? Offering Colin a deal and saying that D will be brought back if you do this and then not fulfilling that. Maybe Norman goes to Colin and says, hey, you got to shoot Nancy and I'll bring D back. Oh, I'm gonna bring some more chaos. I'm not gonna bring D back. And now you just shot, shot Nancy. Cop this fucking L, geek. That's even more chaotic. So if you're just saying the word chaos is the answer, no. It's a it's a lesson that D taught Barry with the whole hostage thing with with uh, with uh, with Jordan. You don't negotiate with fucking. With, 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 you don't negotiate with fucking someone that's got your friend hostage. You just don't. If they want to. <laughs> Oh, fuck. You know, I listen, okay? So, 
Norman's Erwin's thing with Norman is that you know his entire purpose. Let me skip that one. Keith, you know what? I'm gonna pay you extra. Oh my god, that noise! I have never. I have never heard Kate ever make that noise. Yo, chat, you know what that sounds like? You know what that sounds like? Hold on. Oh, dude, four strength, four stam, leather belt. Ah, uh, level 18. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What? <sighs> oh, oh. <laughs> Get all. Also, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a verbal affection at you that I'm huh. very proud of you guys all doing this business stuff. Like you especially have taken to business so beautifully. Oh, I just I yeah, I just. But uh, like you found your niche. Yeah, no, I I love um, I mean I've always wanted like Vespucci to have like a bit more of a, a reason. And was happy to see me. What the so fuck? When you say that, you know, putting a hit out on someone, this is like I do this on the regular. <laughs> Um, so who is I call this him the guy? Next day. Apparently, he doesn't know anything, doesn't remember anything. And I call his girlfriend, Pond. It's like, yeah, he doesn't remember anything from the past month. So, what but before I fuck? did it, I said this was for Bundy, right? Okay, so I shot him, I said this was for Bundy, and I ended my phone call with Pond saying it was for Bundy as well. So he wanted to play some fucking chess game with me, so I put it right back to him. So he's upset about Bloom dealing drugs to Pond. And so Pond says he doesn't remember anything, so I have to jog Pond's memory so it gets back to Bloom. You see what I'm going on with this? Yeah. No, I'm so, so confused. Uh, yeah, Junior's, uh, <laughs> Junior's, Junior's a little spicy about it, so I don't want to give him a bit of distance, mate. Oh, oh, that's, that's Benji. Benji. Not Benji. Here he comes, bro. Really not Benji. No, run, not run, 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 run. I'm not listening to the cunt. Get the fuck away from Yo, Benji, skip bro. the dialogue, bro. That's a <laughs> I'm literally Cut jumping the in the water if Benji bro. comes down this road. Get these motherfuckers out of here! <laughs> I forgot that this happened. That's my boy. Oh my god. <laughs> oh damn that's kind of menacing on on her end it's <laughs> 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 unlocked yeah actually though hey, so now no one gets it You won't, you, won't, you won't kick that cop car. You won't fucking do it, you pussy. You're a fucking pussy man. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> what the hell are you fucking hooligans? Holy shit! <laughs> oh no, 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 no! I love you. Please stay safe. Love you. You, you stay safe, please. I will. You're gonna talk to Barry. Yeah. About what exactly? Uh, the, I don't know what's gonna happen. Like I really don't. There's a chance he might just fucking shoot me. Oh. Well. 
All right, I'm in a good mood, chat. That's going to make me uh sad. I'm going to watch that. Uh... Yeah. I'll Jeez. see you later, Barry. Goodbye. See you, D. <clears throat> All right, let's, let's go. And D did see Barry later, and then we shot him. <sighs> What's the moral of that story? Hello? Yo, uh, didn't know you did Sani runs, Barry. Huh? I didn't know you did Sani runs because you fucking cleaned TJ yeah. up. Man, man. Oh, you saw roll, that, TJ? That oh. out, bro. Yo, fuck you that saw guy. that on the, uh, the old screen? Oh, yeah, TJ, well, I've been yeah, telling you, this is being yeah. televised. Ah! It's being televised to the world. <laughs> you know, I mean, I'm sure a lot of other clubs have good members that we just don't see, but I'm telling you, this, this club has got some pretty unique members. All right, let's, uh, let's get... I've seen that clip. Ziggy wanting to get on Norman to cause a little bit of chaos, holding emotional torment, <laughs> killing the crow, <laughs> the highway man, Cleo dying because of her art, the PBC in absolute shambles, Dundee literally dead. <laughs> Happy birthday, Dark Wizard. <laughs> Isn't it crazy how some people are like, oh, Yo, Irwin's still alive, you know? If I buy an air fryer for chicken, can I literally just buy chicken breast and then throw it in the air fryer and it'll do it all for me? Or do I have to still, like, do I have to season it and shit like, oh, I, like that? I or does it... hate this club. <laughs> does it just... Dundee's not missing out on much, man. Just do it? Oh my god, Edbert. You're so boring as well. Ed Bird is the internet explorer of the club. Oh, what? dude. Fuck me. I, I feel so inferior next to TJ right now. I'm literally thinking like, why did I get a patch when TJ exists? Fuck. Uh, what is that? Huh? So what does that fit? Oh, great. What are you talking about? Uh, that definitely is screaming dad vibes right now. Yeah, well, I'm a dad, so... <laughs> I, I, there's something I enjoy, um... I want to be honest, chat, it's, um... It is very much not an in-character trait. Uh, for Colin to make fun of Barry's clothes. That's that's me. That is 100% me, LT Custard, being a fucking shitter. <laughs> I just, I fucking love making fun of Barry's clothes. I don't know why. I just think it's hilarious. This is fun. I'm very squishy hearted that I got invited to this chat room. Like, like this is, despite all the yelling... Wasn't this the same game where uh, I I ran up to Kate and was like, "What are you looking at, bitch?" <laughs> isn't that the same? Isn't that the same night? <laughs> you know. Yeah, yeah. Glad you're. Yep, yep. Pull it forward for now. We, uh, we'll be done in a minute. Ah! Yeah, you, um... Oh. That's... That's funny. I didn't know that. Norman looks pissed to be there. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, shit! I just killed Colin! <laughs> <laughs> I just killed Colin! <laughs> Oh, my oh, my 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 How are you the same guy that does our Excel spreadsheets? Um. Yo, I'll say it again, Chad. Ebert's a good-looking guy. I think he'd look hotter with a beard. I don't know if he can grow a beard. It doesn't look like he can, but that's my advice. Grow a beard, Ebert. Grow a beard. <sighs> that this is. <laughs> Uh -uh. That fucker knows. <laughs> Nancy's about to have her own arc. <laughs> I won't say what about, but Nancy's about to have her own situation. 
Maybe I'll catch him here. Caleb, 100 bits. BBMC team up with Pez and go after Norman. <laughs> That'll never happen. Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can say that. I can say that if anybody in the club brought that up, they'd probably get decked. Oh, fuck. I accidentally skipped that Oh, one. fucking... Fucking cunt. Oh, I got you that time. Yeah, that was... Yeah. He's going to hospital right Shadow. now! Oh my god, why is this fuck with calling me? Yes, Mr. Speedwagon! Hello, Officer Crocodile Steve. I just let you know that I'm fully cadetted now. Eh! Um, what? Wait, wait, something happened. I mean, congratulations! Happened. I'm so happy to hear! You are? Oh, I think... I knew you were. You know, I was sure the yes. one person I wanted to tell. Um, oh. I, I can't do it today because we're going to bed soon, but would you be interested in FTO for me maybe in the future? In the future, yes! Absolutely, Mr. Speedwagon, XX uh, ex -ex member of BBMC, be now becoming a cop member. Yourself? I'm just processing these no, two members from Gulag really Gang. I can't wait to take an ex-BBMC member that used to know all this vital what? information about this club that's now a fully deputised police officer. Not a problem, Mr. Speedwagon. Congratulations on joining Where's the dark the side. I knew you would understand. Yeah, I'd salute. I'm, oh, uh, I'm giving you. A, I'm using my lips to salute to you. I salute you too. Welcome to the good side. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Fuck it all. You've gone right there. This clip got linked like a. Oh shit! Very alarming. The fuck you looking at, Kate? You fucking bitch. Ah 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 ah. Oh, I see that. Chat out of out of out of context. If you didn't know that we were friends, you you would actually think this guy's a this guy's a cunt. The fuck you looking at, Kate? You fucking bitch. You know it warms it warms my heart that they invited me. It's 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 so great, custard. Fuck you at, Kate, you fucking bitch. Please forgive me, Dion. So yourself, D, you know? No one's above the... No one's above the club. Yourselves included. There's jet skis here. I'm going to take him on one of these. Like how the, the chat is saying... Please don't perma, bro. He literally got murked. Bus. Not gonna lie though, that shit was so fucking inspiring. What the fuck? He's a god tier role player. Holy shit. Finn, god tier. Actually, god tier. Maybe you should recommend him. He has him me for actually prior. like fucking invested as fuck right now. <laughs> City again. There's no locals here to fuck me. No! Who the fuck was that? Who was that? What are the odds? Are you okay? Ah, uh, uh, just the literal odds of what just transpired. But you're not dead. Now he's a pharmacist. Uh... Is TJ? Is he a pharmacist? Bro, I've seen T I've seen Doc's car. He must be fucking loaded. Bro, I know. It, it, it's Bondi. Your gut is usually never wrong. My gut. All right, chat. I um. I'm gonna watch this clip because I'm oh, curious about it. Doing laps around. Uh, doing laps around the billabong. Oh, does it go through a shit ton of alleys over and over again? Yeah, it appears to be. Ah, uh, ugh. Worst, worst track in existence. Yeah, what is this? It's terrible to chase. I wouldn't recommend. Okay. Should we just wait until they finish and then? Yeah, because just... you're gonna go through the same alleys multiple times. Wow. But why? <laughs> Can we hear it? <laughs> Has the 
Vegas bar. <laughs> I already know where this is going and I hate it. What about you, Harper? Are you the loudest at the end? Uh, uh, <laughs> My name is Eric. <laughs> you got any contracts? <gasps> Sorry, just watch another sea. A seal. Oh my god, Nancy. No, nah. Alright, that's how uh, I'm gonna get there, chat. I, uh, I'm a sleepy, sleepy man. Uh, I've been extremely fucking hold on over all day. Um, I am gonna get some sleep. I'm gonna get nice and hydrated. And, uh, we're gonna do it all again tomorrow. Barry's gonna be awake. Uh, and everything's gonna be fine. Smile. Um. Yeah. Uh, appreciate and love you. I hope you guys are enjoying the subathon so far. Uh, um, short stream equals ten and a half hours. Yes. Right, chat. Good night. Love you. Leave you. Stay safe. Stay beautiful. Wait, is Edbert is Edbert live? Actually, you know what? Let's raid Lysium because you know we crack jokes about his very kissable lips. Let's uh, let's go raid the sauce god. Uh, show him some love. I think you all know who Benji Ramos is. Oh, uh, right. Love you and leave you, chat. Stay safe. Stay beautiful. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye. I'm gonna go see behind. Bye bye. You tried too hard, Reggie. You're fucked up, bro. Okay. You're only just working this out, Benji, after how long of knowing me? Got it. Watch out for the roofs! Yeah? Thank you for the raid, because the night left, buddy. Colleen. Motherfucker. Hey, Reggie. You see yeah. the palm trees? Yeah. Anything's a dildo if you're brave enough. <laughs> and I'm fucked up. All right. Can you watch okay. your head, okay? Oh, did you just say runs? Watch your head. <laughs> Listen, you didn't hear what he just said. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, yeah. It gets to about a millime uh, millimeter. That's it. Do you have a bike? Oh, wait. Uh, that was a few days ago, C2. It happens when you care less. Ah, fuck it. I'd, li I'd rather have hair on my head than hair on my fucking chinny chin chin. You know what I mean? Casey looking youthful. <laughs> I just, I see so much RP potential right now for, um, for BBM. <laughs> yup, yup, it was already linked. Thanks for the compliment, man. You're a good looking guy too. You know, maybe we could get together sometime and be good looking together. <laughs> Thank you so much for the eight months. Bye. Hello. Actually, you know what? Would you mind sending me just some just some shavings? I'll just super glue them to my face. Good night, man. Thanks for the good RP tonight, by the way. I would I would pay good money. <laughs>